Uh... Ah! <laughs> Jeez, man. Okay, chat. This is bus. For those who don't know, is a game. Will you hold W for eight hours? Which sounds easy, right? But no, the bus slightly veers to the right. So you have to keep pressing left sometimes. And I believe in this game, Desert Bus VR, which you can play in non-VR and it is free to play, there you can join the bus. If you pull that knob and then click on this, it will put you in a multiplayer game. I don't know if you can find the, like whatever game I'm in, but I think if you just search long enough, you'll get into my bus. And if you have VR, I think you can drive around. See, look, now we're in someone else's bus. We're in someone else's bus. Oh fuck, oh fuck, they almost crashed. So this is someone else's game. Voice chat? No, that's not voice chat. I'm getting the fuck out of here though. I got my own job to do though, bro. I mean. So you guys can join my bus. What is my bus name gonna be? Chib Bus. Chib Bus. Chib? Chib Lee. Mad bus. Mad bus, man. I think this is a an accurate uh an accurate drive length from where's the two distances? Chat, this is the entire game. Do you think I'm gonna make it? Do you think I'm gonna make it? <laughs> oh man no well the problem is if we get like um if we get like three hours in i'm gonna i feel like i have to do it i think my i think my finger's gonna get tired though fuck there's no way i don't crash i also think you can't pull over or stop so i literally have to just do this the entire time oh you guys better like me You guys better like me, dude. It's just, I, literally, in my head, I was like, one, this might be kind of funny. Two, I really do feel like it's a stream of Rite of Passage, man. Jerma, I think, has done it. Joel has done it. Those are the only two that I know have done it. Guys, you're allowed to drive on the wrong side of the road. There's nothing else in the game. <laughs> it's okay. Can I use arrow keys? Nope. Nerd Cubed has done it. Yep. Did they remaster it? So this is the VR version, which I'm dis I decided not to play in VR. We don't have anyone in our bus yet, guys. Maybe we'll get maybe we'll get someone eventually. NL should play this, bro. Will this actually take eight hours? It is eight hours, yes. Unless it's eight hours unless you accidentally fall off the road. Cause then it takes you all the way back to the beginning. So What do you guys want to talk about? No, I have to commit. It would be so funny. I have to commit. It's a funny bit, bro. Is it possible to win? Yeah, you have to drive. Does any... Is there any, um... Desert Bus law Andes in chat? What's well, not really law. Where, where is the road trip? It's like Tucson to Vegas or something. Right? Or like vice versa. It's like somewhere like that. Can we have some music? Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Vegas, Nevada. 
45 miles per hour maximum speed. It takes eight hours to drive it uh, if you do it right. Uh, and there's a little bit of a pull to the right. It's not glamorous, it's not pretty, it's not exciting. It's real. And we put this out, and uh, I think a bug hits the windshield at one point, like four hours in. We just drive, and it pulls to the right. And if you go off the road, it just overheats, and then you get towed back in real time. And you get one point for doing an eight-hour shift. So mind-numbingly real. I should also point out that you can open and close the door of the bus, but no one's in any of the bus stops. You can't get on. No! no one gets on. No one gets off. You just drive the bus. Um, so Randy Pitchford at Gearbox. Well, first Who the all, fuck's in my bus, bus bro? Never came out. It uh, was created but never distributed. That's right. Never came out. I Who is that? Put out desert bus. They're looking back like there's a there's a man that's not real in the back. So how is it possible that it is a known entity being recreated? Are they copying me? Well, let me tell you. This is gonna be our entertainment for eight hours, chat. But, uh, <laughs> it came out. <laughs> Oh, guys, this is awesome. I can see you. I can see you in the mirror. Oh. Maybe I'll leave it. Maybe I'm harassing them. They're obviously a bit shy, you know? Oh, fuck. Wait, now I'm scared. No, I'm scared, bro. Why are they not? Why are they not looking away? Wait. <laughs> oh! We almost lost all our progress right then, guys. Ten minutes in. Holy shit, dude. Can you turn right? That's good. Nah, I'm kidding. My sub is gone. It's okay. Life still goes on. Can the passengers do anything? I think if they have VR, they can walk around the bus, maybe? What do the numbers mean? I- OH! <laughs> I think that means how many miles in we are. They're probably having as much fun as me, man. That's minutes? Oh, is that minutes? What- okay, that- is that miles? Are we four miles in? This bus sucks shit, bro. It can only fucking go 45 miles an hour? Tooth man, they even give sub? May I have your attention, please? Well, the real McDonald's sunbat, Big Mac. Can you can you buy VR so you can come walk up to the front of the bus, please? Tooth man, thank you for the gifts with the plush. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Sweet, sweet. Cheeseburger. Let me in, I have VR. So if you download the game, in the menu on the right, there's a red box, and if you crank on it, I think it puts you in a random game, and one of those random games could be mine. I think is the thing. I'm gonna be asking you guys to do a lot for me during this, if I do commit to the full eight hours, because uh, I can't tab out. If I press, if I try to tab out, it just drags my mouse back into the game. So like, I am kind of just... I don't even think I can go piss. I was watching Vinesauce Joel, Vog Skeletor, do this. And uh, one of the things during his stream is he couldn't pee. He couldn't go to pee for the entire time. Can I hit escape? Nope. You cannot. Guys, this might be the peeing in stream bottle. I can't- I mean, this might be peeing in the bottle stream. This might be the stream I have to piss in a bottle. Oh, fuck, we have two passengers, bro! Now the person in the middle is gonna be freaking out. They can't hide from anyone, dude.
Do you still have the Mancala board? No, I could piss in the Mancala board. I still have it. Mm. I'm in. Okay, now the real question is who's going to sit in the bus for the entire eight hours? Chip, have you ever been on an eight hour road trip IRL? I've not. The longest road trip I've ever been on is probably like two hours, honestly. This is the perfect stream to ask Chibli questions, dude. Do you still have the Lego White House? I do, and uh, on Christmas Day, when my family visited, I showed it to my niece and nephew, and they laughed at it and started taking it apart. What have I eaten today? Nothing. Last night, I had some wraps, and then I also had two Laughing Cow cheeses, but not the Laughing Cow brand. The, the, the grocery store's brand, because they're like a dollar cheaper. Hello, Coco Gollum. You're gonna pass out, not eating for eight hours? No, I'll be fine. What happens if you get hungry? <clears throat> I might be able to, to figure something out. Do you have stereo audio? I do! I fixed my audio. Look, left ear, big left ear audio. Right ear, big right ear audio. Uh, the way I fixed it is I started running my headphone cable through my computer instead of through my interface. What is the difference between an audio interface and an audio mixer, guys? Like, is a Steinberg UR22C an interface or a mixer? How real are your face reveal plans? Okay. Let's talk about it, guys. I'm gonna have to drag this conversation out as long as I can, because we're gonna be doing a lot of fucking yapping, dude. If I do for some reason go to the streamer award for if I got nominated big if and or big I in that hypothetical situation think i would just do it and like just be on camera and then to go back to being not on camera you guys get one peek i think i would just do it and then i would just ne never do it again <laughs> did you get nominated i hacked the website I do have some pretty big vouchers. I'm not gonna lie. I got some pretty big vouchers. We got, um, we secured the Fan Fan Rising Star vote. We secured the Ludwig Rising Star vote. We secured the Squeaks Rising Star vote. Like, we got some pretty good vouchers, man. You're gonna stop being some blue guy in my head? True! Wait, I can't ruin people's image of me. The problem is, like, if that hypothetical does happen and y'all see me at the streamer awards with sunglasses holding my hair up like a headband, don't question it. I'm covering the bald spot, bro. Okay? That's all I've got. I wear sunglasses as a headband all the time because it has to cover the bald spot. You better have a great fit. Holy shit, we got a lot of people in the bus, bro. Now, I already know what I'm gonna buy. It's a um, $10,000 suit. Just kidding. Fuck that, man. Oh, 10 miles, bro. Chat, 10 miles. I've only been doing this for 12 minutes. Oh. You know what? How I said one of my greatest fears was what if this is really like... What happens if this is record low viewership and I'm committed to it for eight hours? I'm gonna hate it. I don't need to worry about that, bro. I can't even tab out to check the viewership. Because I have to keep driving. Don't you want to face a real before you lose all your hair? No, because I think... The way I'm balding... 
if I am hypothetically hypothetically balding, I don't think I'm gonna lose all of my hair on my head, and I think I would look fine with a buzz cut. So like, he's not even balding. I'm not gonna lie. I did another. I did my monthly check in the other night. I think I'm balding. I think I am balding. Why the fuck is this bus so slow, bro? <sighs> you guys want to play a game back there? Nod your head if yes. Okay. <laughs> Whenever I turn around, you guys have to turn around too, okay? So you have to look at the back of the bus, okay? We're gonna test it. <laughs> and you all have to keep that up for the rest of the bus uh, trip, okay? The rest of the eight hours. Anytime unspoken rule if you see me turn around you have to turn around too. You have to be like hey, what the fuck is he looking at bro? Testing it right now There you go <laughs> Wait, do you know what's funny the way this game works the people in the back can't tab out either they're stuck in the bus Unless they like don't have a broken computer and mine's just fucked for some reason. Okay, guys, write this down. 14 minutes in. The first time I'm using my right hand to hold down the W key. I need a tissue. My nose is a bit runny, man. I'm tabbing out. What the fuck? Why can't I tab out? I can tab out with Windows D, but then everything minimizes. Cheetah. I'm going to get some good, strong fingers after this, I reckon. 13, 14 minute first right hand use. Thank God I'm ambidextrous. I can't find Chib's session. It is crazy that there is enough sessions on this game that like it's hard to find a particular one. It is so crazy that there's more than one person playing this. Is there anyone else streaming it? No, there's no one in the category. Like, is this what people just do to like fill their time? <laughs> Have something heavy to put on the key? No, we've got 10 fingers to go through before we before we have to resort to that. We've got 10 fingers we can cycle through before we have to resort to waiting down the key. I do... I kinda have to shit. Try, try, turn the game up. How slowly does it veer to the right? I'm tabbed out. 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 I need to tap out again. Okay, that's not bad. We got a lot of time to tab out, bro. We got a lot of time to tab out. I could probably like go make food before it would hit the right side of the road. Mad bus. <laughs> What's up, Onyx? When you're bringing out the iPad? Okay. This is a thought I had in my head. I thought this would be a perfect game to, to pull up some like, you know, song battles, uh, clip cue, shit like that. But then I also thought, am I really playing the fucking game if I'm, put, I'm, I'm pulling out an iPad? You know, if I'm being a little iPad baby, am I really committed to it? No, I'm being a fraud, dude. This is not for you guys. This is for me. This is a test of endurance. This game was tagged psychological horror on Steam. I'm testing myself. This is for me, dude. <laughs> I'm surprised he's still on the road. It's fine. We've only got seven and seven out. dude we're actually making good fucking time bro almost 20 minutes in i think it's region based y'all in the back of the bus are you from ocean everyone look at me come on guys look at me i'm talking your bus driver is talking 
Are you from Australia, New Zealand? No, no. Oh, okay. They must be from Tucson because they're going to Nevada, Las Vegas. What happens if you slide off the road for five hours? If you go off the road at all, the game ends. Can I do Simon Says? We will save the Simon Says for like an hour in at least, you know? We gotta, we really have to microdose our entertainment. Simon Says, look out the right window! Look towards me! Off the bus, get off the bus. You fucking failed. You f you fucked up. You failed. Can I sing the whole 99 bottles song? 99 bottles of beer on the ball. 99 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 98 bottles of beer on the wall. 98 bottles of beer on the wall. 98 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 98, 97 bottles of beer on the wall. 97 bottles of beer on the wall. 97 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 96 bottles of beer on the wall. 96 bottles of beer on the wall. 96 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 95 bottles of beer on the wall. 95 bottles of beer on the wall. 94 bottles of beer on the wall. 94 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 94 bottles of beer on the wall. 94 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 93 bottles of beer on the wall. 93 bottles of beer on the wall. 93 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 92 bottles of beer on the wall. 92 bottles of beer on the wall. 92 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 91 bottles of beer on the wall. 91 bottles of beer on the wall. 91 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 90 bottles of beer on the wall. 90 bottles of beer on the wall. 90 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 89 bottles of beer on the wall. Welcome back. 89 bottles of beer on the wall, 89 bottles of beer, take one down, pass it around, 87 bottles of beer, 88 bottles of beer on the wall, 88 bottles of beer on the wall, 88 bottles of beer, take one down, pass it around, 87 bottles of beer on the wall, 87 bottles of beer on the wall, 87 bottles of beer, take one down. Set up more, thank you for the 17 months. Okay, we're on 97 bottles, guys, we'll come back. The fun thing about the stream is, you know, in life, have you ever said to yourself, have you ever no no in life have you ever completed the hundred the 99 bottles of beer on the wall song no but this game gives us the opportunity to take that time to sing the entire song jow path thing with the 43 months fire early oh fire early thank you so much for the brand new prime thank you Ninety six bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety six bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. Wait. Eighty six bottles. Eighty five bottles of beer on the wall. Eighty five bottles of beer on the wall. Eighty five bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. Eighty four bottles of beer on the wall. Eighty three. Eighty three. Bo Eighty four bottles of beer on the wall. Eighty four bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 83 bottles of beer on the wall. 83 bottles of beer on the wall. 83 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 82 bottles of beer on the wall. 82 bottles of beer on the wall. 82 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 81 bottles of beer on the wall. 81 bottles of beer on the wall. 81 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 80. What number was I at? 880 bottles of beer on the wall. Seventy nine bottles of air on the wall. Seventy nine bottles of beer. <laughs> You need to start at 999 if we want to make it to Vegas. Well, no, because then after that, dude, I got some pog content planned. We can count sheep. <laughs> this game needs wheel support. Wait, that'd be so good. Yeah, we can count sheep after we finish the bottle song. <sighs> this VOD is going to go so hard later when I'm going to sleep. Yeah, I'm doing this for this, the sleeping VOD viewers. Guys, eventually in game, it does become nighttime. Isn't that exciting? There's going to be a... Wait. Oh. There's a bus. Oh, 
I haven't done very much work at all. Matter of fact, most of the work I've done on Desert Bus, he'd, he'd been here for in the room. That's what's kind of weird about it, because I'm talking about it here, and I don't know much about it, really, but there you go. Anyway, that's uh, it's Desert Bus. I want to thank you very much for coming on our program. Thanks for having me. Please, uh, if any other projects uh, you have coming up, we'd love to have you back. Thank you. I'm a big fan. Thanks a lot. I, um, I never saw you off Broadway, but I uh, bought a program off of eBay. Mm -hmm. and I, like, I like the program a lot. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Wait, is there actual music? Or is it just like a podcast? 2017. Executive summary. The district served more than 4,000 students in early childhood through grade 12. Wait, we're already 5% of the way? No shot, bro. Wait, this shit's gonna be easy, man. 79 bottles of beer on the wall, 79 bottles of beer, take one down, pass it around, 78 bottles of beer on the wall, 78 bottles of beer on the wall, 78 bottles of beer, take one down, we have to do it in person five, take one down, pass it around, 77 bottles of beer on the wall, 77 bottles of beer on the wall, 77 bottles of beer, take one down, pass it around, 76 bottles of beer on the wall, 75 bottles of beer on the wall, 75 bottles of beer, take one down, pass it around, 70 bottles of beer, 60 bottles of beer, 60 bottles of beer, 60 bottles of beer, Yo, the real Zen Koala thing for the 34 months. Can you harmonize with the rumble strip on the side of the road? Can you harmonize with the rumble strip on the side of the road? Did I? Did I? I feel like I did, bro. Kinda? Do I have to go lower or higher? My pitch is off. Let's just say you did. No, no, we have eight hours. We got to figure this out. I don't think I got good pitch, guys. In my head, I'm harmonizing. Dude, someone's gonna join the bus eventually. Turn the bus around. I got a ticket for the long way round. Three pounds of whiskey by the way. How do I join? It's called a Desert Bus VR on Steam. And when you load into the menu, there's a, a red box on the right. It will put you in a random multiplayer game, you gotta pray it's mine. I thought the smudge on the window was a smudge on my monitor. Wait, there's a smudge on the window? That one? Oh, that was on my monitor. I don't see it. Oh, Chibli! Wait, I already have my certificate, dude. I'm so surprised there's still four people in the bus, bro. Center of the screen? I can't see it. There's too many smudges on my monitor, bro. The reticle. Oh, the little reticle. Yeah, yeah, the bottom left of it. <laughs> to harmonize, I just have to do the same pitch, right? How do I do that? Oh, okay, anyone in the back of the bus that doesn't know how to leave the game in case you're uh, losing your mind, you it's this little pan flip. You see this little vacation pan flip? Uh, uh, if you're on the right side of the bus, it'll be on your right. If you're on the left, it'll be on your left. You just hold that, okay? I don't want to kidnap you. I didn't mean to. So if you ever want to get off the bus, just feel free. Yep, okay, understood. Everyone hears me. <laughs> Do 
You guys got any philosoph philosophy? How would you s explain philosophy, guys? How would you define what philosophy is to someone that doesn't know what philosophy is? Think about thinking. Because my mother said something very philosophical this morning, and I said, wow, philosophical. And she said, and explain what that means? And I went, well, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Thinking about thinking? True. Because she said, like, she's like, I wish I didn't have to buy groceries. I wish I could just take a pill that fed me. And then she was like, but then I might miss food and eating food. And I was like, hmm, very philosophical. And she's like, what? What? And I was like, well, like, uh, uh it's like, um, being wise. <laughs> Hello, Max GG's. Thirty minutes in, guys. I got a ticket for the long way round. What's up? I'm just driving my bus, bro. I'm practicing this day job shit in case I need it. In case I ever need it, I want to make sure I have on record that I can drive a bus. Two bottles of whiskey for the road, for the way. Desired behaviors and attitudes. Internal audiences. How long until your next turn? I think, um... I think, uh, there's a turn in about eight hours. I think in about eight hours there's a, there's a turn, but we don't get to play that. The game ends. We don't get to make that turn. Chad, we almost, we've made it halfway to the first hour. We just have to do this, like, th like, th th a bunch more times, bro. What's my go-to karaoke song? Fuck, I've never done karaoke. Am I, like, a piece of shit for that? I've never done karaoke, dude. I don't, I don't, I don't leave the house. And also, when I do leave the house, it's to go buy, like, beans and rice. I did a karaoke stream. Okay, my go-to karaoke song, if they had it, would be, um... Um... What's that one high school musical song? Um... Yeah, we breaking free. Yeah, we break we're soaring, we're flying. There's not a star in heaven that we can reach. Oh, yeah, 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 we bring it real. Oh, we bring it real. My aunt, I don't know the lyrics. But they have screens at karaoke, right? They have a little monitor you can look at. What the fuck you mean by me? Like number one. Okay, I'm I'm driving with my right hand again. I wanted to look at my phone. Is that allowed? Are you allowed to look at your phone if you're driving in a straight line? We're gonna rewrite the rules, bro. Dun, 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 dun. I'm sorry, flying. There's not a star in heaven that we can reach. They're trying, yeah, we're breaking free. The dancing, bro. The dancing in the back. Seventy-four balls of beer on the wall. Guys, we I have no topics already, man. How can I do an hour of just chatting while playing no games, but then when I'm in a game where there's nothing happening, I've, I can't just chat, dude. Okay, what happened yesterday that might be interesting to tell on stream? I don't know. I woke up. What did we do yesterday? Jackbox? I live streamed? I ended like I ate dinner at 2 p.m. Is that crazy? I ate my dinner at 2 p.m. Because, like, the way in my... Like, it normally... I, I normally uh, finish stream and then make dinner, but I normally finish streaming at like four or five. 
But yesterday I ended it at like two, bro. So I was like, fuck it, man. Let's just make it now. Content created. Meatball, thank you for the 41 months. Thank you so much. Would you guys like uh, the comments, the Chibli comments on the not being in the group content this morning situation? Content created. Squab, thank you for the prime. Thank you so much. Welcome. Yes. They organized it at 7, well, 6 a.m. And I was asleep. And then I woke, I got to my computer at like 9.20 and I was like, nah, I don't want to join. <laughs> nah, I just woke up, bro. I'll chill. Why am I asleep at 6 a.m.? True, I should be awake. How do I turn the music down in the game? This music? Avoid promises or granting of unprofessional advantage to others. Refrain from accepting- Does this bus only have a capacity of four people? Well, at least we all know if someone leaves. I'm watching y'all. And my game is loud as hell. I just turned it down in the uh, window settings. Can I get a bigger bus? I could start over and get a bigger bus, maybe. Are those real people behind you? I'll let them answer the question. Nah, they're not. The the one person on the li oh no, no real. They're not real people. Oh my finger's getting tired, dude. Okay, my hand is off the mouse, my finger got tired. What the fuck was that? Did we just hit a landmine, bro? What was that? Did you guys hear that or was that just me? Did I just run? Did I just hit someone? Did I just hit an armadillo? What was your routine yesterday, guys? A conversation is a two-way street, remember? Wait, I just know what I want to change on my OBS preview. You see how the chat... You, I mean, the, the, my OBS. You see how the chat has, like, a, a transparent, like, black box around it? What if I made the transparent black box fade out? So on the left, it was a transparent black box and then it faded out to the game on the right. Or maybe, whoa! Maybe I fade it up, a gradient up and then the chat if the chat also is an ingredient So we can't see no I wouldn't do the text just the box right Stay on the road grandpa I am I am Guys don't worry four hours in we'll get a bug hit our screen I cannot wait for that moment man halfway a bug is gonna hit the screen dude is there anything to look at? What is that? I can't imagine what we will be talking about in five hours. See, that's why I'm kind of excited. Like, um, where is this going to take us, bro? Where is this going to take us? Does anyone know in GTA RP if I can make a character that's got a full body cast on? The passengers are creepy? I can? I saw someone wrapped in bubble wrap? Devs can make custom models? Should I do the gl the glass bones and paper skin guy from Spongebob? <laughs> Every morning How How is it? How would he sound though? I can't do monotone, bro. Gay son or thought daughter TikTok street interviewer. Oh, that what you weren't asking me? That was what I should just do. A 
Are you ever worried your IBS will become as bad again as when you were a child? Or is it too early for real talk? No, that's a good question. I'm not really worried about it. I've been in remission for like... I don't know. A long time. Probably like 10 years. What fixed it? They put me on a new medication and it was good. A good new medication. But I learned that the medication can give you like... Schizophrenia or something. So... That better not happen, bro. And like major depression. So like if that happens, man, I'm gonna be so pissed off. You haven't pooped in 10 years? Yeah, I just stopped pooping. I was telling a story in Discord last night. Warning story about pee and blood, okay? We were talking in Discord last night, and I was telling a story about, um... I, I preface the story, I'm like, this is gonna sound fucking crazy, but I promise it's true. One time I peed blood, and to, then to fix it, I just held my pee until it went away. <laughs> like, I just held my pee for like two days, and then it wasn't- it was fixed. And that was years ago, so if something- if it was something bad... It's gone now. That's insane. Well, it worked, so is it really that crazy if it worked? It was so funny when it happened too, because it went like, and I was like, that doesn't look right. So then I like stopped and I was like, oh, oh, oh. And then my first pee back, I did it like real slowly. My first pee back was like a, like a dribble, because I was like, oh, I'm scared. What if it comes out? First pee back, bro. Never felt so good, man. Is the multiplayer in this game really only four people? Do any of you back there have VR? You do? You should set it up and you can come walk up here. You can be my co-pilot. If you set it up, if you set up your VR, you can come walk around the bus. Isn't that fun? Don't you want to do that really bad? I'm sure you'll... Ooh, I'm sure you'll give up eventually and you'll leave the bus. New rule, if you go if. Never mind. Hey, welcome back. New rule, if you go AFK, you gotta get off the bus. Play up to four friends in the bus. Passengers, new, uh, passengers can sit, wave, walk around. Yeah, I think they can only do that in VR. I think if they're in VR, you can see their hands too. My ass is not playing in VR though. Fuck that, my arms would get tired. This game copied the long drive. Didn't the original Desert Bus come out in like 19? Nineteen ninety eight? Nineteen ninety four? You know, I'm really glad that this version exists because I did not want to play the original, bro. Have you seen how dookie it looks? With Sarin flying There's not a star in heaven that we can't reach. And we're trying, yeah, we're breaking free. I tried joining a few lobbies in VR and like half of the drivers stared me down and hit my social anxiety. Oh! It's, I don't think they were doing it. I don't think they were staring at you with any ill intent. I think they've just probably, um, they're probably bored of the road and you joining was the first thing that's happened to them in like five hours. You know? Well, yeah, maybe bop, 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 bop to the top would be my karaoke song. It would maybe, it would de depend on the vibes of the karaoke room, you know? Okay, I'm taking a small sip of water because I don't want to piss.
Can the passengers hear Chip or are they just listening? I think they're just listening. They can hear this though. Web communications provide the opportunity to reach a broad public with an immediate message that can be targeted directly to their interest. Two components link the district's web communication from external audiences to internal publics. District website and social media. Social media to include Twitter. Uh, Twitter's cancelled, bro. Turn that shit off. Wait, what else can I do? Can I turn the fan on? I don't think there's anything else I can interact with, bro. In VR, the game vibrates your controllers 100% of the time. Wait, really? So you're telling me if I played this in VR, I'd have to do like a battery hot swap on my controllers at some point? I joined one and they had sirens going. What the fuck? I want sirens. What else can I touch? Someone in the back turn out to figure out how to turn on the sirens, bro. Wait, I'm kind of proud, man. We're already 45 minutes in, bro. You need to earn more points to get more stuff. No fucking shot, right? You have to finish it to unlock more shit. Do you eventually get a bus that doesn't go to the right? Ask the passengers about themselves. Okay, I'm gonna play a game. I'm gonna try to figure out which chatter is in which seat. You. I'm gonna ask you questions. You have to nod or shake your head, okay? Was that a no? You don't wanna play? Okay, you wanna play. Okay, um... Have you been subbed for more than three months? Okay, um... Have you been subbed at all? Okay, um... Do you type in chat? Okay, um... Do you type during Lethal Company? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, have you typed during this stream? Does your username start with a C? <gasps> what? No fucking way, bro. What about, um, that made it seem like I had someone in mind, but I didn't. Is your username Chipley? Fuck, man. What about, um... Okay, I was gonna say, when I started these questions, I was gonna say call 115, but they're subbed, so... Are you call 115? I think Cole's in the back. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, guys. I give up. You win. You win. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, <laughs> what is some philosophy we could get through, guys? We might be able to invent like a new philosophical fucking theory or some shit, bro. Like we might, we might honestly spawn something great into the world during this. We could come up with something beautiful, bro. Like what are some physics questions that have never been answered that we can figure out? To be or not to be? What about to A to B three C, bro? What about?
to be what about okay hang on I'm cooking here hang on what about to O to I to C bro am I to be or to be <laughs> no to be Does the does the desert bus have light pollution? Okay, I do think vehicles emit light pollution because their um, lights r radiate upwards, and then also their lights reflect off the pavement in front of them. So therefore, there's probably a decent amount of uh, light pollution coming from vehicles. And also housing. Housing has a lot of light pollution too. Like if you turn a light on in a house and it, it goes out your window, bro, light pollution. How did deserts come around? Okay, it's fucked up because it snows in the desert. Holy fuck, I had a dream I died. I had a dream I died, bro. And it fucking sucked. I had a dream I died from a big spider, dude. Because like, I don't know. Okay, this is a crazy dream. I was living in a neighborhood, right? And when I moved in, someone was like, you gotta be careful every single night when the sun sets, a bunch of dangerous animals come out and you gotta make sure not to die. And for some reason you can't go into your house. And then I, I you know, I survived the night out in the neighborhood. It was like a really classic, you know, the walking dead, you know, the walking dead in the, in the season where they're in that like um, fenced in neighborhood. And it's like real fancy like it's like a private neighborhood. Yeah. It was like that in the dream. Oh. First time in your chance and I've got to say this is some of the best content that I have ever consumed. Thank you at North. I Yo, it's the weasel you. pigeon. Thank you for the 700 bits. Thank you so much. That is like $700. I think. Thank you. Also, thank you Northern Lion. Anyway, it was like a fenced in neighborhood. It was a private neighborhood. And during the night, um, I survived, bro. I survived. I was chilling and the sun was coming up and all the park rangers were coming into the neighborhood to take out all the dangerous animals. And apparently I had a big spider on my back and um, and uh, 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 the park ranger was coming to grab it off of me, but I was chilling. I wasn't even scared. And then it was on my hand and they were grabbing it out of my hand. Oh, oh, no wait! earlier in the dream, earlier in the dream, I almost got bit by this big spider and the park ranger was like, oh, it's okay. Like, because I'm here, if it did bite you, we would have been able to fix it and you would have survived. And I was like, okay, chill. And then, okay. And then the park ranger was grabbing the big spider later on at the end of the, at the, end of the night, grabbing the spider off my hand. And like the spider grabbed onto me, bro. And I was trying to, the, the lady was saying, don't pull away, don't pull away, it will bite. But I was pulling away cause I was a little scared and it had fangs that were like seven inches long and it went straight through my finger and it like fucked me up and I was bleeding crazy bad. But in my head, I was like, I was like, oh, well the park ranger's here. And earlier she said that like, if I get bit and she's around, it'll be fine cause they can fix it. And then I died. Fucking bullshit, she lied to me. Oh, that was fucking bullshit. That was dumb. Yeah, it was a spider that had like a snake bite. I would say it was probably the spider was probably the size. It looked like a black widow and it was probably the size of like a basketball. It was really meaty and I can feel the weight of it. Like I remember the weight of the spider in my dream. Get off the bus. If you guys move your feet, if this, if you're running 45 miles per hour and then jump out of the bus, you will, uh, it won't hurt. What if it's a premonition of the future? I don't think it can be. New Zealand doesn't really have dangerous spiders. That's a mis- Everyone thinks New Zealand has a lot of dangerous bugs because Australia does, but we don't. We don't. We have like nothing, dude. I will say though, some motherfucker found a, found a dead snake behind his uh, hot tub. In Auckland, someone found a dead snake behind their hot tub and everyone was freaking out because they're like, fuck, we have snakes now, bro. But um, they like figured it out. They think a bird just had a, snee a sea snake and like dropped it. Are you the most dangerous bug in New Zealand? I'm the most dangerous um, beast. <laughs> Oh, 
I had a dream I was flirting with someone. Or did, was I cock blocking someone? Do that again. <laughs> I kind of like that. Wait, do you guys like that? What about this one? <laughs> No? Oh. Are you flirting with us? Guys, I'm not flirting with you. I'm not flirting with you. Sorry. I'm not flirting with anyone in my life. Okay? At the moment. Okay? No one. I'm off the market, bro. I'm off the market. What the heck is this game? Uh, you drive in a straight line for eight hours and at four hours in a bug hits the windscreen He's taken guys even if I was taken you guys wouldn't believe me, bro Like if I said like oh, I got to end stream to go hang out with my girlfriend chat would be like eh, I don't think so <laughs> Which is probably good it's probably good. I don't want you guys to know anything about me. It's the classic streamer thing. Like, guys, when I, this is, the, this is how this is gonna work from now on, okay? Well, actually no. No, yeah, this is how it's gonna work from now on, okay? When I end stream, I'm not gonna think about you guys. You're not gonna think about me, okay? I only exist on the monitor during lifetime. All right. Don't sit there off the stream and be like, "Ooh, who? Wait, he said he was dating someone. Who is he dating?" I'm gonna go through his um, uh, his Twitter uh replies and see if he's calling anyone hot. But then I thought about that. You know, while I was saying that, I thought about that. I'm like, oh, what was if someone like is drawing fan out of me though? Or like they're making a funny Chibli meme. Like I want them to be allowed to think about me while they're doing that. Cause like, they're gonna have to think about what the fan art's gonna look like if I'm the fan art, bro. He's dating Prezzo. I have kissed Prezzo multiple times. I love Prezzo. I love him. He's still back. Oh, we lost someone. Wait, we have an open seat on the bus, guys. We have an open seat on the bus. Oh, fuck. I didn't open the door for them. I got to open the door so someone else can get in. The Max Fetches is four. What the fuck? If we get nominated, will we get a Chibli Squeaks picture? Maybe. Oh. They have VR! They have VR! Come up here! Come up here! Come on! Come up here! Come up here! Find out how to walk! Find, maybe you probably need a really long room IRL to walk all the way up here, bro. Come here! Come here! Fuck, man. They've got their seatbelt on, bro. Oh, shit. To do a workout routine. Are you stuck down there? The, that person's nodding their head at them like, you can do it, you can do it. Oh, oh, what the fuck? We got a demon in the bus. Where did the, oh, never mind. I thought they were crawling towards me, bro. I couldn't figure out how to walk. I think you need to like actually walk IRL. So it's kind of unfortunate that they got the seat all the way back there because they're going to need a room that's like 35 feet long. Toss the paper. Can you throw, can you throw that to me? Is that something you can grab? Can you throw that to me? Fuck. Are these actual people? Yeah, yeah. I nominated Shibli for the 199 category and now he has a thousand views. I, uh, because I'm a nosy little shit, 
I did go back in Squeaks' VOD to see, uh, uh, him nominating me, you know, just because, you know, I wanted to, you know, see what Chad had to say about it, see if they wanted me to die. And someone was like, Chibli doesn't qualify, he has a thousand viewers. But, no, I think I still do qualify because it's for last year's viewership. It's for last year's average viewership, and last year my whole long year average viewership was like 490. I will be very surprised though if on this stream I did get a thousand viewers, man. I fucking doubt it, bro. I still can't look at my view account for the whole eight hours. It's gonna be a surprise. I have 865 right now. Ah! No, I'm just kidding. Whoa! Can I turn any of this shit on? This bus has nothing in it, bro. Oh, caught. Dude, they got caught. They got caught, bro. Are they free falling? Did they like fall out of their window IRL? Are they falling? An old, an old time clock, like a round wall clock. Oh, it's the fucking clock radio station, bro. No shot. Two. Three! Exactly. Just like there's three hands, there's three... I have three kids. So he said, I want you to remember... Uh, on a clock, what the hour hand does, what the minute hand does, and what the second Okay, hand the hour does. hand is... is... Okay, the mother of the family. The it wasn't put together The, exactly the minute... Right. The hand is the and dad, and the seconds is the kid. The minute hand is actually on the ear that's supposed to be for the hour hand. Ooh. So the minute hand because, takes about because 12 the, hours to make its way around the clock. The minute hand, because the minute hand uh, is on the same gear as the second hand, because the, the, because kids love playing with their dad, like a lot of kids will say, dad is my favorite, because dads tend to have more fun with their kids, right? Like, that's how, how kids perceive their parents, like, oh, dad's the fun one. But the, the mother hand, the, the hour, the mother hand is the real one fucking holding it all together, bro. The mother hand's the, the one that actually is doing all the work, like, come on. That's so that's the fucking logic behind it. A, a clock is like a family of three. A clock is like a family of three. Mothers can't have fun. Mothers can have fun. This is all about the perception of a child looking at their parents, okay? I don't know about you guys, but when I was young, I would say my dad is the fun one. Because what did my dad do? Give me like $500 one time and I was like, he's the best person in the world. Now looking back, that was a bit fucked up, okay? But I was what, five years old, six years old? I can't help it, bro. What did my dad do? Put me on his shoulders. I had the time of my life, man. But what did Mumsy do? Fed me, got me clothes, sent me to school, fucking tucked me into bed, uh, taught me life lessons. What did Dad do? Fucking one time I asked him for a BMX bike and he said no. Come on, bro. Mumsy had that shit on lock. What did what did Dad do? Dad would buy me a gift irrelevant to my interests. What would Mum do? Bought me a PS2 with Charlie's Angels and Terminator on DVD. She knew I loved Charlie's Angels, dude. What did she do? Bought me a brat stall one time because she didn't give a fuck, okay? Some mumsies be like, well, my, why does my son want a brat stall? Me, oh, to my sister, can I play with the brat stall? Mumsy was like, I'll get you a brat stall, boy. I had so much fun with that brat stall. The mother is the hour hand. The uh, the minute, uh, the father is the minute hand. The kid is the second hand. Which one was it? It was the guy with blonde hair. 
Oh, there's an open seat on the bus, guys. Give me another th theory. And he says, okay, is that all? He said, no, one more thing. When this clock was being put together, it was put together um, at an angle. So what would normally, so where the 12 is, it was put to, the motor was put in 90 degrees Ooh. Off. So, so if you put it on the, on the wall where the 12, 12 is is the top but the motor the top is facing to the towards this the nine so three o'clock the three is essentially acting as the 12 so whatever number they're pointing at you need to move over three to get to the oh, actual time yeah okay yep um so let's say if you if you're at the three okay that's actually since it goes well since it goes backwards that would actually be anything that'd be three, that'd be nine backwards you're actually looking at i suppose that would be six since six it's going backwards yeah um so you have to move everything over by six except when you get to the you know you don't subtract three twelve is essentially zero on a clock okay you go behind, you don't go, you know, what, you don't go one, you go one, or two, one, twelve, instead of zero. So it just, it loops around again. So yes, like zero, twelve, 12 is a zero. No, yeah, that actually makes sense. Twelve on a clock should be a zero, because you, it, you don't, well, then, that, well, that would fuck it up. But actually, that would make a lot more sense if all the twelves and times were zeros, right? Except the minute, right? Because then... No, that makes way more sense, bro, because on the 24 o'clock, they say midnight is just zero, zero something, right? Why did that happen? Why did a clock get to the point where we got 12s? Okay, well then, no, no, actually, yeah, because then midday is 12, because that makes sense, because on the 24 o'clock, you go from, you go from zero to 24, so then it being a 12 in the middle, makes perfect fucking sense because then if you see a 12 you know it's midday but that logic would also still work if it was a non 24 hour clock and midnight was zero zero because you could go zero zero through to 12 and then you could go 12 one well that wouldn't really work but then you could use i think context clues are very big because you know, if it said 1.35, you're gonna go, well, is it 1.35 a.m. or 1.35 p.m.? Bro, look out the window, man. Look out the fucking window. Right? I think Con people don't do um, context clues What's enough in this world. Like, and... Mine is drained, smile. Hey, hey, uh, <clears throat> a viewer sending in a question here. Hang on. Um... What is your favorite mode of transportation minus trains? I like cars and I think we need more cars on the road and I think we need more parking lots for said cars and instead of those parking lots being vertical and efficient, I think we should lay them out flat so we have more concrete in the world because concrete, you can, you know, you can grow concrete. Concrete's a renewable source. You know, you can get new concrete. You can just renew it. Or how about this solution? Every parking lot is dirt. That would actually be so fucking based, bro, if every parking lot was dirt. Because then when people don't park there anymore, you can just- it just fucking grows into trees and shit. Why don't we have more trees in parking lots? I feel like that is just more efficient. Because then, one, more trees in parking lots. Bang, looks better. Two, during summertime, um, it doesn't get as hot in the car when you're not in it. Because the sun's not beating through the window, bro. Angel, thank you for the 44 months. Uh, Pasha, thank you for the four months. Wait, what was I talking about before uh, the, the, tr the parking lots? Oh, 24 hour clocks, Tw um, context clues. I think people that, I, I, as someone who doesn't make a lot of sense all the time and definitely has a problem explaining things, if someone is talking to me, I need them to be able to catch on to context clues so easily because I'll be like, uh, blah, 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 blah. And they'll be like, what do you mean? And I'm like, I don't know how to fucking explain it, bro. Use the context clues. 
We have an open. Oh, I think the person in VR died. Oh, they're back. Hello. Hi. Did you see the Hyundai Ionic 5 in go fast on the Nurburgring? I did not. I'm over the Ionic 5 already, I'm not gonna lie. Dude, I used to, like a couple years ago, do you guys remember my era of wanting to move country? You remember that? I think I'm over that era, bro. Unless... Unless, okay, so the area used to be, I mean, the, the, the shit was, like, I want to move to, like, overseas, so I have more, because that's where all my friends live, but, I don't think I can be bothered anymore, dude, shit's hard, man, I would, if I was dating someone that lived in another country, I would consider it, because then I would have dual citizenship in the long run, which means, whatever happens, come back to New Zealand, bro. But if I'm dating someone and they live overseas and I live in New Zealand, bro, lay it out logically, man. What country is better than this probably to, to live in and get married in and raise a family in, bro? Probably the, that's not a big list, man. You got to live in like fucking Sweden or Iceland or some shit. Like, I, I would like to move overseas for like a year or two. I think that'd be fun. I think that'd be fun. Ninety Day Fiance Chip Edition. <laughs> nah, I'm okay. I already had a two week marriage. How many miles is that, guys? 50? 530? Do you, do you read the white dial on that? Or is it just the two black dials on the left? 53? Are we 53 miles in? Do you still talk to Jennifer? Sometimes. When I'm a little lonely, I will. We're fucking losing one, dude. Oh, hello! Dude, are you... It's so funny, this person's moving their head so much, but because they're in VR, it means they're moving their head IRL, bro. Like, they're like laying down and shit. Oh! Wait, can you stand up? What happens if you stand up? What happens if you stand up? <gasps> now, what happens? You're tall as fuck. What the hell? What happens if you walk? What happens if you walk? Okay, okay, okay. Now, what happens if you do a push-up? 
Can you do a push? I'm just trying to get them to work out, bro. Could you do like a dance? Could you stand up and do like a TikTok Content dance? Created. Yo, Albatross, thank you for the 16 Stop months. Request. Stop requested. I think if I stop the bus, the game ends. You can't dance. Okay, that's fair. Oh, oh, they're doing a push up. They're doing a push up, I think. Oh. Hello. We may have to get some medical attention on the bus. I believe the passenger is just paused. Oh, oh my fucking god, their head. Oh, 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 okay, they're good, they're good. These are all real people? Yeah. Bro, in the front is so scary. Okay, um, should we play, uh, can I guess who you are again? Is your username Sernold? Easy. <laughs> I knew that one. Okay, you in the middle. I'm gonna guess you. Does your username start with a C? A call one fifteen. Easy. See chat, I know what all my viewers look like my face. You in the back! You in the oh um does your username start with a C? S H I give up M T You you in the VR, I'm gonna guess you. Does your username start with C? I, is your username Chip Lee? But the mod, not me? Northern Lion. HC Justin. German 95. German 95 in the bus, y'all. German 95 is in the bus. Wait, you in the back? Does it start with O? Off the bus. Oh, okay, okay, never mind, on the bus. Wellington Walk. In Fucking Texas. hell, man! Seven. Still saying the roads, dude? Jesus! Uh, wait, this is a good test to see if I could report a, a record a podcast. What would today's topic be for the podcast? Ooh, what about, um... Did you guys see that Twitch added a new rule? Uh, where um you can't exploit Content the drops created. yo artisan partisan thank you for the 29 Mine, months yo albatross baby, again thank you so much for the 16. so they added a twitch added a new rule where you can't uh farm drops in a uh in a, when a game has drops you can't just like leave your stream on or something i don't know i'm gonna be honest they tweeted about Content it created. i didn't really get it uh 
and I don't really even need to worry about it because I've never streamed a game that has drops in my life. 24 carats, think of the prime. What's your favorite type of mattress? Memory foam, box spring. Okay, my mattress is like 20 years old and it's second hand. Is that bad? It has an imprint of where my body is, kind of, like a, like a small one. And one time, I tried to uh, flip the mattress to sleep on the other side because I was like, that's what you mean to do. But because it's, it's been on the one side for so long, the springs like poke out the bottom. So like I flipped it and I had springs stuck in my back. But it's not as bad as you think, guys, because when I move, eventually I want to get a new mattress. That's when I'm going to get one. And this mattress has a really nice quality memory foam topper on it. Okay, I paid, I paid decent money for a nice memory foam topper. So like I'm not even on the mattress bro i'm on some fucking memory foam shit and it's good am i sleeping on the bottom like um wait a mattress has a white a right way up and a wrong way up i have a topper and it's so nice wait mattresses have a correct way to go you rotate it not flip it well if it ain't broke, don't fix it, you know? Are you Chibli? Yes. I rotate mine every month. I rotate my, uh, my bed sheets. Is that something you meant to do? I rotate my bed sheets. What's up, Will? Do you guys ever uh, see people from Chibli chat and other Twitch chats? Because sometimes I'll be watching another stream and I'll see a Chibli chatter in there. Like one time I found smiley face in another chat and I've got to say they weren't smiling bro. They were just chatting dude. I was like what the fuck? What the fuck? They were just chatting man. But by in other streams, I mean like outside of like the Chibli atmosphere, you know, like like sometimes I'll be watching a stream That's like someone I don't know, you know, it's just a streamer and I'll see Chibli chatters in there sometimes I'm like, whoa What the fuck you also watch live streams on Twitch like me? What the hell? Also, sometimes I'll go to a chat and they'll have a- they'll have like a Chibli BTTV emote! Will, you're the reason I brought up this conversation, because when I raided Lost Dog, you were just in chat and I was like, whoa! Lost Dog. Remember when Squeaks thought I was fucking Australian, dude? Look! I don't have beef with Australians, but I have beef with my friends not knowing. I know he's American. I know he lives in America, bro. He's American. He doesn't know I'm a Kiwi, dude. He hates Australians. Why do, um, why do, uh, why do in RP do Australians say that they live in the WoW expansion? Are you, aren't you allowed to say that? Aren't you allowed to say Australia on no pixel or is that like against the rules? Are you not allowed to say Australia? That's a Vivek thing? Um, I do. Did you guys see the clip of the lady counting votes and she said Ramasqua and then she went Ramaswamy? Shit was so funny. Literally squeaks viewer, dude. Feel free to have a nap back there, guys. If you want. If New York, Miami, and LA, message is gone. Sorry, can't read it. Should we do a prediction? If you guys think I'll make it to the end. Where am I going? We're going to Vegas. We're going to Vegas. Or Tucson. I don't remember. Content 
it. Yo, the mouse. Thank you for the two months. Smile at New York, Miami, and LA all have different names in the Oh, GTA wait, true. Too. Because, because LA is Los Santos, right? But then what do they call? Surely in America, uh, surely in GTA, they have a name for America. What do they call America in GTA? Because, because, okay. You got, you got Liberty City. You got Vice City and Los Santos. But then they just call it America. So like, so like Australia would be Australia, but then Melbourne would be like fucking Meldove or some shit, bro. I don't know. Yo, the King in the North. Thank you for the Prime. Welcome, Chippy. Yeah, but then London exists in the G in GTA because they got they have a. Uh, they have London. Don't they have just like a GTA London? Right? So maybe, maybe countries outside of America just keep their names. Like the cities, like maybe Melbourne would just be Melbourne because it's outside of America. What is Florida called in the GTA universe? What are they calling that one? Is that... Well... What would the entirety of it be called? San Andreas? Oh, San Andreas is the entirety of California. Yeah, Vice City is Miami, but then like, what's Florida? Because I'm sure GTA 6 is going to have like a lot of Florida, right? Toasting with the 28 months? Yeah. Ouch. How am I only an hour and a half in, bro? Fuck this shit. I'm gonna crash the bus. Status update. I don't need to pee. I'm not hungry. I still do need to poop. I needed to poop before I went live. I probably should have pooped before I went live. If you crash, will you restart? If I make it... I've, if I crash, I'm done. Wait, can the person in VR do a backflip? What are you doing? Oh, no, never mind. It's okay. Are you planning on doing any GTA RP for yourself? Okay, here's my dilemma. I feel like I've left it too long. I feel like I've missed the, the boat, bro. I feel like I've missed the, uh, the bus. I've missed the train. I missed... What's the saying? Missed the train. Just say no. Well, the thing is, in my head, I have every intention to, and I really do want to. But then also in my head, I'm like, I'm shy. And also, I don't know what character I do. And then I think of a character, and then like I watch some GTA LP, and I'm like, well, that character already exists like seven times over. I can't do it for the... I can't be the eighth one to do it, dude. That's, that's scammed. And then I'm like, what well, if I like I'm playing it and then like I get scared? <laughs> Chat, we have an open. Oh, never mind. I think they're just laying down. What is that back there? Oh, oh, Jesus. Gee, holy fuck, they did a backflip, bro. Holy shit. What the fuck? How the fuck did they do that? Oh, I think they, I don't think they landed it. Oh! Oh! I think they like aren't landing on their feet though. They take a while to get back up, man. I think they're hurting themselves. Plus one RP. <laughs> Are they throwing the headset? I think so. Oh, do you think I can go AFK and get a ginger beer? Probably not, right? Can someone Google, can you stop the bus in Desert Bus? Like, if I pull over and stop and go, like, stop moving, will I get in trouble? Go really fast and hit the brakes? There isn't brakes. The bus has no brakes.
You can stop once. Apparently you can stop the bus for a couple minutes, but eventually the battery will die if left inactive for too long, at which point you will be towed. Oh fuck, only a couple minutes? I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm getting finger fatigue, dude. How do you stop? I guess you don't. I was looking at my phone. Is backseating allowed? Yeah, if you want to tell me how to play the game, that's more than that's more that's allowed. That's allowed. You should RP as a truck driver. Okay, well the character I, I dare I had is the glass bones and paper skin dude from uh the SpongeBob. But then like what would I do? Uh, <laughs> hey guys. Hey. Every morning I break my arms. Every morning I break my arms. Rama Squammy. <laughs> Vivek Rama Squammy. Day one. Day one. I okay guys this may be a loser comment that I'm about to say but it is like so true sometimes when I watch an RP stream I think about what I would do in RP if I was in this situation <laughs> and I was thinking you know that classic bit where you bite pasta to make it sound like your, your bones are snapping if I was hypothetically playing the character I just described last night they were doing an auctioning they were auctioning off dates on GTA RP and the auction was in the strip club and the people would uh, dance while people were bidding imagine if I was playing that character and while I was dancing I was doing the pasta bone snapping sound bro and it sounded like I was fucking just breaking all my bones trying to get someone to bid on me dude <laughs> That would have been funny, man! That's literally the most human being thing. Most people are like, if I was there, if I was there, I would have done this. I also thought no I'm not giving you guys that one because if I RP I want you guys to see that one unfold naturally dude RP is mostly Krungo I think RP is what you make of it you know I think if you go in like I also see every side like if I was to RP I wouldn't be I would respect the rules but I don't think I would be like a serious RP -er. but I can get the desire for serious RP the RP I like watching, and what I would do is like, pretty much just fucking around. <laughs> like Bogdan. Bogdan? Peak RP, dude. Peak RP character in my eyes. It's just fucking around. So funny. <laughs> Should I hold this for a minute and uh, quit the game? this task can I make the Ibland sound <laughs> what is happening back there what is happening back there What? 
Where did the VR person go? Can we get a hand check? Can we get a hand check? Everyone put their hands up. Oh, they're sneaking back to their seat. I see them. I see them sneaking back to their seat, dude. I don't know where their head is. I fucked my VR up. <laughs> oh no, they're broken, dude. Where are they? You know, I wish this bus would stop fucking changing gears. I wish it was just one constant hum. Is that made to like make you go crazy? Is that like a tortured, a tortured device? Okay, we were on a really good lead with the clock being a, a family of three. Where else can we go with this? What about like, um... If you... The head is out the window? Holy fuck! They're, Jesus Christ, bro! Chat, remember when I used to do 24 hour streams? I have to drive with my right hand again. My left hand, getting tired, bro. No, there was like a couple months in a row where I was doing it. I did a 24 hour stream like I think I did it like three months in a row or something, right? Or two months? I missed the old chib Okay Non non joking time. This is a serious question What is the old chib? Okay, what is the old chib and you can't say gambling cuz that guys No, no guys gamble that you made that up in your head. I never did that. I never did that. You made that up. Slurs and the C word. Okay, the, I, I need to just preface that before someone reads that and goes, Chibli's not talking about that because it's obviously an era he doesn't want to talk about. There was never an era where I was saying slurs. I just need to preface that that was not an error that I had, okay? <laughs> the female VTuber? Jennifer? The old chip would draw a woman in a wheelchair caught in a spider web. <laughs> Producer Michael? I think the React era is over, y'all. I think the React era is over. I got my business suit on, man. I'm not here to fuck around anymore. I'm here to play video games. Five by ending a few meters from my house, Chib. When I had horrible internet, oh. High school musical, Chib. Luigi Mansion, Chib. So you're telling me everyone typing that, that like the, these Chibs are the, is the Chib that they miss? Like you miss Luigi Mansion, Chib, and Balloons TD, Chib? Do you think, not to get too deep, do you think that's some of you just miss the era of the of your life around the time of that Chibli content. So when you say you miss the old Chib, you actually just subconsciously miss those times in life in general. And me was not like I wasn't tied to that at all. It was just that you enjoyed everything a bit more during that era. So you think that I am tied to that? My life is so much better now, you were just worse. <laughs> oh, fair enough. Fair enough. I think... Chibli's take on old content being viewed as more enjoyable than new content. I have to think about this one. 
I don't know. I think it's good not to hang up on the past too much, especially as a streamer, you know? I think it's important because if you do it as a streamer, you'll you'll get caught in this thing, in this trap where you never evolve your content. And I unfortunately think as a streamer, you do need to evolve your content a lot or like at least something about it. Hence why I'm playing an eight hour game where you press nothing but W. Holding his cock, thank you for the gift sub. You press W, yeah, I've been holding W for an hour and 38 minutes. Guys, we're almost halfway. Oh fuck, they're getting closer, dude. Holy shit, they're getting closer, man. Content Toilet eel, created. thank you so much for the 17 months. Toilet eel. Can we pull over? I need to pee pee down naked. Uh, I can slow down and you can try jump out. Jump out, jump out, jump out, jump out, jump out, jump out. Oh, they went back to this seat. Isn't it eight hours? Okay, let's do some basic maths, okay? Two hours is half of four hours, and then four hours is half of eight hours. Motherfucker, what is eight minus six? Two? I don't fucking get how this bullshit... How the fuck is... How the fuck is five minus nine four? What? How is one minus nine eight? Everyone's question marking me, but listen, okay? I was playing Voices of the Void the other day, all right? There was a simple maths equation, right? You know, five minus six, okay? In my head, I was like, bro, zero. What do you mean? Zero. Everyone in chat, you're a fucking idiot. I would kill you if I was given the opportunity. If you, if you like, were a fly in my room, I would swat the fuck out of you with a fly swatter and I'd kill you. That's what my chat was saying to me, okay? And then, what this, someone was like, oh, absolute value. This this thing called absolute values. And I'm like, what the fuck is that? And then I was like, you don't know? Stupid. Stupid. I wish you were two flies. And I wish I had two fly swatters. Get your ass. And then... I consulted with my friends the following day. I said, does this make sense? And they're like, nah. Absolute values are irrelevant. When do you- have you ever used an absolute value in your life? It, is, it has no practical use at all. He has friends in chat, is this true? One in chat if you're my friend, right guys? If you are minusing more than the number, it is z minus or zero, dude. Absolute values are absolutely bullshit. What is a real world practical useful scenario where an absolute value needs to be used like if i'm fucking at the grocery store and for some reason the three dollar apples are five dollars off bro those are free apples man they're not gonna make me pick two dollars for the five dollar apples bro speed of something reverse isn't negative speed so if I'm driving 30 kilometers an hour and then I am minusing my and I'm reducing my speed by 50 kilometers an hour, I'm going 20 kilometers an hour, not minus 20 kilometers an hour. You're reversing? Yeah, so I would be going minus 20 kilometers an hour, bro. 
because I'm going backwards. <laughs> Fuck, it does make sense, doesn't it? It does. You are going 20 kilometers an hour, but, but the other way. Wait, is that what it means? Is it just means the other way? So it only has one practical use, and that's speed. So if I... Drop. Well, no, that doesn't make sense. If I bounce a ball, say I have a ball and it's five meters in the sky and I drop it and it, dr go it drops at a meter a second. Mine is. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm stressing myself out. Dude, when I was a kid, I got scammed uh, for bouncy balls. I had a friend. We would play handball, uh, four court handball. We it's a, a jack, a, a jack, a queen, a king, and like a tan, I think. And you'd all stand, and the king would be in the top right position. The queen would be in the top left, and then jack in the bottom left, and then the other one would be in the in the bottom right. And then we would bounce the ball, and if it double bounced, or if you missed a ball, you got out, right? And then you'd all rotate. So say, for example, if you were the queen and you got out, the jack would take your spot, and then the ten would move up, and then you'd go into the ten spot, you see? And then the thing was that you wanted to get into the king spot, and the king always served, all right? And there was one set of balls. There was a guy at my school that would sell the balls. He said they were the best balls for the game. And he said he would get them from Poland. He flew to Poland for vacation and he bought a bunch of the balls. And they were really rare. And they were the perfect balls for the game. And I'm not going to lie, they were pretty good balls for the game. Anyway, he said because they're so rare, $20 each, bro. $20 a ball. And I was like, you know what? I do need a handball ball. So I'm going to buy a ball, $20. Turns out the balls are from the dollar store and they're two bucks. Bro scammed my ass. Not only did he fucking scam me, he threw my ball into the forest near my school and we could never find it. And I think what happened is while we were looking for it, someone did find it and they just took it and was like, can't find the ball. Can't find the ball. That school was so capitalist ridden, bro. Like at that school, we had the bouncy ball Andy selling bouncy balls. And then we had me, I would draw my own Simpsons comic books and I would try sell them, but no one would ever buy them. And then there was someone else that would make um, little characters. They had uh, little like fuzzy balls, okay? Little fuzzy balls that they would glue eyes onto and like arms with like, uh, with those like fuzzy straws. And then they would build them houses in in uh, shoe boxes. They would they would make like houses and stuff and make all these toys. And then they would sell them so fucking expensive, bro. Those prices were competing with Solvanians. And then, okay, that kid's allowed to do it. Cool. The teachers, the principal doesn't give a fuck. I come along. Some other kids come along and they're like, well, I'm gonna set up a competitive business, man. I'm gonna start making my own too and selling them as well. I'm gonna undercut the fucking monopoly we've got going on. Bang! No more allowed to sell shit at school what the fuck do you mean absolute fucking bullshit why do i not get to do it but that motherfucker does you were letting that fucking kid run a monopoly on this business for fucking months bro they made hundreds of dollars i come along like the poorest motherfucker at the school man zero dollars in my piggy bank i'm not allowed to sell no fucking fuzzy ball dude Bullshit, man! I'm poor, if anything, I, I was poor. If anything, I should have been the one that was allowed to do it. And that mother, I've been to their house. They had a nice house. No, I'm just kidding. They were chill. They were chill. They were my friend, actually. I wasn't that mad. I actually had a crush on them. I had a crush on them. And I remember I was going to tell them I had a crush on them one day. And uh, it was the day that we made uh, ginger beer at school. We made ginger beer. 
and after we all made ginger beer and uh the, everyone was getting picked up after school i was like be right back mumsy i gotta go do something and then uh, I, uh my mom was like hurry up and i was like ah oh, shot i'm stressed bro and i ran over to her and i said i want to tell you something and she went what and i said your ginger beer turned out really well and then i ran away Cause I got nervous. W Riz. <laughs> Dude, that school, man, that school had some drama, bro. That school had some drama. Apparently, all of the parents were having like affairs on each other. What the fuck? And I remember one of my teachers taught, taught me how to do this. Which like... Thanks, bro. Maybe teach me uh, absolute values. I don't really need to know how to sound like a fucking smoke alarm. But you know what? Maybe I didn't need to know how to do that because now in my profession, guys, I don't use absolute values, but do you know what I use? I do that same strategy for the SpongeBob laugh. I use the exact same strategy and he taught it to me. So maybe he fucking knew, dude. He also taught me how to juggle. He also taught me about cup stacking. Dude, did I have a clown at my school as a teacher, bro? Like, I'm now thinking about it. Did I just have a clown that was one of my teachers? Did I accidentally go, like, to a clown school as a child? No way you manage this for eight hours straight. I got bad news for you. We're already... An hour and 49 minutes in. He knew it was entertainer or a bust. Wait, that's actually so smart. Like, if you're a teacher at a school and you have a kid and you're like, fuck, bro. I've told him what absolute values are three times this week, man. He's just, like, having a little trouble with it. Just pivot them hard into, like, being funny. Just start teaching them jokes instead. Being like, oh, what? How does a cat like a steak? Medium rare. Also, the medium rare joke, that shit, my friend... Umfi, Bumfi was telling me she went to an escape room recently, okay? She did the escape room, and then the person working there said, If you can tell me a joke that makes me laugh, I'll give you 20% off. Do you know what joke she pulled out? Medium rare. Do you know what she got? 20% off. Shit's saving money, dude. Being funny, literally, is OP. It's an OP class trait. When you're making your character in the character cre creation screen, pick charisma. Plus three buff. What's the medium rare joke? Why did I say that so American? How does a cat like to order its steak, guys? Medium rare? Zero seven six six zero one four four seven one zero one eight one nine. Four two nine five 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 nine six one nine eight nine four six seven six seven. Eight, I'm gonna nine, say seven. a digit and I'm gonna try to remember it as long as possible. And every time I recite it, I'm gonna add one digit one nine one nine seven one nine seven seven one nine seven seven nine one nine seven seven nine one one nine seven seven nine one two one nine seven seven nine one five. One nine seven seven nine one five six one nine seven seven nine one. Did I fuck it up? One two one two three one two three four one one two three four one 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 two three four one one two one one two three four one two one. Five three three 
Zero, zero one, zero one five, zero one five nine, zero one five nine eight, zero one nine five. Uh. Should we count how many pieces of bus cards are on the ground? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Lame. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7, Six one zero four seven six two one four seven six zero two five one I don't remember. You should play the double game on your head. One two four eight. 16 34 Seven hundred and sixty six. One thousand six hundred to three hundred and twenty two. Two thousand five hundred created. And Yo, what be deluxe? Same with 26 months? Hello, Chillax. Watching this off an edible? Take a seat. Take a seat. Make yourself feel at home. Chibali. Guys, what do we talk about for six more hours? What am I doing with my life, bro? Why did I think this would be a good idea? I thought it'd be funny. I'm not losing my mind fast enough. Is this the whole game? No, 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 no. Four hours in, a bug splatters on your on your windscreen. And then six hours in, the sun sets. Okay, chat. Someone Google uh, good conversation starters. You do kill animals? I was asking about that. Yeah. Weather. It's really cold in America, yeah? What am I most proud of? Um... Oh... I... Oh... Oh... Um... Well... I think... I... Am... A, a little bit funny? What am I wearing? Shorts that are cut above the knee. They're they're shorter in inseam. I I wanna say like four to five inches. Four probably four inch in inseam. And a large black t shirt. And a bracelet and a pair of ATH M50 axes and a pair of uh, Calvin Klein underwear I got from uh, Costco.
What is the last thing you baked? Vegetables. What am I scared of? I am scared of. Hmm, what am I scared of? Do you want a deep answer or do you want like a little uh, goofy like, oh, heights? Because like, I think everyone's scared of heights in some element aspect, right? I'm afraid of, I think... Maybe like amounting to nothing? <laughs> Maybe like, um, well, I don't know, because in my head, I'm like, I would really like to eventually in my life have a nice, happy family and have a child that I uh, get to give a life that I didn't have as a child, a.k.a. lots of like uh, opportunities, mainly monetarily and, you know, like a nice house. And then, like, two loving parents. But, then I'm like, oof. Wom's if that never happens, bro. Wom's if, like, wom's if I'm, wom's if I'm in this room for the rest of my life. Wom's if I'd stop making life progression, and I never get to that point, man. I'm gonna be so pissed off. I'm gonna be, like, 70-year-old single grandpa. That's scary. I don't want that. It's not so much scary as it is kind of like depressing, maybe. Because I'm like, fuck, man. It's kind of all I want. Okay, next question. You find fulfillment in other ways? Yeah, maybe when I make it to like 50, I'll buy a motorbike. Sunrise or sunset? Ooh, I think a sunset is prettier, but I think a sunrise is more enjoyable. Because like, when the sun sets, right? It's um, you get the feeling of, of it, it was hot all day. You feel the feeling of the warmth of the day leaving, right? When the sun sets, you're watching the sunset, it's beautiful, it's breathtaking, and you get the feeling of the warmth from the day leaving because the sun is leaving. But in the morning, it's a little pretty, you know? It's not as beautiful, I can't lie, but it is still pretty. And there, the feeling of the, the nighttime coldness leaving, coming into the day's heat is fucking beautiful, bro. That w Like, the crispiness you get from waking up before the sun gets up, and you're outside in that crispy, cool, fresh air is so fucking... makes it so much more worth it than, this, than the sunset, bro. I think a sunrise is better than a sunset just for that feeling alone. You know how great it feels to be on, like, a mountain? Imagine you're on a mountain, you know, you've got up at like 4.30, you go for a hike with someone you love, bro, up a mountain to watch the sun rise, the sun starts coming up, it's nice and fucking crispy up there, bro, you like, may, you get, oh my god, the warmth, the warmth that starts radiating out of the sun, bro, and the, the crispy fucking cool fresh air you get to share, you get to share that with someone, and that's it, just so nice, man. Imagine you have a cup of coffee in that too, like fuck life this like breathtaking. I almost said life taking. Yeah, when you're camping, when you're camping and you get up at like six or seven and like the sun is kinda out, but there's still a frost on the grass and it's like beautiful. Favorite thing I've bought recently? I don't buy I don't consume almost anything. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really buy things. Is that bad or good? I only really buy groceries. That's about it. I guess uh, I did buy like a perfume recently. Great shoes, haircut and shirt, where'd you get it? Okay, hypothetical, I'm outside of the house. Um. Uh, shoes, I'm probably wearing my Margiela Gats I got on Essence, okay? 
what would I wear outside the house? Probably um, there is a uh, there's a couple really nice blank black t-shirts I have made by a Japanese uh, I think there it's an athletics brand and they're made for baseball Maybe I got it at a I got two of them at a store on Malrose in LA Haircut I cut it myself There's an open seat on the bus guys It's at the back though. So if you're in VR, you got to make a long high call the way up here, dude. When was the last time I cried? When I watched the Blackpink documentary. Couldn't tell you why. I think I was just going through it and the Blackpink documentary was irrelevant to the situation. You went to LA free three hour bit? Yeah, I've been to LA a couple times. How did you know? How do you join? You launch Desert Buzz VR and you just, uh, there's a red box and then you gotta hope that you get into my game. This bus is so fucking slow, dude. Hello, Prizzo. Prizzo, you're gonna love this streamed in. Look, ready? Did we run out of radios? Did we run out of songs? I was like, should we listen to it? If I would listen to this, if this had more bass. Okay, Prizzo, it's, I'm, I'm nominating you. You ask me a question, Prizzo. Have you ever banned someone on another Twitch channel and did you enjoy it? I did. I used to be a Twitch mod before I was a stream. What's my favorite hamburger? Um, I don't really buy fast food anymore, but when I did, when I was a when I was a fast food consumer, I used to really like the um the uh, double whopper with cheese and no tomato. That was my classic fast food burger order. Was a double whopper with cheese and no tomato, but. If I'm eating, if I'm eating meat, because I normally get that, what we call a rebel whopper, you know, fake meat, but uh, 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 genre of sandwich, bro, chicken sandwiches, man, chicken sandwich, we call them just chicken burgers, chicken sandwiches, spicy chicken sandwich, so good, you cannot beat a good spicy chicken sandwich, bro. What would be my ideal living situation? Penthouse apartment. Um, and then a garage in the penthouse apartment that has a, an elevator. So I don't have to go downstairs to get in the car and I just get in and, but the car in the garage is an Uber. And it's a, there is an Uber driver that just sits there and I pay them the entire time that they're sitting there. And then also when I want to go somewhere, I get in the garage Uber and I say, can I go here? And they go, yep. And then I tip them like a thousand percent. Would I rather be a mayfly or a blue whale? Are you telling me would I rather die in like 27 minutes or live like 500 years? That's just a personal driver? Ah, oh, fuck. I'd rather be a blue whale. I think the ocean would be fun. Oh, the size of? Would I rather be the size of? Probably a blue whale. Wait, am I still a human though? Either way, you would hate that you can't stream, you're obsessed. Exactly, but I could... Maybe? Dude, can you actually live inside of a whale? Try 
trip to space or the bottom of the ocean? Do I survive in both of those scenarios? Or is it is, is there still the risk element of both of those? Is this crazy to say? I think it's safer to go to space than it is to go to the bottom of the ocean. Because like... Because like... Okay, to go to space, you need people that are trained enough to design something that can take people to space. But to go to the bottom of the ocean, you could be a dude that's like, Bro, if I weld two bathtubs together, and then put a fucking window on it, and then put like a brick on it, we can go to the bottom of the ocean. Like the 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 limit the the range of knowledge you need to go to space makes it feel like space is safer than the bottom of the ocean because you have to be a very specific person to try get to space. But any motherfucker can go. Yeah, I'm gonna invent something to go to the ocean. Proven by the dude that was like, yeah, we're gonna go look at the Titanic. What happened? Uh uh. Dude wasn't trained enough, bro. He just invented some shit in his backyard. And then also, this might be grim, I feel like dying in space would be more chill than dying in the ocean. Because, okay, you die in the ocean? Well, I guess in both of those scenarios, you just implode. But at least if you die in space, it looks nicer. Because you get to look at Earth when it happens. And then you'll probably have like a really deep moment that is like, dang, I spent my entire life there now, and I'm ending it up here, bro. What the fuck? Actually, no, don't in space you, like, boil alive. What do you guys think? Yeah. Fair enough. How many people have died in space? Would you consider yourself introverted? You said you're shy? I... Oof. Wait, what am I? Wait, are you an ass or a boobs guy? I... I think... Okay, I do believe that ass or boobs question is stupid, but I'm still gonna answer it, okay? I refuse the question, why not both? That is, I think, the, like, the general answer, but... What am I? I don't know. I can't really... I guess... Well, I don't know. I don't really look at either, dude. If you asked me, like... Like... How many years ago... Was I, was I, was I a dude that would either pick boobs or ass? If you asked me like 10 years ago, I would probably say ass. Are you a balls or cock guy? I think balls are funnier. I think balls are way funnier. Wait, I was reading a question and then I got distracted by boobs or ass. Wait, what was the question? Introverted? Oh! Well, I don't know if I'm introverted or if I... When I was younger, I had a lot of social anxiety, okay? Like, a lot. And I don't really think I have that anymore because... Like, I logged into my brain and I was like, bro... Who cares a little bit if I'm awkward? And I'm definitely still a little awkward now and a little shy, but like, but like I just kind of like logged out of my brain in that aspect. Like if I embarrass, like if I meet someone and, um, and like I'm a little awkward and shy in my brain, I've just told myself that is n like normal. Cause it is bro. If you meet someone for the first time, it's normal to be like a little shy and introverted and awkward. So I think I'm like... 
I think I'm still an introvert though. Social anxiety passed aside. I think I'm still introverted. Can you backflip? No, but I have reoccurring dreams that I can. Why are you scared of GTA RP? I think because I'm scared of being bad of it. I'm scared of being bad at GTA RP. My most recent nightmare? Are you in no pixel? I'm not. I'm not. But I think I could be. My most recent nightmare was a uh, me. Well, oh, actually, the dream I had last night where I got killed wasn't really a nightmare. But I did have a nightmare re a while ago where um I was in my house and then in the backyard there was a bunch of dead people and I was hiding because I was home alone. And then people started pulling up to my house and I was really scared. And then apparently it was just a movie set and they were filming a movie in my on my property and they were all alive people actually. But before I knew that, it was scary. What do you guys think? Hands up in the party bus, man! Would you rather eat a slice of cheese or an entire soda? Slice of cheese. Slice of cheese? Best thing you can snack on. What's the best compliment you've ever gotten? Prizzo one time said that I have no bags under my eyes. Which wasn't really like, um, I didn't really go like, wow, that's the best compliment I've ever gotten. But it was a moment where I was like, holy shit, that is something I've never realized about myself. So like, I'm never going to forget it because I never knew that. Like, that's something I just overlooked. Like, I never realized that. Someone told me I had a nice hog once. Oh, only once? Dude, I saw a Reddit post. <laughs> Dude, I saw a Reddit post on r slash small dick problems of someone being like, I looked up reviews of dildos of my size, man. Worst night of my life, bro. Everyone said it's too small and they refunded it. And I was like, oh. But then in my head, I was like, I kind of want to do that. <laughs> I was like, I kind of want to look those up. I want to see. I want to see, dude. What is? What are they be saying? I'll post my response to R slash small dick problems. Is that like a thing people do? Read them on stream, guys. You are not gonna know the size of my hog. Sorry. That's for me to know. You've never measured? Mm, probably like a long time ago. No Chibli penis related questions, chant. Get out of there. I can just go to the Wikipedia page and find out. Yeah, true. It's probably on my wiki. Do you think your height has decreased with age? Yes, because my posture has got worse. I literally think I've got shorter by like two inches because my posture is just so bad. What about hole question? I've never looked at my hole. And I never want to look at my hole. That, I don't want to know what it looks like. I don't need to know what it looks like. I already have enough self-conscious problems. I don't need to know what like that part of my body looks like. What's the worst picture someone else has of you? There is maybe like two pictures of me in existence. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, did I miss a sign? There was a sign on the side of the road and I missed it? Fuck, we're missing all of the content, bro. Squeeze fine with your host, yours truly, Larry J. DeVille. Question number two. Lawrence, Kansas is a city that is host to a public university. 
the University of Is it A, Alabama, B, Alaska, C, Arizona, D, Arkansas, E, California, F, Colorado, G, Connecticut, H, Delaware, I, Florida, J, Georgia, K, L, Idaho. The farming chat, bro. <laughs> Shut up! Do I watch any speedrunners? I watch Liam sometimes. Very rarely. But I like it. I think when Prizo watches clips on stream, Liam's clips, no disrespect to anyone else, Liam's clips are the funniest ones. Every single time. I don't know why, I don't know how Liam is so funny. And most of the time, it's just because he's trying not to laugh. And I really do love the gimmick of like, like a streamer never showing themselves laugh. I think that's so funny. So whenever he goes to laugh, he turns his like webcam off and it makes it 10 times funnier because you know he's giggling back there, dude. You know he's giggling. Do you watch any slow runners? I used to watch Squeak stream uh, Mario when he streamed that. But I also used to watch Northern Lines uh, speedrun Mario as well. That's probably the slowest runner I've, I've seen. The breast milk clip makes me laugh. Oh, the t the clip that's like, would you take a sip of breast milk? And then he's like, I'm taking more than a sip or like or something like that. <laughs> what does... Hello, Archie. What does... It can't taste good, right? What do you guys think? Yeah, it can't taste that good. Are you taking us the whole way to Vegas? Yeah, we're going to TwitchCon, guys. It's sweeter than cow milk? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, I don't want sweet milk. If you eat... You know you can get nipples in your armpits? Did you know that? Because the milk line, the milk duct lines go from like... They go all over your body and you can get a third nipple anywhere on the milk duct line. And it goes into your armpits. The, the line goes through your armpits. So technically you can get a third nipple. People think you can only get third nipples around the nipples. No, you can get a third nipple like on your stomach, on your like in the middle of your chest, in your armpit. You can get a third nipple like anywhere. Anywhere. Two and a half scum, sing with a raid. Put the seatbelt on, lock in. On your leg? I don't think you can get a third nipple on your leg. I don't think that you can get them on your legs, because I don't think the lines go to down your legs, right? Someone Google a uh, uh, milk duct line. No, thank you. Fair enough. Next question. Uh, Missouri and Colorado border Shut which up. Favorite animal? I really do like bison. I think bison, like I think I think bison are the most majestic 
living animal we have, in my opinion. I think that I think it's the most like that's the closest thing we have to like a majestic fucking mythological animal, bro. And hashtag fuck buffaloes, man. Lame as hell. Stinky ass cows, pretty much. Bison is so fucking cool, bro. They're so cool. Have you ever seen how big they are? They're like the size of a car, man. Do you know how fucking sick that is? Do you know how cool that is? Moose? Moose are cool, but they like... The thing is, nothing looks like a bison, dude. A moose just looks like a big deer, and then a deer just looks like a fucking big goat. A bison just looks like a bison. Like, what looks like a bison? And you can't say cow because they look different. You can't say buffalo, they look different. If anything, a bison is closer to like a like a rhino than it is a cow. Do you fuck with yaks? Yaks, I think, would stink, but they're like chill. Would you rather have to drink one liter of water but it starts as ice or drink one liter of water that has been left overnight? Oh. Left overnight? I do that all the time. Every single morning I wake up, I finish my coffee, and I finish the water from the previous night. How long do you think it would take you to kickflip? I think I could do it in a day. Because I used to skate. I could never kickflip, but I think just years of being interested in skating has given me the knowledge. Like, I already know, like... Like, I know, I know it all. I know, already know all the hours, like the strats, bro. Shout out Andy Anderson, dude. Wait, you guys, does anyone in chat know uh, Luke Blovad? They have like a couple TikToks blow up on Twitter every once in a while, and also they make music. Literally, who one person's gonna know Luke Blovad, dude. Yes, I love Luke Blobat, and then I love them even more learning that they fucking, they skate! They used to be a skater! I was watching this, like, they have skate videos on YouTube and shit! They used to be signed to a team called, um, well, they used to skate for a, a company called, uh, Corporate? Maybe? And they're so fucking good at skating! Are you guys? Oh, we have five in the bus, bro. Gangnam Style. Is that Chib? Chib, are you Gangnam Style right now? Chib, is that you? Who's who's VR in the two headed, bro? Chat. What instrument is the harp? Uh, is the harp the big one? What is the small harp? A liar? Should I get a tattoo of a, um, there's a tattoo artist that I was looking at and, uh, they have some flash and uh, one of their flash is a, um, so the flash is, oh, I shouldn't get a tattoo. Okay. Wait, we have a VR Andy sitting in the front seat. Can you walk up to the front of the bus? Hello. The typing. Oh! Are they fucking crawling on the ground, the IRL? What are they doing?
Hello? <laughs> Farm and chat. Farm and chat. Okay. Okay. Wait, you need to come stand like right here so I can look at the road. I, I respect you not trying to interfere the uh, the line of sight I have with the road, but you have my permission to come even closer to the front of the bus. Chip is making his own RP server. What was if I joined GTA RP and I got addicted to gambling in it? You bald head. The sun is setting. What the hell, life? My fingers are getting so sore. Content created. Bianc, thank you for the 24 months. Would you rather poop 50,000 gallons of mayo or one ninja throwing star? Would I rather poop 50,000 gallons of mayo or one ninja throwing star? Probably... Um, what would do more damage? I'm not gonna lie, I think the mayo would do more damage. Are you kidding me? Do you know how much 50,000 gallons is? You wouldn't even have a hole at that point. You- I don't even think you would be a human at that point. Is it all at once? How long does it take? Oh, if you move too much, it goes black? Oh, I see. Twenty hours? I feel like I could shit for twenty hours. I think I could do that. I guess I'll do the mayo. Okay. No, a follow-up question to this question. No, never mind. We're not moving on from the poop. Yo, Michael, thank you so much for the two months. Guys, I'm actually proud of how well we're doing. Funniest thing to poop? Uh, like a Big Mac? Like imagine if you took a shit and it came out as this full Big Mac? Like an intact, like it was just a hamburger? That would be so funny, dude. Would I eat it? No, what the fuck? Hello? You're bald. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean it. Where did you go? I didn't mean it. <sighs> I have to drive with my right hand, dude. My left hand's getting too sore already, and we're not even halfway. How are we only two hours in? Do you think me doing this will inspire anyone else to do it? I'm gonna nominate people at the end like the goddamn ice bucket challenge, bro. What's the worst game I've played? This is somehow not one of them. No, you don't think anyone else is gonna do this? You don't think they're gonna go, wow, that actually is a really good piece of content idea. Guarantee Ryan does it tomorrow. He only streams for five hours, you couldn't even finish it. Wait, I'm gonna be streaming until like 7 p.m. dude Oh fuck uh, Wait, that's so far away That's in six hours
I don't have anything to eat. What the hell, Fells and Chant? What a red, cool username. Turns out eight hours is a long time. Is it really though? Oh my god. I I looked at when I made my RuneScape account the other day. I made that shit in 2006, bro. Isn't that sad? Do you think if I stop the bus, I can go get a ginger beer? How fast does it veer to the right? I could totally, I would have a ginger beer by now. I would have a ginger beer by now. And then if I need to piss, I can piss in the ginger beer bottle. What's on the radio? Don't want to fold the right flap over to the left. Kind of like you turn a page in a book. Good job. Now turn over the shape and repeat on this side. Then fold the right flap to the left again. We'll give you a moment to get caught up. If you're not caught up at this point, no! still to pause the tape and hit play when you're ready. I drove 10 hours home from winter break. This is easy. Did you drive on a road that has nothing on it though? And did you have to hold W with your middle finger the entire time? Hmm? Did you? You know what? I'm gonna take a third gummy vitamin of the day, bro. Time to get fucking twisted, yeah? It's time to get fucking twisted. Wait, this might be the fourth one. I'm gonna have kidney failure, dude. Okay. Now is the time. I have to figure out a way to hold down W with something on my keyboard. I think a stick of chapstick is gonna be the strat. Hmm. What weighs enough to hold down? Use tape? I don't own any. What about... I have a pair of pliers? Oh, I have an idea. It doesn't weigh it down enough. It doesn't weigh it down enough. Unless I add more weight. Oh, I just... What's that thing where the spit comes out of your teeth? It's bleated. I just gleeked all over myself. Can someone I trust Google if you can pull over the bus? Which is a big ask. I don't trust a lot of you. I'm not going to lie. You can stop those for a couple of minutes, but the battery will die. Google said it's fine. Chib, I trust you. Chib, are you here? Tr Chib, Chibli. Okay, apparently you can pull over for a couple of minutes. I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk it, dude. Enough for a bath bathroom break if you're quick. I don't want to fucking risk it, dude. Wait, it's so scary. I drove one point on my mouse, stopped the bus, and went AFK for 30 minutes, and I still didn't get towed. 
They got bored of waiting and closed the game. If there's any biter dying mechanic present. Oop. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so fucking nervous, bro. If it ends, I'm ending the stream. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it, dude. I don't want to do it. Can I do it? No! Okay. I'll do it later. I'll do it when I get really desperate. No, I want to do it now. 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 I have hair in my mouth. Fuck, I forgot to get the, I forgot to get the ginger beer. Guys, I didn't go pee. I went to go get ginger beer, but I forgot to get the ginger beer, dude. Fuck. I just ran to the kitchen and I ran back. Man, I forgot to get the drink, dude. <laughs> get trolled, bro. Get trolled, you absolute mouse. You're all so stupid. Every day I wake up and I broke, break my bones. Oh, that's the RP voice, dude. Ramasquami, day one. Every day I wake up and I break my bones. I think that was actually the fastest I've ran in so long. I don't know if I have a big ego. Does everyone else, is everyone else convinced that they can run like fast as fuck? Like every once in a while when I run a little bit, I'm like, fuck, I'm quick, bro. Like I'm, I can, I'm so fast. Like once every four months when I get a little jog on, I'm like, holy fuck, man. I'm actually so quick, bro. You just think you're quick? Nah, I, if, if when it's in me, bro, it is in me. And then I run for like 10 feet and I'm like, oh, I can never do that again. Thanks, what the man. tuna? Man, stop. That's the way I like to... Uh -huh. Anon? Oh, Anon. OP is Anon? Thank you so much for the five gifties. What the hell? Oh my god, cheese burger. 
Betty White? What the? What the? What the hell? It's so funny. My, um, guys, self report. I live at home. I live at home. Self report. Okay. I still live with my mum Z. But it's a rough, uh, economic world out there. Okay, man. Apartments are not cheap, dude. I'm working on it. I promise. But every time. Every time I go downstairs while I'm streaming to do something, my mom can tell, like, she knows what's happening because I'm so fast through the house, bro. Like, I, I'm, like, speed walking or, like, running. Like, I'm quick through the house, bro. Millionaire lives with his mumsy. So what? So what that I'm a millionaire? And, like, normally when I see mumsy, she'll talk to me. But when I'm, like, speed walking, she knows. She knows. She's like, oh, give him his space. He's in the zone, bro. What the? What's on the radio? What is that? Oh my fucking god, dude. I thought there was like a fucking shooting star or something. Where are you going? Where are you going? You scared the shit out of me. Where are you? Bye. I'm gonna scare the shit out of them. And for our last origami of the camp, we're going to do one for the kids. Start again with a rectangle piece of paper. Dude, I feel like I'm being like, this is like Baldur's Gate demon, bro. A two by five, three by seven. I'm about to be given like a choice. Four by eight. Shut up. Goodbye! Are they crawling? They're still just crawling on the ground? What is this movement? I'm gonna be honest, passengers, I'm so sorry. I, like, forgot about you guys. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. So sorry. Do something. Hi! Yay! What the fuck? <laughs> what are you doing? What do you think is funny, huh? Wait, can you drive for me? Fucking Jesus Christ. This is literally Jesus taking the wheel. Okay, guys, next question. Oh, they're driving me. Look at that. If the color orange tastes like oranges, what does the color purple taste like? Yam. Purple yams. How is the AI like this? Right? Like, how, what is the AI doing right now? What's my most watched YouTube channel? Probably... Probably, um... Recently? Probably... I don't know his name. He, he posts the dip. Oh my fuck! Hello, Joski. Favorite Lego set? White House. Favorite YouTube channel? I don't know his name. He posts skateboarding videos every day. I don't know his name. He's got a mustache. Um, a lot of Andy Anderson videos. I don't remember his name. I've been watching him every day for like two weeks. What about, yeah, 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 Dan, Dan Corrigan. Yeah, 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 him, him, him. I've been watching a lot of him. Yeah, 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 yeah.
Dude, I was watching, I was just browsing YouTube the other day and there was a video, there was a video titled the downfall of, and then a channel name that is a big like skateboarding channel that I used to watch ago. And I was like, huh, like I normally hate videos like the downfall, blah, blah, blah. I think they're so stupid, but I decided to watch it and I watched it. Apparently the dude that runs the channel is a fucking Scientologist, man. What the fuck? I was like, huh? That's what happened? He's a Scientologist? Content and then one of the points created. in the video was like, I think it's fucked up that he was asking his viewers to donate to this one thing. But like, here is an article where he uh, got given an award from the Church of Scientology for donating a million dollars. And I'm like, what the fuck? Yo, Stinky Egg, hey, thank you for the prime. Crazy, dude. Oh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Chat, what is that song? Chat, what is that song? Oh, baby, it's a wild world. Oh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Take good care. I'm not a nice friend, sir. Oh, things to wear. Things to wear. Too bad. Out there. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Baby, baby, it's a wild. 
play in the guitar, bro. Okay, we get one song every three hours, guys. Um, yo, Jade Stir, thank you so much for the brand new TM1, thank you. We got one song every three hours. That was really good, though. I, that's what I needed to wake myself up, man. That, I really needed that. I really needed that. I wasn't being that loud, right? I don't think I would have got a noise complaint for that. Oh, it's fucking raining and my window's open. It's already been another three hours. Time for a second song. Nah, 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 nah. We can't do that. Oh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Dude, that song, it's always stuck in my head. And I remember the first time I listened to it, it was because I was watching the British drama uh, teen series Skins. I first heard that song on Skins. Good song, bro. Look right. Oh, sunset, bro, but it's hidden behind the fucking mirror, bro. <laughs> A dog, dog sticking his head out the window, dude. <laughs> That's someone enjoying the trip, man. Holy, dude. This shit probably looks so crazy in VR. Wait, I think we have a spot on the bus. Yeah, 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 they're pointing. There's an empty seat, I think. Can you play I Spy? All right, we can do that. I Spy with my little eye. Something beginning with R. Ah. The road. Oh, too easy, dude. What the hell? Too easy. Okay, you guys go. Why are you driving on the inside side of the road? Because it veers to the right. So I go all the way to the left to give myself as much room. See, look, I'm not touching anything right now, and this is how the bus goes. Someone's losing their mind right now because they didn't realize that this was a mechanic, and they're like, I just slowly sucked at driving. Now, if you let go of the steering, it goes, it slowly veers to the right. Why? I think so you have to pay attention the entire time. Oh, there's two seats, bro. Yeah, bad tire alignment. Can I turn the lights on, please? What's on that? First, I had Woody. He got hit by a train. Then, I had Anita. Are we listening to, like, a murder confession? vengeance on the train that killed Woody. And then I found Bisto making little poops on the windmill outside our house. After Mr. Torg and Dusky, I you should play this. Dusky, you should play this. I'm trying to make it the new meta, man. You should jump on this, dude. It's a really good game. I like that it's so funny in my head. I was like, hmm. Um, what content could I do today? Could I do playing the worst rated video games on Metacritic? That sounds pretty fun. Nah, I'll do the game where you hold W and uh, you press A every once in a while. That seems like it's it would be much better content, dude. I just got ads. Can you repeat the last 90 seconds? Yeah, it was just this. Being in touch with your emotions is not a character flaw. That's right, high five. Is something wrong? You look confused, Vault Hunter. Oh, you probably haven't heard anyone call Mr. Torg high five before. The world may know him as Mr. Torg, 
but the flexing tins always referred to him using his middle name. It's a Flexington family tradition, after all. Use your grandfather or grandmother's name as your own middle name. Bye. Bye bye. Hello. What? What is that? Oh well. I. It is so funny because you know there's someone IRL doing that with the VR hits it on and they're scared every time they do it that they're gonna hit their head on the wall. They're like, I gotta be careful, I can't do it too aggressively, I'm gonna hit my fucking head on the wall, dude. Ah, uh, chat, what can we talk about? What's a fucking thing we could invent right now, man? Let's brainstorm, okay? Let's brainstorm. We have a lot of free time. Oh, we could finish the 99 bottles of beer on the wall song. 94, 90, 74 bottles of beer on the wall. 74 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 73 bottles of beer on the wall. 70... Three bottles of beer on the wall, 73 bottles of beer, take one down, pause it around, 72 bottles of beer on the wall, 72 bottles of beer on the wall, 72 bottles of beer, take one down, pause it around, 71 bottles of beer on the wall, 71 bottles of beer on the wall, 71 bottles of beer, take one down, pause it around, 69 bottles of beer on the wall. Okay, we'll stop there. We made some good progress on that. I'm sure by the end of the eight hours we'll get it finished. We can't do that already, we used our three hour song, fuck true. Are those two passengers kissing? I think they just live inside of each other's head. Guys, don't spam. If I don't have chat during this, I have literally nothing. Warning. I'll turn this bus around. Do you think you'd be a good barista? Yes, I think I would be a beautiful barista. I would be so attentive to everyone's little coffee orders. I would I would be so nice to the regulars. I would give people some free cookies. You cannot stop us all. There is literally a setting that you can turn on that prevents duplicate messages. <laughs> I hate to break it to you. Can I get a venti caramel frappuccino with non-fat coconut milk? Exactly two and a half cups of sugar with chalk. I would remember that. I would remember that if I was a barista, bro. I would fucking remember that. Look, I can recite it right now with my eyes closed. Can I get a venti caramel frappuccino with non-fat coconut, non coconut milk? Exactly two and a half sugar cup of sugar drizzle chocolate six and a caramel. See? Dude, coconut milk? Shit's kind of fucking good, bro. I can't lie. Can I pretend to do small talk with a customer? Hey! Wait, how have you how have you been? It's been a while. How are you? <gasps> That's good. I was wondering where you went. How was your trip? Oh! Oh no. Oh. 
Oh, you can tell me next time. There's a lot of customers coming in. So anyway, what can I get you today? Okay, yep, march, a, a, a large iced matcha, yep. Okay, and you want one of the apricots, um, danishes over there? Okay, I can get you one of those, too. Okay, I love you. Sorry. Um, that will be $29.99. Please. Oh, you just can't afford that? Fuck you. Get the fuck out. Fuck you. And I saw you bring in a Coke Zero can. I knew that you were going to drink that fucking out-of-establishment beverage in my establishment, motherfucker. Get the fuck out of my cafe, bro. I'll report you to every fucking cafe in a 10-mile radius, dude. You're going to have nowhere to go. You're going to have nowhere to go. I'm going to tell them that you sneak in cans of Coke Zero, you piece of shit. Get the fuck out. I don't even give a fuck about the vocation you just took. I was just trying to sweet talk you so you'd buy more shit. I don't give a fuck. I was just trying to make it feel like we're friends, so I form a parasocial relationship with you, so every time you come in here, you feel inclined to buy more shit because you enjoy being in here because my presence is in this building, and you think we're fucking friends, so in your mind, on the weekend, you're like, yeah, I'm gonna go to that cafe because I'm friends with the person that works there, and we always have such a nice fucking conversation. You think we're friends. We're not friends. I see you as nothing but money. Your money to me. I don't give a fuck about you or your goddamn coffee order. Also, every time you order a drink, I've been spitting in it, bro. I don't give a fuck. Anyway, thank you. I'll bring it to your table when it's ready. Thank you so much. That's how he thinks about viewers. <laughs> Imagine. I don't give a fuck about you guys, man. I don't give a fuck anymore. Me in seven years when I'm British and I'm having a breakdown on stream. I didn't even like streaming, man. I've never liked this shit, bro. Yeah, I just fucking hate all of you, man. I just was fucking doing this because I needed to, bro. I don't even like it. No, I'm just kidding. I'd never be British. Why won't it play? Why won't it play? <laughs> it's so over content wise no i'm delivering the best bits of the stream right now what do you mean it's over i'm delivering some heat bro take good care none of those things to wear no 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 i have a new song idea Because we're doing a USA road trip, bro. We're doing a United States of America road trip, man. We gotta get party in the USA. A musical for race. I'm nauseous. I'm nervous. And I'm ready to blow. This is Something crazy can go wrong. Passing gas like yeah. Like yeah. Hey, hey, hey. I'm farting in the USA. Yeah, I'm farting. Wait, can you do the Lethal Company dance? Hey, hey! Look at them go! What the fuck? Whoa! 
great assets, great, great assets, great assets, great, great assets. Watch the road. Guys, I'm watching the road through this window. Don't even worry. Hey! <laughs> are those people? Yeah, these are real human beings in my bus. Dude, isn't this beautiful though? Can it be like the $600 was worth it? I don't know if I'm driving from Vegas or I'm I'm in Vegas. I don't know where I'm going to where I'm from. $600 game. This game was $600, yeah. But I'm going to the refund period's 8 hours, so I'm good. They should make it. Oh, well, that wouldn't work, never mind. Arizona to Nevada. Maybe the radio will tell us. Danny boy, thank you for the 44 Matt, months. Yes, Matt. Boredom is the true tragedy. You may one day find a challenging combat. Stupid. Not on picks up a giant. There's an empty seat, guys. That's fine, we're almost at four hours and the second half always goes faster, right? Isn't that the philosophy, the, the logic? Isn't that real? The second half is always the fastest half. What's up, Europe? The second half is way slower? No shot! When you're on a plane, the second one is the fastest one. Just flexing how I can spell Albuquerque? Albuquerque? I can't even say it. What the fuck? What is that? That's new. That's- what is that? We have two seats on the bus, guys. How to join the game is called a uh, desert bus VR on Steam But you can play in non VR and then you just have to find a random game and hope it's this one. Oh Wait so cute. They're waving to each other, bro. Oh Hi, wait, I Can't wave What? Are you threatening me? What the fuck? Are you threatening me? Did you just tell me to die? What was that? Oh, you're pointing and laughing at me. Great. Great. Nice to know we have nice people on this bus, dude. Is there actually two people in this seat? Or is it just one person with two hit? No, oh my god, there's actually two people in that seat. That is so funny. You guys are twin flames. So this the twins. <sighs> Bad news. I feel a bit of a, a pee coming on. I feel a bit of a pee brewing in me. I think that ginger beer. It was. I at least have three hundred thirty milliliters of liquid in me right now. I know the exact song that I need to play while uh, playing this game. Okay, this song's an hour long. If we listen to it a couple of times, we're gonna make a lot of progress.
Maybe another time. The content's already hard enough to consume, bro. Why is the alignment fuck? I tried to get it into the shop before I left, bro. They wouldn't take me. Sorry to the passengers behind. I'm driving with my right hand. I can't I can't turn around. Has Chip shown feet on stream yet? My feet are not nice. I cannot I cannot show you my feet ever in my life. And now that I've said that, I hate it because for like for ten the next ten years, someone's gonna be trying to catch a sneak on my feet, dude. And they're gonna see my feet and they're gonna be like, yep, he was right. They're not nice. Wait, maybe I should cut my toenails while I'm driving. I had to rip that one off. Okay, I'll do my left foot at like hour six. I'll do my other foot like hour six. We got one of them done. I've been meaning to do that for a couple of days. We got one done. We made good progress. We're halfway done. With cutting my, toena my toenails and not the game. How the fuck has it only been like six minutes since fucking six minutes ago, dude? NL has done this? I don't think NL has done this. I don't think any logical streamer would ever do this because it makes no sense. There is no gain out of the content for doing this. Right? It's not, I would argue it's not enjoyable visually. I guess it is enjoyable visually i mean air in your ears if the person doing it can uphold a conversation for eight hours but i don't know if i have the abilities to do that man i already feel like i'm running out of shit to talk about dude the only reason it is good content is because after you do it, there will be a subset of people that are going to be like, I was there for the desert bus stream. And then they're going to be like, it was the best thing ever. And then the people that weren't there for it are going to be like, fuck, man, I wasn't there for it. I feel like shit. And then there's going to be like a cool exclusive club that are like, yeah, I was there for it. And everyone's going to be like, oh, man, I feel so left out. Like when you release a limited edition vinyl, you know, and someone's like, I got the vinyl and everyone's just like, I don't have the vinyl. Maybe we'll get a topic off the radio. How many combinations of a cheeseburger can you get? Surely endless, is the combinations you can get of a burger infinite? Right, because okay. One combination, bread, patty, bread. Combination two, bread, patty, bread, cheese. Oh, maybe put the cheese in the middle. And then bread, patty, cheese, lettuce. Bread, patty, cheese, lettuce, tomato. Bread, okay, let's actually figure this out. Okay, bread, patty, cheese, lettuce, tomato is like combination number four. You could have one with no patty, that's number five. Pickle, six. Add pickles six, and then it. now the crazy thing is, you could do, you could do, lettuce. You could do patty, cheese, lettuce, no tomato, and pickles. That's another one. There is endless amounts of, of, burger combination. And then once you run out of edible ingredients, you can do inedible ingredients. Cause then, no, you don't even need to do that, bro. Because once you've done every single combination with beef, you do every single combination with chicken, and then you double, you double the amount of combinations right there. And then 
bang shit ton and then you do guess what condiments bro okay you have all these combinations with like all this shit at the more ingredients you add the more combinations it adds like fucking tenfold man right because say even say even every single burger was a patty and then it had lettuce tomato and pickles on it it's that and the, and then it's that in beef form and chicken form just say that's the only two combinations there are okay and then you add ketchup bang times two that's four combinations and then you add mustard bang that's a times two again and then you do one with no ketchup and just mustard bang another two and then you do i don't know fucking secret big mac sauce bang another two and then you big mac sauce and mustard a big mac sauce and ketchup and then you do like a pickle relish bang pickle relish bang pickle relish, relish and ketchup pickle relish and mustard pickle relish and burger mac big mac sauce bang and then you do a combination with all four of those sauces and then you do a combination with only three of them and then you do a combination with a different all four like a different all three of them dang two bro it's literally there is an endless amount of fucking burgers that you can create in this world and these fast food establishments literally just do the same shit on repeat and it's kind of actually pissing me off because this is something i literally never realized about this world until i started talking about it right now i'm actually so annoyed right now it's so fucking stupid that they do the same combinations repeatedly like, what is the most creative fast food burger, dude? Like, we have a, a burger here called Kiwi Burger has egg on it. Bang, you're adding egg to the unlimited... Why not do a burger that's like... Beef, egg, and avocado? That's fun, man, and cheese! Pickles! Onion! Not enough onions, bro! I want a burger that is literally just beef and onions. I don't give a fuck. Onion is so good. If you go to Costco, can you get a, your own container and fill it with the Costco hot dog onions? And steal it? Here's a burger for you. Fresh beef marinated with blueberries, raspberries, vinaigrette, dressing, American cheese, cheesy hash browns, fried egg. See, why is, is no one making those? Why is no one making that shit? It's pissing me off. Why is no one putting avocado on burgers, dude? Do like an avocado mash on top of a, like a, like a, okay? Bang. I'm about to make the best burger ever right now. Have a guacamole. <laughs> you know how fast food works, right? How does it work? Is it AI generated? Or do, or do you mean it has to be fast? Well, you could make it fast. Why don't they like... You could make you could make it fast. Just put it all in like a like a a piping bag, like you're baking. How the fuck has it only, dude? I swear to God, I looked at this clock twenty minutes ago and it was three sixteen. I think it's slow. The time is slowing down. If it's not fitting in a warming drawer, it's not going on that burger. Okay. What about... What? Okay, what fits in the drawer? Bacon, beef, chicken. You could... There's so much good shit you could put in there. Like a little... Like sausage? Egg? You could put egg in there. Didn't Burger King do a ramen burger? Pineapple on burger is based. Pineapple? Pineapple is the best fruit, but not when it's warm. Warm pineapple is a freaking crime, dude.
but I'm not here to be like that dumb asshole that's like, oh, you get pineapple on pizza? Fuck you. No, you're living your life and I'm living my life, okay? You can do that. I'm not eating your pizza. You're eating your pizza, bro. I'm just personally warm pineapple. Pineapple on pizza? I don't like it. You know what is really good though? Candied pineapple. Dude, you get some pineapple rings and you put brown sugar on that shit and then you cook it? Oh my god. Yo, Amanda TTCT, thank you for the brand new tier one, Chippy. Chippy. Can you read me a bedtime story? Mm. Um. One one was a racehorse. Two two was one two. When a one 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 race two two one one two <laughs> how's it only been two minutes ah, I'm just kidding I'm just kidding. That was a joke. Guys, can I pivot? No, no. No, no. I'm already too fucking committed, man. I can't pivot. I can't pivot. Yeah, I'm looking at the clock too much. Yo, this kid, Jage. Thank you so much for the 35 months. Thank you. Thanks for the company. You mean the Alito company? Oh! Lethal company reference. Among Us of 2024, dude. You gotta finish this trip and then pivot? Okay, now I can do that. Yeah, we'll play like a... Maybe we'll do like a Red Dead Redemption 2 Let's Play after this. Yeah. Okay. I'll see if I can beat Red Dead Redemption 2 in a single stream. Sean, thank you for the 13 months. Hello, Dave. Can I do more escape room? I think I'm too smart for that game. Garth lost two armies. Garth continued the attack with three armies. Trent defended with two armies. Garth rolled six, three, and three. Trent rolled three and one. Trent lost two armies. Garth continued the attack with three armies. Trent defended with one army. Garth rolled six, two, and one. I'm gonna create a medieval battle in my head and I'm gonna narrate it out loud for everyone. Okay. One side, side A. Trent has total units, 286. 286 total units. 20 of them are horse mounted, okay? 286 horse mounted units and then 200 i mean 286 total units 20 horse mounted units okay one squad of 10 have a ladder and another squad of 10 have uh crossbows okay very very not good the rest of them in pretty poor equipment 286 total 20 on the horse 10 10 got a ladder 10 got crossbows the defending side will call him brief his name's Brief, okay? He's from medieval era, all right? Uh, defending the castle, they're down. You know, uh, the main military that defends the castle is out for the day. They've only got 80 total units inside, but they're in a castle. So they've uh, got the high ground. They're better uh, prepared. They have more resources. Content okay, created. Brief, 80 units. Um, they've all got swords, shields, and bows, all right? It's uh, laid out in an open plane, an open plane, kind of like what we're looking at right now. Castle on the right side, uh, defended by Brief. Trent on the left side with his units. 
Uh, Trent decides to split half of his units uh, minus the minus the horses to either side. So it's two. Okay, Brief's castle right here, right? Uh, there's half of uh, the other units over there, half of the other units over there, because they don't want to. You know what? They split it three three ways, three ways. Uh, one one on the front, one on the side, one on the other side, because they because they don't want to push all the units through the main gate. Uh, because uh, sieging a castle uh, through the main gate is bad because medieval castles have this thing where above the main gate they have a hole, and uh, above the hole they drop like like hot oil or like rocks and shit like that so you want to put as small amount of uh troops through the main gate as possible um the uh the quarter the th one third on the right side of the castle so the castle's over there right and main gates this side right side of the castle has the ladder right left side there's a small hill has a crossbow okay um they start the attack by the crossbowmen shooting into the castle, right? They take out five troops, bang. 75 troops on reef side, right? Still 186 on Trent's side. Um, bang, surprise, man. Dude in the castle does magic, bro. He fucking flies up 200 feet, bang. Fireball, takes out 30 troops, bro. What the fuck, man? Bro's playing Mountain Blade in his head. Bang, flies up, fireball, takes out 30 troops uh, on the crossbow side, kills every crossbowman except one, okay? With one crossbowman left uh, out of 10. Um, side, Trent's side with the ladder, they're, pu they're uh, putting up the ladders. Everyone else in the castle on brief side is focused towards the main gate and the side with the crossbowman. And the side... Uh, with the ladders is sneaking in bro. They don't know that they're actually getting in a couple of them get in right that they're in the castle walls So lay it out in your head front side uh, People pushing the main gate left side up on a little hill uh, uh, One crosswoman couple of troops. Oh fuck. I forgot they had horses bro Horses on the left side horses on the right side. You know what horses circling the castle and then Everyone inside the castle is focused on the left side and the front side. On the right side, dudes climbing up ladders. Bang, 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 bang. They, they get roughly 50 troops inside the castle walls from the right side. And then everyone inside the castle realizes this, right? Uh, they're actually technologically advanced for this period. They have grenades. They throw grenades at the people coming in. They, the people that are coming in are blowing up from the grenades and they don't even know what's happening because grenades didn't exist back then, right? They're freaking the fuck out, man. They think it's wizardry and witchcraft. They start retreating down the ladders. They're going back down the ladders. One dude, turns out one dude that was in the army that pushed up the ladder is 93 years old, bro. He's elderly as fuck. The br people on brief side inside the castle take sympathy on that. They adopt him. And in this uh, world that we're living in, when you get adopted, you actually reset your age back to zero so this 93 year old man that was just fighting in a war is now a zero year old child he's a baby he gets picked up by one of the fair maidens in the town taken back to the main castle he's starting his life over again as as a zero year old child okay bang out of the taken out of the battle Turns out, all the people on the right side uh, that uh, had the letters are elderly. They're all elderly people, ranging from ages 80 to like 127, okay? Um, they, 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 they were running down the ladders, but they actually started running back up the ladders, hands in the air, doing the court emote, because they also want to be adopted. But... There was actually only one couple living within the castle walls that were looking to adopt a child. So... They get um, shot with crossbows, man. They're getting shot with crossbows. Someone threw uh, like oil on one of them and then threw a bunch of chicken feathers. But in this universe that we live in, if that happens to you, that's not actually a prank. It is actually a fucking spell that turns you into a chicken. So that guy gets turned into a chicken. And then everyone else in the, the civilians in the castle walls realize this and they don't normally fight or uh, partake in the wars, but there's actually been a famine recently and there's not a lot of food so every civilian in the castle walls pick up oil 
uh, sticky substances, glue, and chicken feathers. And they start throwing mass amounts of oil and chicken feathers at all these old people that just tried to take this castle. And you know, one of them had the bright idea of going to the front gate where there is a big group of enemies trying to get through the front gate and they throw massive amounts of oil and chicken feathers down there and they hit 50 people they turn 50 people into chickens man I'll finish the story another day thanks You want me to finish the story? Okay. Frodo Baggins comes out of nowhere, bro. Apparently, he's been living in a cave right behind the castle, dude. Frodo Baggins, and he has the ring. But in this universe, the ring, every single ring in this world, in this universe that I've created, has a duplicate there is a pair of every single ring and if two people wear the rings they immediately get married so if i have this one ring let's just say it's a 23 b and then someone else is also wearing the ring a 23 b if we both wear a 23 b we get married turns out frodo put this ring on guess who is the other part of the ring the king of the castle they now they're gay and they both have the castle and they um both do magic as well and they dr ride on rhinoceros dude they fucking start flying and shit and they actually are pacifists and they don't want to partake in the war at all so they leave man and they leave and they start another castle somewhere that's all about um chilling out and hanging out and stuff and they invent hash oil and they start smoking a shit ton of fucking weed and uh, uh, save the world. And that that town that they opened housed the first Guy Fieri restaurant in the world. And that town is called Flavor Town. Roll the credits. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun -dun -dun. The credits in this movie is the Halo theme. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun 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 you like it, guys? Do you think this person's VR has calibrated, it's messed up at some point, and they're sitting on their desk watching the stream, but it's calibrated in a way that them looking at their monitor is facing away from me? So they're technically looking at me right now, but they're facing away from me? Where did the person playing peekaboo go? When am I gonna play C Crusader Kings 3? What is that though? Twitter just like sh like gave me a notification to show me a Valkyrie tweet But for some reason I thought it was Valkyrie like interacting with one of my tweets and I was like what the fuck? Valkyrie's in the bus bro That's an incest simulator game? What, Crusader Kings? Hello, Jake. It's crazy. Isn't that like law accurate though? Like that's what they were doing back then, right? How do you get on the bus? The game is called um, 
there's a buzz vr and you have to uh just uh in the menu there's a red box you can crank on and you have to when you crank on it you have to hope it puts you in my bus yep dude how is it only been 10 fucking minutes i feel like that story i just told was like 30 minutes long no How has it only been 10 minutes, dude? I need to piss! Uh, how long is this drive? Eight hours? I'm not gonna recreate being a long haul bus driver that accurately. I'm not gonna piss in a bottle. Our trip might be a little bit over eight hours because we stopped for a second. Eight armies in Middle East, five armies in Afghanistan, and one army in Europe. We have attacked East Africa from Middle East with three armies. My story was better, bro. Can I open the window? I can't do anything! Uh, I can't even turn the fan on, dude! What has happened? We lost someone. We have three seats. Two seats. I need to know how the risk game ends. Wait, is that a risk game? Garth received three armies for occupying ten territories. Two armies for controlling South America. I need to pee so bad, actually. That ginger beer's gone straight through me, man. Quarantine We're almost at the created. bug hitting the screen, though. That's gonna, like, really change up the rest of the gameplay, I think. I think that will give me an enough excitement to keep going. Yo, Potty Pod's staying with the 22 months. He's not gonna make it? Nah, 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 nah. We're already halfway. Why would I give up now? You think I'm a coward? You think I'm cowardice? I got my phone in my hand. I can sit here all day, dude. I need to pee, dude. I need to pee so bad. Fuck, but if I pull over, it's totally gonna kill the run. Why don't I- I shouldn't have talked about pissing or like even acknowledged it as a sense my body is feeling because it's gonna just keep manifesting now. There are achievements for idling the bus for several hours, so as long as the bus is completely still, you should be fine. Really? Just pee yourself? No judgment? If any stream I was gonna piss myself, now would be the one, dude. Yo, overclocked pixel, thank you for the gifts up the pee toilet. <sighs> if I play with the doll for an hour, that's a lot of time knocked off. Maybe if we count down from like a thousand. One thousand, nine hundred ninety-nine, nine hundred ninety-eight, nine hundred ninety-seven, nine hundred ninety-six, nine hundred ninety-five, nine hundred ninety-four, nine hundred ninety-three, nine hundred ninety-two, nine hundred ninety-one, nine hundred ninety, nine hundred eighty-nine, 
I'm bored. Turn 20. Leon. Leon received four armies for occupying 12 territories and seven armies for controlling Asia. Leon placed 11 armies in Siam. Leon attacked Indonesia from Siam with three armies. Garth defended with two armies. I need to piss. If the game ends while I'm gone, fuck my shit life. My life is ruined. created this is our chance to escape everyone off the bus I think that was very important because now I have no, I have no, nothing in my mind distracting me. Well, in a bad way, because oh, when I needed to pee, all I could think about was I need to pee. I can't, I need to hurry up. This needs to go as fast as possible. I need to piss. But now that's not a worry I have because I don't need to pee anymore. I also got four creamy cheese wedges, so I have snacks for the trip, dude. Yes, I'm eating them with my hands, and no, I didn't wash my hands. But also, I don't piss on my fingers, bro. Like, be real. Be fucking real with yourself. Passenger check-in. Getting a bit quiet back there. Hey! Dude, the five-head play would have been me just like joining someone else's game and pretend I'm playing. 
Right? Pull up a script of your favorite movie and read it? Should I read a movie script? I'm trying to eat cheese with one hand, dude. This one has an odd crumb in it. Read the B-movie script? Should I? How long is the B-movie? I don't think I want to do that. Should read a menu, it's longer. Cheesecake factory menu? Is that fucking real? Is Cheesecake factory menu actually... Is it 5,000 words long or 5,000 items long? What is on the menu, bro? Like, what are they putting on it? At that point... That'd be better off having a menu, like, that is just that you open it and it says, just tell us what you want and we'll try. Like, just put fucking every, like... Have no limitations on it. Like, oh, someone came in, they asked for lobster, they got crab. Whatever, they tried. Cheesecake, they tried. Sloth, thing for the 44 months? Did they have good food? I doubt it. There's no way if something has that many items, th the food's con like good. Because that shit's probably old as fuck, right? Like all the food, they, all the ingredients are probably so old. Fuck, I finished all of my cheese. No, I thought Cheesecake Factory was literally just like a dessert restaurant. Be like, oh, I want to, I want a little bit of cheesecake right now, bro. Maybe with some ice cream. But apparently not. What cheese? Uh, off-brand laughing cow cheese. Key lime pie? Yeah, like I wanted some key lime pie. Okay, great. We'll go to Cheesecake Factory. Oh, I want like pancakes, but I want the pancakes to be out of uh, made out of waffle mixtures. Okay, we'll go to the Cheesecake Factory, dude. Mumsy's home, guys. Mumsy's home. Big day. If you want cr cr crawfish gumbo and your buddy wants curry, you go to there? Wait, do they- do they actually do like curries and shit? Let me google the Cheesecake Factory menu. I'm curious, man. Is Cake factory I this shit better look good because I literally have a friend that I swear used to like praise the fuck out of this menu I mean not the menu they used to say they love cheesecake factory so if this menu sucks I'm gonna like rethink everything dude okay they do avocado tacos that sounds nice right skinny licious avocado tacos okay what's the difference bro crispy crab bite crab wonton thai chili shrimp warm crab dip house made meatballs chili crunch shrimp petite fillet breakfast kimchi fried rice and eggs brunch flatbread little house salad sweet corn chicken taquitos korean fried cauliflower avocado tacos Stuffed mushrooms, crispy Brussels sprouts, beaten avocado salad, cheeseburger spring rolls. That doesn't fucking end! Okay, we're at the appetizers, dude. Roadside sliders. Okay, that sounds nice. Chicken pot stickers. Tex-Mex egg rolls, quesadilla, avocado egg rolls, warm crab dip, spicy tuna. Doesn't fucking end, dude. Fried macaroni and cheese as an appetizer? Okay, we can skip the solids. They literally 
out of everything they have bro they have three solids are you kidding me they have three solids they've got like 27 appetizers but three solids they have flatbread pizzas and i know they have normal pizzas too i guarantee it bee sting flatbread pizza they have some shit called glam burgers, dude. What the fuck is a glam burger, man? French dip cheeseburger. Americana cheeseburger. Macaroni and cheeseburger. Oh, they have an impossible burger. And a veggie burger. And they've got sandwiches. Wait, they have a second... Wait, they have a second solids category. Wait, with way more... They have so many... No, not that many. They have more solids, though. Lunch favorites? Oh, they have the super solid, dude. Orange chicken? Specialties. Ooh. Specialties. They have something called chicken littles. <laughs> Shepherd's pie, mid, mid. Oh, they got pasta though. Dang, they really do have a lot of shit, huh? Miso salmon. They've got steaks as well. All oh, their the sides. You can get a side of just green beans. Did you guys just hear that, or was that my own head? I literally just heard like exploding head syndrome in my head But like it was through my headset It was a mad moon bro <sighs> I've only ever eaten at one American diner and it was BJ's And I gotta say if you feel like being a piece of shit that eats like 50,000 things in one sitting BJ's is great, bro. I love the BJ's because you just buy Wait, their menu is massive too, though You just buy like seven things and you eat all of it. I did try a bazooki. Yeah, the bazooki was really good I also ate it um cracker barrel cracker barrel is pretty good, too. The bartender at BJ's took my keys and the cops had to drive me home. <laughs> oh, was it on the menu? Now nah, BJ's was good. I would go back to BJ's. And Pazookies are like... Pazookies sound crazy, but like they're good, bro. They're good. You can't deny it. A fucking pizza that's the size of... I mean, a cookie that's the size of a pizza? With ice cream on it? What the fuck? That's like every kid's dream, man. That's every kid's dream. Am I gonna have arthritis after playing this game? Or carpal tunnel? Mm -mm -mm. BJ's is Costco? Wait, are they owned by the same place? How do I turn my lights on? That's becoming a concern. Because, like, imagine what this game's gonna be like if we can see even less. BJ's is blowjobs? No fucking shot. What the hell? No lights is mad moon. We're gonna actually like run. <gasps> Wait, we're gonna get we're gonna hit a bug soon. We're gonna hit a bug, dude. Terms above regarding any applicable moral rights survive any termination of this agreement and shall endure. I never. I, I didn't have Costco near me, but I had BJ's. Same thing. Sam's Club is, Club is also like them. Oh, BJ's is also like a, a wholesale store. Wholesale pricing. Sam's Club. 
Ah, I see. Is the BJ's restaurant like popular? Over there? Or are they kind of rare? Dude, when I was uh when I was in Houston Airport, I love flying to and from New Zealand. Well, okay, I don't love doing it. It's actually fucking miserable. But the w one of the bonuses you get is the uh, terminal, like the the gate that you always have to board at, is always so far away from every other gate. Cause like, I don't know, they just push it like so far away. So you're normally at like a really quiet part of the airport. And when I was flying out of Houston, I was in a really quiet part of the airport. And uh, I, okay, first off, I took my shoes off and I had my feet out <laughs> for a little bit, but that was because my toes hurt and there was no one else around. And then after I put my shoes back on, there was a bar that I went to and I got a chicken bowl, a queso chicken bowl. Holy fuck, man. I watched them cook that in the microwave in the back, but it was actually so fucking good. I don't care. That shit was so yummy. But my shoes were back on for that. I, I had my shoes back on. And then I drank a couple Modellos. Oof! That cost me like a, probably $300. Toes out of the airport eating microwave airport food. Dude, I remember that I was at the gate so early. Man, coming back from Mexico sucked so bad. Because Apollo and I had to get to the airport early in Cancun for Apollo to go home. So I had to wait by myself at that airport for like an hour. And then flew to Houston where I had to wait like fucking four hours or some shit. Uh, and I remember during that four hours, Ryan was, he mentioned his strategy on flights. We buy bags of chips. So, and this was after I drank at the bar. So I was a little drunk and I just remember like an hour before my flight, walking around a little drunk, buying like as many chips as I can. Just finished the 800 piece Lego set and it's only 10 centimeters tall. What the hell? That's not very tall. Did you miss a couple hundred pieces? What happened? 10 centimeters is enough. Yep. Okay, where's the bug? We've been- we've been playing for four hours waiting for this moment, dude. Imagine if it played like the scariest jump scare in the world. Where is it? Hello? What? Property and permit are governed by this agreement. You must comply with the software store terms of service and any other software store applicable rules or policy. Where's the bug? Where is the bug? Oh my god, someone in the back fell asleep, dude. They fucking fall asleep, man. Wait, do you think they actually fall asleep at the desk? Oh, 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 they, they did. They fall asleep at the desk. <laughs> <laughs> They're having a little nap, man. Well. Okay, if it's based off miles and not hours, we should hit it in like two or three minutes, because that's probably how long I was AFK. Oh, oh. 
or your home country, including country that may have lower standards of privacy protection. To the public display of your data, such as identification of your user-created content, or displaying your scores, ranking achievements, and other gameplay data on websites. Who's your favorite passenger? I do, I do like the person in VR. I think they're quite funny, but this person has been so committed at nodding at every single thing I say. But they're also very energetic. Like, I feel like, you know, they, they spin around a lot. They can't keep still, you know? Oh, maybe it's their twin in them that's the one that can't keep still. That person is in the, they're just chilling in the back there, you know, they're keeping it themselves They're making sure they don't eat anything too stinky in the bus They're not yelling anything out at the bus driver, you know, they're kind of relaxing VR Andy's quite chill I don't know. I can't pick a favorite. They're all my favorites. They all have such distinct personalities, you know? Should I see how close I can get to the edge of the road? No! Oh! Ah! No! You were my fair. Oh, just kidding. You're there. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. 69 bottles of beer on the wall. 69 bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. 68 bottles of beer on the wall. 68 bottles of beer on the wall. 68 bottles of beer. Pass one down. Take it around. 67 bottles of beer on the wall. 67 bottles of beer on the wall. 67 bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. 66 bottles of beer on the wall. 66 bottles of beer on the wall, 66 bottles of it, take one down, pass it around, 65 bottles of beer on the wall. Okay, we did another five. We're not on good pace to complete the song by the end of the eight hours though. Have you ever stolen anything? Uh, I stole a Sharpie from my school one time and I got really scared. Also, I stole a bottle of uh, like a, a Alcoholic beverage from a house party at my house once But I was too afraid to drink it because I thought getting drunk was gonna kill me So I didn't drink it and then I like hit it amongst all the other alcohol again Because I, I don't know I thought drinking would like really hurt for some reason. Where's the bug man? Dude, this would have been way easier if I was drinking alcohol. <gasps> Wait, I've got alcohol downstairs. No, I'm not gonna do that. I'll never drink on stream ever again, dude. Oh! Lights! It's so sad that that was so exciting, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Whoa! Lights, bro! Wait, that's fucking awesome, dude. What in chat if you Me doing one in chat cuz I don't know if I have like um 50 viewers or uh, like 500 Okay, this is more than 50 people 20k? Matt! 36? I would believe it. Do I watch TikTok? Kinda, but I started, um... I started reading books at the time that I would, I'd go on TikTok, aka right before I went to sleep, I started reading a book instead. Because I started, I'm on my knowledge maxing arc. I'm trying to get knowledge maxed. And, and, um... Smart pilled. So I stopped consuming as much TikTok. I still do consume it, but like not that much. I'm really trying to be smart in 2024, dude. I'm gonna learn all about absolute values. I already learned about absolute values. I'm already smarter than I was coming into this year. 
I do think absolute values are fucking bullshit, but like I now know how they work, probably. I'm reminded. No wonder you have the attention span to drive a bus for eight hours straight. I actually play this game off stream all, like all the time. This is gonna be like my third run. This is what I play every day after stream, guys. You wanna know what I do when I'm not streaming? It's this. Where is the fucking bug, though? What's my record? F five and a half hours? Dude, the first per person to ever play this game... Do you think they know that it takes eight hours? Or do you think the first person to ever play this game was like, what is happening, bro? Is this it? This is all the game's got? And then when they got to the end, they're like, oh. Wait, you can see the moon. Oh, never mind. That is like something on my monitor. It's like a perfectly circular smudge on my monitor that like reflects the light in my window. It looks like a moon. This should be a torture method. I saw a New York Times article that said this is the worst game ever made. Wait, am I playing the worst game ever right now? <gasps> the bus has lights in it, dude. No shot. Wicked. I think the worst part is the bus keeps cycling audio like it goes like I wish it was just like like a hum like a, a single hum dude Ninety nine bottles of beer on the wall. Sixty five bottles of beer. Take one down. Buzz around. Sixty four bottles of beer on the wall. We got Sonic or Mario guy when they were in the Olympics. I'm gonna say, uh, did they have a shadow or whatever that one guy's called? The cool one. That's my guy. Sorry, I zoned out for a second. I thought this was the long drive. Is this better or worse than that, chat? Chat, answer truthfully. Worse, worse, better, worse. Long drive is funnier. What is the long drive? Definitely worse. Yeah, but in the long drive, can you get people sitting in the back seat? This is more chill. This is not meant to be chill. This is meant to be riveting content. This is meant to be one of the most exciting game. Oh, exciting games I've ever streamed. Oh, I played the long. Oh, was the long drive the one where it's like German 995 here and then he crashes the car. I kind of wanted to play that again recently. Have they updated it a lot since I last played it? How long did I play it ago? Like a year or two? If you think this stream game, if you think this game is boring, you have to look at it in a, in a different light. You know, this isn't a game. This is a piece of art this is this is you're meant to look at it from the from the from the intellectual standpoint and realize that this is a test of mental endurance and psychological perception of 
how our brains process mundane tasks. And see, look, I'm not even banging my head against the wall. Passengers are losing their goddamn mind, bro. Not even been here for four hours. I wish I could see everyone's names. Like, I want to know who's who. How do I get on the bus? Um, it's in the main menu of the game. The game's called Desert Bus VR. It's only four people though, for some reason. Imagine if we could have like a hundred people in this shit, dude. Where's the fucking bug, man? Was the bug a lie? Was the bug actually just a troll? I missed the bug. Can you say you, that the bug is six hours? No shot, man. No shot! Uh, the dude at the start said four! The bug is at hour six? You know, I'm kind of impressed with myself. I feel like I've been relatively entertaining, maybe, this entire time. We haven't had too much, um... Too much silence, you know? Like I'm upholding a pretty good, pretty good conversation. <laughs> oh, this is just a streamer's test, man. This is how you should get your. They should do this to be Twitch partner, bro. If you can hold the conversation for the entire eight hours, they partner you on Twitch. And if you can't, affiliate. This is how they give out the seventy thirty split from now on. What's our mileage? Wait, isn't the whole trip only 370 something miles? How are we at 300? How do I read that? Is that 299? I left work and you were doing this and I haven't, I, and I have walked a mile home, done chores, made dinner, ate dinner, and then here you are, you are my rock. It's 2K? The trip is not. 2,000 miles long. Are you lying to me? Or does that say 2,000? Wait, how long is this fucking trip, dude? How long is Tucson to Vegas? It's at 2 miles? No, I'm going 45 miles an hour! My husband and I watched you while eating dinner. Okay, what'd you eat for dinner? What the hell? Can I have a plate? I hope it was good. We're not gonna tell me to shift out of first gear. Oh no, is there gears in this game? And I've been doing it wrong this entire time. I pressed every key on my keyboard and none of it works. I think you're lying. Korean fried chicken, what the hell? That sounds good as fuck. It would be so funny if you're going at half speed and nobody knew. Chib, I think I saw you at a Walmart in Ohio. Well, yeah, that probably was me. I was at a Walmart in Ohio today. What's up, Rogue? No, yeah, I definitely was at a Walmart in Ohio. What if you did this as your GTA RP gimmick? What, I just drive a bus for eight hours a day? I log on to the server, drive a good bus for eight hours, and then log off? No RP? Just sitting in the bus? Now, yeah, I could do that. I like the parasocial barista RP more. You don't like glass bones and paper skin RP? Every morning I wake up. 
When I get out of bed, I break 17 pounds. Why not? I couldn't keep up that voice. Fuck that, dude. I think if I was to do that character, it would have to be like, oh, every morning I wake up. Every morning when I wake up. What does the dude even say? I was born with glass bones and paper skin. Every morning I wake up, I break my legs, and every afternoon I break my arms. At night I lie awake in agony until my heart attacks put me to sleep. <laughs> Day one. Vivek Ramaswamy. Nah, dude, easy, bro. That was my audition reel just then. Is that a TikTok reference? As a reference to in SpongeBob, there is a fish. There's a fish and it, he's fucked. He's uh he's a fish that's like uh he's got glass bones and paper skin. Is there a bathroom in the back of the bus or is everyone fending for themselves? Yeah, no one in this bus has gone bathroom. Oh wait, there's two people asleep now. Wait, well I guess there's only one asleep right now, but... Well, I, I think everyone's asleep, honestly. I think they're asleep. I think one of the twins has been AFK for like an hour, I'm not gonna lie. I've not seen both of them moving in so long. Only one of them moves. See, look, that one day, that one's awake. They're asleep. They're awake. They had a good nap, though. Yeah, it's because I'm such a nice, relaxing driver. People can find peace in it and go to sleep. 99 bottles of beer on the wall, 99 bottles of beer, take one down, pass it around, Darn it, a bottles of beer on the wall. Am I winning, son? I think I'm on pretty good pace right now. I can't lie. I think we're on pretty good pace, dude. I don't think we're on world record pace though. We stopped a little bit. We stopped a couple times. The bus's hair moves so slow. If I miss the bus, I can still catch it by jogging to the... You can run 45 miles an hour? ADGQ for this probably goes so hard. <laughs> Wait, hang on, guys. We're at hour 420. Wait, I should get on Spotify and I should find a road trip playlist. Wait, I'm gonna do my- BUG! 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 FUCK YES! Wait, I'm gonna do one of my favorite things ever. I'm gonna do one of my favorite things ever. I'm gonna go on Spotify and I'm gonna search. TwitchCon road trip playlist because people don't realize when they make a playlist they're public and so many people make TwitchCon road trip playlists and they're just fucking they're just public bro Alex no okay um 
What about... Okay, uh... No, there's a bunch of podcasts. Um... What about... What about, uh, this playlist? He's in your bed, I'm in your Twitch chat. No. The first song was by Wilbur, dude. What about, um... Dude, there's like, there's not... Where, where's all the playlists gone, man? Dude, there used to be so many TwitchCon wrote... Or TwitchCon... Maybe TwitchCon? I'm gonna search TwitchCon 2022. TwitchCon 2022. Oh, 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 I found a playlist. Okay, this is someone's TwitchCon 2022 playlist. Actually, that scares me. I don't want to listen to that. It was scary. How do I filter just my playlists? Oh, oh, I found it. Whoa, 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 whoa. What about, um... Man, they're just all playlists to play on stream. No, no, I want someone's beautiful experience laid out into a playlist. Two thousand and nineteen nostalgic playlist. Okay, let's listen to the 2019, 2020, 2021 nostalgia playlist. What was nostalgic for um three years ago? Tame Impala. I'm so nostalgic right now, man. I'm so nostalgic, bro! Oh, remember the good days, man! Remember those good days? Feels like it was just, you know, a five, a five years ago. Okay, what is the next song? Next song, next song. Pretty Dread. <laughs> Pretty Dread, dude. I'm so nostalgic right now, bro. Oh. <laughs> Doja Cat? The song's just called Dick. More Doja Cat? <laughs> no, it closed. I'm so nostalgic, bro. Oh, man, this is hitting me right in the feels, bro. All Town Road. This is hitting me in the feels, bro. I love this nostalgia playlist. Anybody tell me nothing and tell me nothing. Can nobody tell me nothing? Can't tell me nothing. They're doing UPA. Hey, hey, hey. Oh shit, they're gonna get, give themselves a concussion, dude. They're gonna get a concussion. Wait, hit the Gangnam style. Hit the Gangnam style. Hey, hey. <laughs> They're doing the emo! They're doing the emo! I'm so nostalgic right now, bro! <laughs> okay, what's the next song in this 2019 nostalgia flip? Did, where'd they go? Oh, they fell over. 
My Spotify app keeps crashing. Why does it keep crashing? Oh my god. <laughs> ah! Polaroid, have you dancing in my room? I want to remember. I think it was about noon. It's getting harder to understand, to understand how you found in my head, in my hands. I could be a pretty girl, wear a dress for you. I could be a pretty girl. When you want me to I could be your pretty girl I could be your pretty girl That's how I am I'm so Oh, they're pranking him! They're pranking him, dude! Tickle his nose! Tickle his nose! Where do you think they went? Do you think they died in real life? I hope not. I saw an article that says daily multivitamin, multivitamin use may actually slow memory loss. What the fuck? Should I take a fifth one? I'm never gonna forget anything, dude. Wait, if you're in the bus and you're AFK and you can hear me, can you leave? So we can get more people. They just left the game open, dude. Maybe they're cooking dinner. I shouldn't have taken the multivitamin, man. My head hurts. Okay, what's another thing I can search up on Spotify? What about... German 905. German 905 playlist. Playlists. What about, um... What about Zerkin it with German MCA, what the fuck? Wait, VR is awesome, man. VR is fucking awesome, bro. If I had no passengers in my bus, I would have absolutely no content right now. I would have nothing, bro. Okay, what what else is in the playlist of uh, titled "Zerking It with German Nine Five? I didn't make this playlist, nor do I endorse it. I'm just getting curious. The rest of the songs are just normal, bro. Yeah. 
back to him. No more music. We have to not distract ourselves from what's important. If I could collab with any streamer, who would it be? I don't know. The collabs come and they come, you know? If if a collab, if there is a ever hypothetical collab that hasn't happened yet, maybe it's not meant to be. But if a collab does happen, it was meant to be. Maybe, uh, maybe Northern Lion. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll play a game with Northern Lion one day. He is one of my favorite streamers. I watch Northern Lion streams every morning. I love him. Now that guy is weird. Oh, what did he do? Squeaks collab win. Whenever he stops RPing, dude. He needs to beat his addiction. Joel collab win. My... Okay, here is some Chibli lore, okay? The... The YouTubing... Founding fathers to the Chibli consuming gaming content on the internet. What the fuck am I saying, bro? The first people I ever started watching on YouTube were... Vinny, Joel, and Kriken. Those three. I think... Oh, and uh... No, that was later. But those three... In my head, are like... They're just the goats, bro. Those three are the goats, man. And I did watch Joma, but like later on. Joma was a bit later on. I didn't watch Jer Like Kraken? I was watching Kraken like... Fucking forever ago, dude. When he was playing, like, what's that one zombie game with Sam B? Dead Island? Yeah, Dead Island days? I think that's probably around when I started watching. Why is this bus so slow? I think it only has, um, like a two-cylinder engine. And then I've met Kraken twice, but I embarrassed myself to both times. I've em I embarrassed myself both times, which is so unfortunate. <laughs> because the first time, the first time was before I was a streamer, and I was like, "I love you, I love you so much, like, I fucking love you, Kraken. Like, I'm freaking out right now, man. Like, oh my god!" And then the second time was uh after i became a streamer but i was drunk and i was like i'm a fucking streamer now man <laughs> and i was like oh man he thinks i'm like a social climbing bro oh but revert back to my theory about social anxiety does he remember either of those probably not probably not no need to be anxious about it no need to beat myself up over he probably doesn't remember me I think the funniest fucking thing you guys know KYL Speedy KYL Speedy is uh, another one of the youtubers I watched way back in the day when I was real young and I watched him during my dying era like my actual human dying era and I remember I messaged Speedy bro I said damn a YouTube message and I was like, I'm so sick. <laughs> Help, man. I'm fucking, like, dying, bro. But I love your videos. Thank you so much for every video you make, man. I watch all of them. And he actually replied. He was so sweet. He was like, oh, thank you for watching. But I think it was so funny. Me as a little kid being like, I'm dying, but I love you. <laughs> 
I just I love your video. Uh, uh, it hurts to type this. Uh, I love the videos. It's a dramatic. Yep, for sure. I feel like the bus has got slower. Am I crazy? It's still saying 45. Can I use the wheel? I don't know. Maybe I should have tried. I'm surprised I've been holding W this entire time. Nope. Oopsies. Did he ever finish 99 bottles? Nah, nah, we're giving it a little bit of a rest. We're giving it a little bit of a rest. We'll come back to it though. What are the OG YouTubers that I watch? I don't know. Not a lot. Besides like... Ah! I used to watch all the family vloggers. Seen on Nanners. Yeah, I watched a bit of C Nanners. Written link. I did have a written link phase for about a year. My favorite uh, vlog channel was BF vs GF. I loved them, bro. I loved them. I wanted to be like them. And Shay Carl, yeah. And CTFXC, yes, them also. That was my nightly rotation, was those three channels. I remember every single night before I went to bed or stayed up for a late epic gaming sesh, I would go downstairs at like 11 p.m. or midnight and I would make a cup of, um, of English breakfast tea at midnight and I would get a little snack and then I would watch all three of their daily uploads, bro. Oh, it was so cutie pie. It was so pookie pie. It was so cute having a little nightly routine I had watching all of their daily vlogs. What else did I used to? I used to watch a lot of Frankie on PC when he played DayZ all the time, like DayZ mod. BFV's GF was so funny because they were together for seven years, then broke up. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, why is that funny? <laughs> oh. 2009 was 15 years ago? No. No, it wasn't. The old people get nostalgic for like the 70s. That is so funny. I mean, so sad. Can you swerve off the road? Kitten. Getting around. 2020 was 24 years ago. Ooh, it's so fucked up to think in 15 years, 2024 is gonna be 15 years ago, bro. Yuck! Man, what is life gonna be like in 2035, you reckon? What the fuck? You think we're gonna have flying cars yet? What do you think more vehicles are gonna look like the Tesla Cybertruck? Warm? Content created. Yo! Colin, thank you for the prime. Welcome in. Chat, I'm not gonna tell you what to do, but it is it is a brand new prime. What do we normally do? What do we normally do on there, guys? What do we normally do? Remember your lessons. Oh, there you go. There you go. Blue Lobster! Do you think humans are getting bolder? Do you think balding is more common now than it was forever ago when there wasn't microplastics and chemicals in the air? 
Dude! And headsets, man. Creative. Yo, John Lynn, thank you for the brand new Prime. Welcome, thank you so much. You're not balding, you're just global warming proof. Wait, true, I'm living proof of evolution, man. Cause I'm, my body is evolving to counteract global warming. Cause hair on your head warms you up. And if the world is getting warmer, I'm evolving past. I'm evolving past that, man. I'm human too. I'm human 2.0. What the fuck? I'm chilling. Yeah, I'm climate maxing. Bro, such an NL fan. He started balding. <laughs> Dude, my dad must have been such a big NL fan then. What the fuck? It's so funny to think someone denying climate change. You just show them a picture of a bald guy and you say, explain this. Explain this. Well, um... They just faint. Can we get a head check? Hang on, I'm taking a little sip of water. I'm so happy to hear you fix your stereo sound. I have learned that there is another issue with how my audio is set up now though. Every like... I'm really glad you guys can't hear it. Every, um, I don't know, I want to say 10 to 15 minutes, a really loud noise will just play in my headset. And I, I've, I, I know it's not exploding head syndrome. There's just a really loud noise that goes like, <laughs> and I'm like, oh, that's nice. Content created. Yo, Jurassic Seahorse, thank you for the Prime. Thank you so much. I feel so special. You did miss the bug on the windscreen, yep. Unfortunate. The only content this game- Oh, oh, it's been so long! The remainder scattered before more could be killed due to the loud sounds of the machine gun. No more birds were seen for the rest of that day and the battle failed to achieve its desired outcome of the slaughter of Um, me, 1,000 birds. Is it the emu the war? Followed, there were limited access to the birds and found it difficult to near them to the distance. What was the was emu war wide. actually? Like emus just started attacking people? Six days after the first engagement, there had been 2,500 rounds of the 10,000 rounds of ammunition spent but the number of birds killed was likely to be less than 50 birds didn't Australia lose the war against the emus the settlers were also attacking birds at this time they had managed to obtain Content around 200 yo Luke Kin thank you for the two However, months thank you both army and the settlers suffered severe casualties due to the obscene violence of these native Australian birds. Dominic Cerventri, an ornithologist. It's a literally, it's illegal to kill a native bird. Well, I guess it probably applies everywhere, right? Like you can't kill a bald eagle in America, you'll probably get in trouble. Wait, can you just kill emus in Australia though? What the fuck? That's fucked up, dude. Guys, I'm gonna get tired. You can't kill swans in the UK? Wait, is swan the UK's native bird?
What's the time? It's 3 p.m. Oh, bro, it's my nap time. It's the queen's favorite bird. I got bad news about the queen, bro. The queen owns all the swans. I got bad news about the queen, dude. Do you think someone who really likes Lizzo got really scared the day the queen died because they misread someone saying Lizzie and they thought they said Lizzo and they fucking like freaked out like crazy for like five minutes? <laughs> they threw their iPhone across the room. They're like, no! And then they're like, oh, wait, never mind. Queen Elizabeth, my bad. I think the bus driver should keep the day job. Dude, there is a place by me. Every time I go out grocery shopping, I, it, I see it every time. There's a bunch of bus stops in one area, and then there is one porta potty, and all the bus drivers use this one porta potty, dude. I see it every time. There's always like a line of like four buses, and one of them's always taking a poop. And then I always, I kind of feel bad because I'm like, shit, man. They don't even got somewhere to shit, dude. They're gonna, they use this straight porta potty, man. Give them like a like a bus house. So I'll see. Oh my god! I just did the exploding head sound. It's so fucking scary. It's so scary. I need to keep myself entertained for two minutes. Is there oncoming traffic? Nope. What you see right now is the entire game. Pause to check, guys. What is your favorite smiley emote to use in casual conversation? I do like colon D. I like colon D, but I also just like colon smiley, the normal one. But I've 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 thrown some colon D's into a couple conversations in my life. What's my favorite bone in the body? Probably. Ooh, maybe like my femur. My femur or something like like done like something big. Like a big bone? I think they're really cool. My cock. <laughs> uh -oh. Just fucking kidding. What the hell? How long's your femur? I don't know. <laughs> It's really big though, right? Maybe my hip. Is the hip one bone? Hip bone? Like the... What's that one bone that's your hips? That one's pretty cool because it's massive, bro. Maybe yeah, my pelvis. Hotline bling. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. one thing. Mm 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 help what the hell is Gandalf big naturals it is a, uh, it's my letterbox profile picture. It's Gandalf. Uh, but... For you to know what it is, you'll have to know what big naturals mean. Do you know what big naturals mean? It's Gandalf with big naturals. Chad, I'm starting to lose my mind.
Uber? Yes. Gandalf the Grey with big old titties. Only three more hours? Hey, I mean, we made it over halfway. That's pretty good. I mean, I could stop. I'm high as fuck. Tell me why I have a Wikipedia page for swans open. <laughs> we were talking about swans uh, not long ago. Don't worry. You're not losing your mind. It was. It had good reason behind it. Yeah, the queen liked eating them. Content created. Yo, bunny duck. Thing with a prime. Thank you so much. What happens if you park the bus? You can park it for like a couple of minutes, like for or like a while. Like if you stop driving, you can just like come back. You can go AFK for a little bit and then come back. Stop it. So loud. Stop it. 1-800 Hotline Blink. You know, you don't think. Can I roll my Oz? I can roll them, but I can't roll them in words. Unless I'm saying, like, what do you mean? Sometimes I say, like, what do you mean? Or some shit. I don't know, bro. Crazy like that. Crazy like that. <sighs> Hurry up! Go faster, you piece of shit! Not you, sorry. What's two minus eight? Six. Apparently, for some fucking reason, it's six. I have no fucking clue why, but apparently it's six. And assuming each crime is committed by a different person. That makes the probability of committing a crime 0 0.37. Why is the radio so grim lately? We listened to it earlier, it was about war. We listened to it after that, it was about war. We listened to it now, it's about murdering people. But since we use such a loose definition as violence and entertainment to give us the 1.0 content creator. Yo, Enots. Thank you so much for the brand new tier one. Thank you. Thank you. Chibli mention Pog crazy? I can't tab out. Shit. I missed the bug hitting the windscreen. Yep, the best content the game has offered yet, and you missed it. What the hell? Actually, how would I tear list? I think I would tear list the lights turning on more exciting than being the bug on the windscreen. I'm not gonna lie. I think the lights turning on was a was a, a more pog moment. Please read this article on basic maths. Nah, I don't need to. I already know everything. Can you please pog maxing? Maybe these people left the game without leaving the lobby and it's just, they've just frozen them in time forever, right? Maybe it just froze them in time. Oh, they're back! Wait, what the fuck? They're back! They're like, how the fuck did I get here, bro? <laughs> oh! Okay, add that to the list of pug moments. You guys on a date or... Bit of an odd first date, I reckon. Do I own any makeup? I do not. I do own skincare that kind of is like concealer, but like not really. 
It's a skincare product that turns, like, match it changes color. Wait, is concealer what you use for small, t like small cover-ups? Or is it? No, that's not foundation. Foundation's the whole face, right? Well, a lot of it. I know makeup guys. Yeah, I have a skincare thing that's kind of like concealer, but I don't like it because it doesn't really match my skin tone. Also, it gets like dry. I think it's called like Dr. Jot something. Yeah, it's seek a pair. Almost six hours, guys. Would I ever paint my nails? Probably not. Maybe like a clear coat. Maybe though. Almost five hours, not six. Yeah, but five hours is almost six. So almost five, you you can't lie, is almost six, right? Basic maths. I read the Wikipedia article. Because five is just one away from six. Is there, um... What is the smallest measurement of time? Is there, like, nanoseconds? Like, is there, like... A hundred of something? It's called a plank? What is that? A picosecond? What is that? How many... How many... Do they use picoseconds in anything? Named after the scientist who calculated it or found it? What did he do? Did he just go like... What? And then he was like, that wasn't even a second long. I don't even think that was a millisecond long. I'm gonna say... That was a picosecond. That's a Chip Lee second, dude. How many things do you reckon got invented because some dude just did something wrong and then people are like, you did that wrong. And he's like, and then the dude that invented it was like, actually, no, I did it right. It's just something that I made up right now. Like there was, there was some dude was like, well, that's not even a millisecond, bro. You just fucked it up. You, like, that's not even correct, and it's like, no, I meant to do it like that, it's new. It's a new thing I've just made. It's actually new right now. It just released. Oh, what do they call it? Um... Pico... Seconds? One picosecond, time taken by light and vacuum to travel, approximately... Wait, so how long is one picosecond? Picosecond's kind of cute, dude. I'm gonna start living my life in that. It's one picosecond long? Yeah, but like how many picoseconds is a millisecond, you know? One trillionth of a second. No fucking shot. Are you kidding me? Really? What the fuck? Okay, what is the t measurement of time under milliseconds? A microsecond? Okay, what's under a microsecond? A nano? Okay, what's under a nano, guys? We're learning so much right now as a collective, right? Or did you guys already all know this? Micro? So a hundred microseconds is one nanosecond? Dogma. What do you guys think?
It is crazy that this person has been in VR the entire time. My hands are getting so sore, man. Please read this Wikipedia article on unit conversion. <laughs> no. No. Instead, I'm going to listen to this song. Why is it coming through my phone? <sighs> Only three more hours. It's probably like three and a half more hours because I keep stomping. What if I just. Ooh, that felt good though. I, that felt good. I felt it. I felt it. That felt so fucking good, bro. It felt so good. That felt so good. I saw it in my eyes, man. I saw it fucking fail, dude. No, 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 no. <sighs> Just how far can I go? How far can I go over, though? How far can I go over? Like, when does it get, when does it, when do I get in trouble? feels so good man my heart drops every time bro it's like a little adrenaline rush man oh it's like a little fucking it makes you feel so alive dude can this bus just like fucking explode or something so i can call off sick Do we have a head count? I think we only have two real people at the moment. I think the other two, uh, I don't know. Maybe they fall asleep to the stream or something. I wish I could move seats. VR Andy definitely deserves like a front row seat. They deserve to be sitting up here, dude. Instead of all the way back there. 
Like, they could be dancing right up here, dude. Bro doesn't even have the attention span to drive eight hours through nothing. Honestly, I think watching this is harder than playing it. I think watching the stream is harder than playing it because, like, you know, at least I get the whole W, bro. <laughs> I get the whole W. You guys get to do what? Type Omega LOL and kick W? I get to play a game on my main monitor? Okay, true. I guess you get to do other stuff as well. God gives his hardest battles to his toughest Twitch viewers. Yup. You hear that? You guys are the toughest Twitch viewers. I can turn off the stream. Don't do- no, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. No, no. How long do you think I can ride on the shoulder before I get in trouble? I feel like I can go like a long- like 10 seconds, dude. Nah, you can sit on that forever, man. How close are you to just ending the stream at the last stop? Nah, not that close. What are the... Does anyone know what the prediction odds were? I can't let the believers down, right? I can tell Chad cycled a few viewers though, because there's only like two people typing that have prediction badges, bro. <laughs> it was 50-50? Oh wow, so like if I fail... Like 50% of the people are happy and if I f if I make it 50% of the people are happy like it's perfect Why did so many people believe have they never watched the Chibli stream? I was the dude that said I was gonna do 24 hours in Minecraft VR and I played it for like three and a half minutes Guys, I didn't even say I was gonna finish the game. I just, I said I'm tr getting my streamer rite of passage. That doesn't mean finishing it. This is my first Chibli stream. Wait, is this anyone else's first Chibli stream? What a great first stream. It really shows off everything I have to offer on twitch.tv, dude. Wait, what the fuck this actual first time chat is? Wait, no, come back next stream. I promise it will be different. If this is your first stream, make sure to come back next time as well, please. I bet it will be different. It will be different. <laughs> I'll change. I'll change. I promise. He's the number one Dizzy Bus streamer. He plays it all the time. It's all he plays. Would you guys get a microchip installed in your head if it made you really smart? And it had no risk? If everyone else is doing it, you're a sheep? Are you a sheep? What if... The way they installed it was like really painless. Like it was just like, it was like a piercing. <sighs> yeah, all dinner with Jay Z. All dinner with Jay Z. You know, guys, you can you can actually play this game without looking at it. You just wait until it rumbles and then you hold A until it rumbles again. For everyone doing the let's play along at home. Miles is not looking at the screen, bro. It's like real driving. Wait, is that real? Chip, do you think you could convince your friends that you saw Santa for real and now believe in his existence? Yes. I do. And like, they... Honestly... 
Mm, they would probably be like, oh my god. Wow, really? Just to be nice. I've got nice friends, you know, if I told them, if if they thought I was dead set on believing Santa is real, they would definitely just be like, oh, that's so nice. But like, I might convince one of them. Those aren't real friends. No, my friends have to keep me delusional. My friends have to keep me delusional. Are your friends five years old? No, they think Santa's real too. Jesus Christ, how far left did I go, bro? Did I almost just lose it? I can already tell this new strategy is gonna get me killed. Not looking at the screen is gonna get me in so much trouble. Happy to report that Fortnite Festival's songs are fun to play. Wait, what new songs did they add? What, what new ones? Are they good? The last songs they added were kind of like Resident Sleeper. They added Debussy? No shot, bro. Wait, cause I can't check, guys. Is Ludwig still trying to kickflip? Did he kickflip? He was being so cocky, bro. He was being so cocky. I was watching his stream where he was planning his like weakest streams and he's like, I mean, I think I can do it in one stream. Oh! I could see that he like he already could ollie, dude. That was kind of cool. Should I level rune crafting? You get ninety nine. Is there any deer you can hit in this? Maybe an elk. They need to make mods for this game, man. My fingers hurt so bad. Uh. Are you gonna drive back? Yeah, next stream, next stream I do is gonna be me driving all the way back, guys. Just to keep it nice and realistic, you know? I don't wanna break the immersion. I need to find out a way to hold down W. I'm gonna get back to figuring that out because that is actually gonna be life changing. If I can find a way to automatically hold down W, it would make the game so much easier. Nothing is heavy enough, dude. You need a lot of weight to push the- Oh, a spring. A spot is open. Oh! We have a seat! Oh wait, I think I got taken already. The person that fell asleep in the back had enough, dude. Hello, Spectacore. Hello. A Spectacore, you seem like someone that knows how to hold down a key on a keyboard automatically without your finger. Maybe I'll use my pocket knife, bro. That's kind of heavy. It's heavy. I, uh, I, I just almost lost it. I just almost lost it. Take off the keycap? Okay. Wait, I have a keycap puller somewhere. I can do that. Where is it though? I'm, I just have to rip it off with my fingers. I have to unplug my keyboard for this, though. Fuck. 
It didn't work. Um. What? What, guys? Why are we Monka? Why? Maybe I could use a ginger beer bottle. I have it perfectly balanced. I have it perfectly balanced. It's a bottle. It's a glass bottle upside down. Whoa! I fell over! Because I pressed the A key, dude. I'm gonna do it again. I, okay, I have it balanced again. I have it balanced again. And I can press A! Never mind. <laughs> What about like, uh... Ooh! Maybe I can, uh... Oh, I got an idea. I have an idea. I got like these toothpicks. If I jam a toothpick on the, like, one... And like, D... Right? Okay, I'm trying to jam the toothpick under the two key and the D key over the W key. So it can hold down W. Doesn't fucking fit, man. I'm running out of like props on my desk to try jam this shit down, man. I think the glass bottle is my best bet. Okay, I balanced the glass bottle again. And it's not on the A key at all, so I can press the A key just fine. This is the easiest game I've ever played. Okay, okay, it doesn't- okay, it's just on the W key. Man, this is perfect. It's literally 330 milliliter glass bottle upside down. I'm a fucking genius, man. My, my sense of balance is beautiful. I can find the center of gravity in anything. I could probably go AFK right now and it'd be fine. Should I grab this? Should I see if I can grab it and then drop it really quick? there for too long and exits the game man oh, I'm crazy nothing the broad view is a very simple piece a b a form a classical form you'll forgive me however 
The devil is in the details. And the gloss bottle's back. It fell over for a more, second. We'll discover that just underneath of that simplicity. It fell again. A treasure trove of I think we have to come up with another solution. Glass bottle doesn't work. What the fuck is heavy? Nothing is heavy enough. These are 68 gram switches, bro. I need something that's heavier than that and it's fucking like, like pinpointed weight. What is this? What's in this bag? Nothing. Coin? I don't own. Well, I guess I got American ones. Yeah, I'm going to go back to the toothpick. The toothpick is scary because I keep- I have to mess with the D key to like try jam it under. Come on! It's so close! I don't have any soda can tabs, guys. Hold W, unplug keyboard, steer with second keyboard. Wait, I do have two keyboards. Oh, <gasps> the toothpick! The toothpick worked! Dude, the toothpick is in, man. The toothpick is in, dude. Holy, it fucking worked, bro. Wait, add that to the list of Pog moments, man. Timestamp that in the VOD comments, dude. Yay! Okay, now for a rush of adrenaline, I'm gonna play looking only backwards. Just to keep myself, like, you know, energized. It's not that hard. It's not that hard. This is how real bus drivers do it, dude. You ever been told to sit back down in a bus? How do you think they knew? It wasn't- it's not because they have a mirror. It's because they- they turn around. The cute- the chat- the girl- Chat, the girl texted me the frick back. Woo! Exciting. Should be overcorrected to the opposite side of the road? At exactly six hours, the oncoming buses start? Wait, is that real? I would fucking believe it. Because at four and a half hours, there was a bug on the screen. Man, rumble strip sounds so good. <laughs> if they look perfectly at the right place, it looks like it's like a like funny face, bro. <laughs> Alright, that was good. Oh! Oh! Oh, what the fuck? They're playing basketball. Oh my god, they're both going. Almost five and a half hours, and I don't know if I can do it anymore, man. You have to. Life starts fresh when you realize you don't have to do anything in this life, bro.
Life. Just distract yourself by naming every type of tree you know. Oak, willow, acacia, birch, orange, apple, lemon, fijoa, mandarin, pine, great pine, yew, maple, uh magic uh uh redwood uh cedar oak uh um arctic pine um, mahogany uh uh, I mean, I feel like I'm doing pretty fucking good, dude. Are you kidding me? I feel like I did pretty good. Content created. Cully Rod saved me the 15 months? Are those just RuneScape trees? Some of them were, but some of them weren't. Name an animal for each letter of the alphabet. Okay. A. Antelope. B. Beaver. C. Crocodile. D. Duck. A, B, C, E. E, e elephant f fish g draw a b c d e f g h h hippo a b c d e f g h i iguana uh, uh, a b c d e f g h i j Draw, um, uh, uh, um, a jellyfish. A B C D E F G H I J K. Uh, K. A. Uh, Komodo dragon. A B C D E F G H I J K. L. M N O P. L L a lizard M M um, um, uh, uh, monkey M N N What about a um, yet yeah, narwhal? A B C M G H K L L M N O P penis L M N O O O orangutan penis A B C um Q uh a quail R uh a raven S uh is an S would be what about uh, stink bug? A B C D F G H I J K L M N O P Q R. Oh, did I miss all? Who is all? No, I missed all. No, I didn't. I got Raven. That's a bug. S. Santa's reindeers. A B C D F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S. T T T Triceratops A B C D F G A B C D F G H I J K L M N O Q R S T U U is would be us. We're animals. V would be a a Velociraptor or a Vulture, even. And then, what was the other ones? Happy birthday, Teeny! W would be a whale. Easy. X. Uh. Uh. 
Oh, Xenopod, bro? Is that a real thing? That sounds like a real fucking thing, bro. Like an isopod, but it's spelled Xeno instead. <laughs> Is there actually an animal that starts with X, though? A xenopod, yep. Why? Um. Oh, why? Why? What about like? A uh, uh, yellow. Yellow-footed booby! Yellow-footed tit or whatever the fuck they're called. I know they're normally blue-footed, but like, there's a yellow-footed one probably. And then Z? Wow, what an animal is Z? What about like... Z Z Zor... Azor, Azorin, Azorak, Azorb, Azorb, Az Z, 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 Oh, Zebra! Okay, I got it. I got one for every single one. Thank you for the nods of approval, uh, bus passengers. Wait, we have five people in the bus again. Okay, now an animal for every number in the number alphabet. One, okay, one fish, two fish, three fish, four fish, five fish, six fish, seven fish, eight fish, nine fish, ten fish. 11 fish 12 fish 13 fish 14 fish 15 fish 16 fish 17 fish Seventeen fish 18 fish 19 fish 20 fish Twenty-one fish, A to Z countries, Arizona, Barcelona, Chile, Denmark, uh, England, Finland. Uh Huh Is there a country that starts with G? Georgia Uh Haiti Ireland Japan Kuwait is that a country? Kazakhstan Lebanon Moldova Nigeria Um Oh, huh Oh, huh 
What about... Oh, huh? Omen? Oh, man? ABCDG, DHJK, Element, OP, P, Poland? Q? Q, huh? Qatar? Oh, true. Uh, Russia? Have you seen EFG, HHJK, Element, QR, S, S? Uh... Good Donna place? Slovenia, Slovakia, Spain, Switzerland, Sri Lanka, ABCD, MT, HHJK, Element, QRS, T, T, um. Man, I fell off doing this game, bro. T. I want to try to figure it out. I'm not looking at chat. T. Uh. Uh, Tunisia, t Tanzania, right? No, that doesn't start. No, no, that's TS, right? A, B, C, D, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, V, Q, R, S, T, U, uh, U would be United States, South America. A, B, C, D, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, V, R, S, T, U, V, V, Vanuatu. Content created. A B C D F G H N L M N O Q R S T U V W W. Woke land, bro. What about um? Wales, yeah, yeah. Wales is a good one. A B C D F G H I J K L M N O Q R S T U V W X Y Z X would be uh X Y Yemen Z Zimbabwe X. Is there any? Is there any that start with X? Dude, I think half of the reason I'm okay at that is because every time there's a TikTok on my For You page of a dude being like, if you can name a country that starts with this letter, I'll give you $10. And every time they do it, I fucking, I take that shit so serious. So seriously, man. I take that shit so fucking seriously. I'm not fucking around. I would get that $10. I'd get that $10, man. Name five women. My mother. My oldest sister. On my mom's side. The... My mother's youngest... Daughter. And then on my dad's side, Content his created. three daughters. Yo, Lundex, thank you for the six months. I don't want to name them. I don't want to dox my sisters. Seeing you in a hive mind video genuinely gave me whiplash. Guys, not to be an insensitive piece of shit. This is no, there's no, I'm not trying to be an asshole. What is hive mind? <laughs> Guys, what is that?
Name other people? Okay, I'll name five women. Biddy White? The Queen Elizabeth? Zoe Deschanel? Katy Perry? Uh, Hillary Clinton. Okay, now I'll try. F I'll try name five men. Snoop Dogg. Rin and Stimpy. Beavis and Butthead. You know what? I'm so confident, I'm gonna go for 10. Ed, Ed, and Eddie? <laughs> Drake? <laughs> Can't Josh. <laughs> I can do tan woman. Anya Taylor Joy. Bjork. Ooh, um. Ooh, um. God. Is a woman. Written by Ariana Grande. And then the cherry on top. The cherry on top, you may be wondering. Would be Princess Beach. Now you try you try do that guys. Can I name a hundred people? Betty White, Snoop Dogg, Hugh Jackman, um, Doug Demiro, Andy Anderson, Anya Taylor Joy, FKA Twigs, Ariana Grande, Dua Lipa. Um, Biddy White, HC Justin, Dave, Joski, Dumb Dog, Northern Lion, Mouth Bear, Corey, Justin Bieber, Paul, Minkus, Ringo Starr, John Lennon. Yoko Ono JFK JFK's wife Midas the guy that turns like silver into gold Danny DeVito Germa Ludwig Maya Tony Hawk Rose Jisoo Lisa Jenny From Blackpink Um Sideshow Bob The Bagel Boss Man Channing Tatum
Me? Mr. Beast? PewDiePie? Cage Cooking? Prizzo? Zach? And Cody? Edward Scissorhands, Winona Ryder, Kurt Cobain, David Attenborough, Guy Fieri, Earl Sweatshirt, Tyler the Creator, Kali Uchis Frank Ocean Kate Lovely Momo Franklin the Turtle Olivia Munn Olivia Rodrigo Ooh, Gwen Stefani. Um, Sam and Cat. Um, Mark Applied. Yep, I was going to say that one. Ooh, Cat and Dog from Cat Dog. <gasps> um,. Ah, uh, uh. uh, oh, God. Fuck, I already did God. Jesus, Squeaks, Laws Dog. Yorgos, that guy that directs movies, Yorgos, Yorgos, you know Yorgos? Um... <gasps> Vivek Ramaswamy? Swami? Bernie Sanders? Chloe Swabrick? Um... JFK Jr. Donald Trump. Michael Jackson. Um. Weird Al. Alexander Hamilton! The guy in the Kappa emote? <gasps> um... Ooh, Walt Disney. Um... George Bush, Jimmy Carter, Ronald Reagan, Henry Ford, Thomas Edison, George Washington, Mozart, Van Gogh, Peter Griffin, Brian the Dog, Quagmire, the other guy in the wheelchair, what's his name? Joel? Joe Biden? Um... Uh, bu bu um, uh, Buzz Aldrin? 
Uh, Buzz Lightyear. That one doesn't count. Just wanted to flex that I know who that is. Um... Steve Harvey. Uh... Minecraft Steve. Uh... Mary Kate and Ashley. Uh, Rick Owens. Donatella, Donatelli, Donatello Versace. Donatella. Michelangelo. Donatello oh, What's the other Ninja Turtle? Michelangelo? JC Penny? Penny from Big Bang? Sheldon! Two and a half men? Has the guy who snorts all the coke it's crack? If there's crack in the house, somebody else fucking smoke it. Winning. His name is Charlie Sean, and his and his friend is Young Lean Dude and Blade and Echo Two K and Die Boy Digital. And, um... Oh! JC Penny! And, um... Amelia Earhart? Michelle Obama? Malcolm in the middle? Frodo Baggins? What's his name? His name is, um... <laughs> it's not the same person. What's his name? There's Malcolm. D no, they're, they're, okay, we'll take like Daniel Rankin, but that's not his name. That's another guy. Oh, Brian Crankston and Jesse Pinkman. Oh, Chandler Bing, Phoebe Bridges, Rachel. Um, who else is in France, bro? Joey. And Ross, the Big Lebowski, Badlands Chug, Badland Chugs, oh, Charlie Puth, and Tupac and Biggie. I did get Big Lebowski from Mon Monica Lewinsky. I did, I did. That is the strain I took in my head. Um. Uh. Gordon Ramsay, Anthony Bourdain. Uh. Jamie Oliver. Rachel Ray. Uh, every no, I can't say that one yet. No, I'm just gonna, well, we'll save that one for a moment of desperation. I'm only at twenty. Kim Kardashian, Chloe Kardashian. Huh? 
Courtney Kardashian and Courtney Love and <gasps> the Beatles. Oh, oh, Dave Grohl, Dave Grohl, Dave Grohl. Mark Cuban. <gasps> uh, Johnny Knoxville, Bam, Majera, oh, um, 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 well, uh, Steve O, George Lucas, Peter Jackson. Um, uh, David Tennant, Peter Piper, Haley Williams, Beyonce, already did Phoebe Bridges. Zendaya. Yep. Um. Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Rick Grimes. Daryl. Queen Elizabeth the first Rey Mysterio John Cena Aston Martin I think I did a I did I think I did 50 guys was that not 50 oh yeah Penn and Tulla Rose from the Titanic and Jack the goal was a hundred oh I think I did a hundred did I not do a hundred Cowboy, Beep Bop, Ash Ketchum, Misty, oh my god, yes, yeah, someone should make a sparkle quiz of try guess the 100 people that Chibli guessed, dude, that would be awesome, Frankie M Muniz, Um Ooh Who's that guy that would like kill people and then put them under his house? Yeah, John Wayne Gacy And then Um Well now I gotta make sure I make a jump that like isn't like like whatever person I name next Everyone's just gonna think I'm thinking I think they're kind of like John Wayne Gacy, bro Chuck E. Cheese John Wayne Airport. John Wayne. Is that someone? John Wayne. They he must be. He has an airport named after him.
Rit and Link! And Wyatt. And Ben Dover? David Dobrik. Jason Derulo. And Jason Nash. And Shane Dawson. Sophia Nygaard? Yep, Ray William Johnson, Trisha Paytas, Stiff Poppers. <gasps> ah, the Daily Grace Show! The Daily Grace Show! And then Elliot Morgan! Um... This person? Hey! You got any tricks? Do you have a trick? What do you? Oh, oh! Don't break them! Don't break it! Do you have like a ladder in your house you could climb up with your VR headset on? Like a ladder, maybe? Or, um... Do you have a microwave? If you put the controller in the microwave and then you turn it on, the con your hand will just spin. Yep, do that one. <gasps> Wait, let's do charades! Wait, do let's do charades! <laughs> Wait, can you look at me? Oh, your hands are backwards. Are you okay? Oh! You want to do charades? Okay, think of something. Hi! I didn't forget about you, don't worry. Chat, how do you say charade? How do you play charade? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yep. Oh fuck, getting up for it, serious. Uh, cowboy! Riding a horse! Riding! Cow! Horse! Don't look so sad! I didn't mean it! Um... How many words is it? <laughs> One... Two... Three... Th 
mystery words. Um, riding the horse. Driving the horse. Opa Gangnam style. Wait, was it Gangnam style? Hey, I saw that from chat. Okay, VR Andy, all the way in the back. You need to move into like a fucking YMCA community facility so you have enough room to walk all the way up here from down there so you can complete charades. Yeah! Over here! Dude! Come on! There you go! Swim to me! Yo, why two two three thing with a gift sub? Keep swimming! Nemo! Backstroke? Can we play again? Okay, 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 okay. One, two, two words, two words. Oh, running, running, uh, jumping the Olympics. London Olympic. Uh, oh, London 2012, bro. Woo! Wait, why the fuck am I so good at this shit? Why we're both so good? You're so good at acting, and I'm so good at guessing. The fuck? I'm making someone play charades with me. <laughs> They're in their room with the stream on playing charades with me, bro. That's <laughs> just insane. Mm. Are, you, are you coming yet? Are you coming over here? Hey! Wake up! Oi! Run of the bus, bro! Come on! Okay, we can play from here. We can play from here. Just, if you stand up, I can probably see enough. If you want, you can say no. What? Oh. Can you do sign language? Oh, you're turning on a shower. Oh, that way we're not playing charades. I think you were just saying it, trying to say kinda. My bad. Okay, I see. Can you turn your head around 360s without moving your hand?
What the fuck is it doing? Holy shit! That was cool. Not to like, um... Not to like make you feel bad, but there was someone else in the bus doing backflips earlier, so... I don't know if that quite tops that. That's okay, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Hello? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. I saw your brain. I saw straight through your neck. I saw your brain. What the fuck? Wait, can you put your bald spot in front of my camera? Like, how close can you get to my camera? Is there like an invisible box around me? Oh, there isn't. Oh, 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 oh! Hello? Oh, oh! I... You've ever driven... Have you ever driven one of these before? I've... I've never driven one of them either. Oh, you, you're so bald. <laughs> um, They don't stop. They're still going, dude. They're the fuck. Oh my god. Did they just fucking fall? Okay. Um. Lord Farquad. Shrek, Donkey, um, the guy that voice acted Shrek, Adam Sandler, I don't know. Guys, only two more hours. Only an hour and 40 more minutes, dude. That's not that bad, right? Right? We're making good time. That's honestly not that bad. Do you know what that calls for? You know how we're gonna do one song every three hours? <laughs> you uh, something new <laughs> ah, I can't press the D key. I can't press the D key. It's stuck. It's stuck. I can't press it. If I go too far left, we're fucked. <laughs> Baby, baby, it's a wild world. Yeah, I smile. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. And I just run by the time go.
I'm making out of life's friends, friends out there. There is a lot of everywhere. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. I am not bad. Wait, what is that one song from Big Little Lies? Big Little Lies, that Little Lies song with the with the mumsies that do the thing to that one dude. Cold Little Heart. Yeah, I really want it. Yeah, you want it bad. Oh my! Oh, this song is so good, dude. Fuck. Whoo! DJ, turn my shit up! Turn my shit up, DJ! Oh, I almost ran off the road! Did you ever want it? Ever did you want it bad? Oh my! And tear me apart! Ah. Oh. Wow. Ooh, wow. Yup. Wow. 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 Oh, this isn't even the radio edit. The song's nine minutes long. Where's the radio edit? Cold Little Heart Radio Edit. Did you ever want it? Did you want it bad? Oh my. They're making out, bro. Did you ever notice my life? Bench, 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 bench. Okay. 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 What a beautiful song, dude. What a beautiful song. Isn't it crazy that Justin drove to a convention this morning and his drive was an hour and a half long? And I've been driving in a straight line in a video game for six and a half hours. Fucking hell, man. When does it end? I don't know. How long is the drive from Tucson to Vegas? Eight hours, I think. What's on the radio? Ladies and gentlemen, my producer Chester is shouting at me again. Well, 
shouting may be overstating it, but uh, I'm sorry to say, ladies and gentlemen, that it has happened once again, as it seems to happen so many times, that we've actually run out of time to listen to this piece of music. But that is quite all right. New World Symphony is a extremely popular piece of music. I have no doubt that all of you already have a copy of it in your record collections at home. Uh, I'll have to leave it as an exercise to you, the listener, to take what we've discussed today and, and go and listen to this work and really dig in to the beautiful melodies and music of Dvorak. Okay, turning back to measure 101. So now we are at the Menomoso, the tempo one. Here we have a return to the opening melodies. We're going we're gonna to skip that brass fanfare. That doesn't happen here. Instead, right back to the... Then here's that augmented fifth chord that was so beautiful the first time. And I'm sorry, ladies, but sometimes when I speak during a uh, during a passage of music, my need to stay with the meter. Uh, causes my mouth to say things that are not strictly true. When I say an augmented five chord, of course I mean an augmented five chord, tonicizing six in our key of B flat. What's in the Chibli Spotify like songs? People like my like songs. What do we got in here, dude? What can I what can I cook up for the fans at home? And I'm always happy because. I only do what I want. I'm top dog like the best at yet. Ooh, that's another ooh ooh in the back. I'm top dog like the best at your head. That's another ooh ooh in the bag. Hey! Should I drive the bus onto the sand and flip it over, killing the driver and all the passengers? Or what? Do you guys want another beautiful song? This song is fucking beautiful, dude. This song is fucking beautiful, man. But it's- it's- f oh, it's only five minutes, that's not bad. This song is fucking beautiful, bro. Oh. Oh. Cry, what a beautiful song. Oh. It's in my right ear. This is why I hate stereo audio. This is a music video. This is a music video. Is that a moment right? 
the light. What a beautiful song, bro. What a beautiful song, yo. So true. Hey! Everyone get up their fucking lighters! Everyone in the crowd pulled up their fucking lighters! <laughs> <laughs> Harvest Moon reference! Holy shit! What else is in my playlist? What about, um... What about, um... Oh, another beautiful song. Another beautiful song. This one. This is also in the Chibli playlist. We have a lot of variety in the playlist, dude. I told you there's a lot of variety in the playlist, man. Oh! Sorry, almost crashed. <laughs> okay, guys, uh, what do you want to hear next, guys? What type of vibe? Oh, beautiful song right here. Beautiful. Oh, fucking Louis Bomfer, bro. The one, this is the, uh, one of the best albums to ever exist in hu existence of human beings, bro. This album is fucking beautiful, man. I love this shit. I love this shit! I love this one! Whoo! Fucking beautiful mod! This is a masterpiece, bro! You think the guitar was catching on fire when he played this shit? Cause it's fire, dude! Whew. How the fuck has it been so long? We were at six and a half hours like 40 minutes ago, dude. Why is it taking so long? This is the worst fucking bus in the world, man. Like, we feel so close, but so far away, dude. Hey, back to the AMA that we were doing at the first 10 minutes of the stream. Any questions, guys? There has been so many characters in this. Like, we've got the twins. Oh, well, everyone's a character, kind of. This person's just been, like, AFK staring straight at me for, like, the past three hours. 
Do I wear wigs? No. Would I wear wigs? No. Best toast topping? Pesto. Or avocado. Micah, thank you so much for the four months. Thank you. Cream team or squirt squad? Um... Cream cheese or cheese whiz? Cream cheese? Favorite type of measurement? A, a picosecond. I wanna be... Have you ever eaten cat food? I asked four people today and they all said no. Um, no, but one time, when I was really, really young, my my mom put a, a can of cat food on a plate to feed it to the cat, and then the cat didn't want it, so she put it in the fridge to give it to the cat later, and then my dad came back from work, and he walked into the house, and he thought it was a pate, and he ate it, and then my mom was, like, laughing her ass off, because later in the night, he was like, I feel really sick, I don't feel so good, and she was like, well, what have you eaten? And he was like, not much, just that pate in the fridge, and then she was like, that was cat food, dickhead. Dumbass, that was cat food, bro. And he ate, he ate the whole thing, man. I was talking about dry kibble. Oh. Nah. I probably tried it. And they're fucking chilling, bro. What pets did I have? I had a, a three cats, a dog, and then we got rid of that dog, and we had another dog, and then I think we got rid of that dog too, and then we got another dog, and I had a lamb, and I had a pony, and I had another pony, and I had a bunny rabbit, and I had a horse, And I had a, I kind of had a duck. What's your go-to compliment? Wow, you're really not annoying to be around. Got rid of how? One dog. Okay, I can say this because it was family decisions, so it's not my fault. One dog kept running away from home. So I think we gave it to a family member. Um. One dog was like a demon personified into a shih tzu. So we also gave that away to someone else we knew. And then the other dog we got was like chill as fuck. But I was like two, so I had no say in this. I was just like, oh, where's the dog? Where'd the dog go? Have I ever crashed a car? No, but I have been in two car crashes. One of them, the first car crash I was in was really bad. And I, for some reason, didn't give a fuck. I simply got out of the car and I was like, okay, now what? How do I get home? Cause I, I mean, I was a child, I wasn't driving. I was like, how do I get home, lol? And then the second crash was like literally at five kilometers an hour and the car didn't even get dented and for some reason i was like i'm never getting in a car ever again bro fuck you fuck everyone that drives one of these fucking stupid pieces of shit man and my, i had to go to therapy for it <laughs> but my therapist was cool because she would buy me candy after the therapy session she'd be like oh there's a candy shop go buy the candy and i was like oh i love it I'm gonna have- I'm gonna be ter terrified of cars more often, bro. Didn't you play- oh yeah, during the therapy I would pick up the toy cars and I would make them crash into like shit, like really aggressively. Like all I would do while I was in therapy is make the cars crash. And at the time I was like, I'm having a good time, but looking back I'm like, dang, that was probably very telling. She probably took down a lot of notes from from what was I was doing.
How old am I? 26. You're a case study? Yep. That actually might be my favorite Chibli Law, law the toy cars. I remember exactly. I remember exactly the layout of the the room, and they there was like a there was a sink that you could play with, and she would fill it with water for like kids to like fuck around because kids love playing with basins of water, and I would just make. I remember there was an ambulance toy, and then there was a normal car toy. I would uh, make the normal car toy crash into the the sink. And then I would be like, oh, the ambulance is coming. And then I'd make the ambulance also crash into the sink. And I was like, oh, they all died. <laughs> Holy fuck, chat. Dude, I did something awesome last night, man. That like made me relive childhood. I slept, I turned the light on in the hallway and I slept with the door open ajar. Like I'm a kid that was afraid of the dark, bro. Like I had a night light on. Holy fuck, it took me down memory lane, dude. I was the best sleep I've ever had. How much of that was from the first crash? I don't know. I remember during the first crash, the thing that pissed me off the most Content is created. we just went to the store and we had a big bag of like potato chips on the floor in the front, unopened. And when we crashed, my sister stomped on the bag of chips and we lost all of them. That pissed me off, bro. I wanted to eat those. Yo, Sunrays, thank you for the brand new tier one. I was like, man, I was hungry. And then another thing that pissed me off about that is I was sitting in the back of an ambulance and someone someone I knew from my school walked past because they were walking home so I waved at them and they ignored me bro come on dude don't know walling me in the back of an ambulance the fuck Does this explain the fact you don't drive? No, I just don't drive because I don't I don't I don't see a reason to so I've never really got my license. I know I should though <laughs> Next question mods feed through another question Do you live in a city with transit? Yeah, kind of it's a bit unreliable though, but isn't that just that's public transport in 2023 four? Passenger check. We lost one. I think they fall asleep. Oh, maybe they're like just watching in bed and their monitor is on their ceiling. Are you okay back there? You're good? Okay. What's your favorite Eminem rhyme? Don't you just want to grab a boob plus my penis gone attitude? Cause like, one, what the fuck is wrong with you? Two, what the fuck does that mean, bro? I'm stuck, I can't press D. My D is pinned down, well pinned up with a toothpick. If I go too far left, I'm stuck. Coffee or tea? Look guys, I'm beginning to think I'm a bit of a coffee snob, but I can't lie bro. Coffee all day, every day. Coffee is so much better than tea. I, do, I think, you know what? I actually think they're not comparable. I think they're not comparable because tea has so much variety in it and coffee has a lot of variety too. But at the end of the day, coffee is just coffee. 
it's all coffee tea is all tea but there's so many different types of tea bro like you can have different types of coffee but it's still coffee like the, it's not like oh this one coffee is um it tastes way fucking different bro it's like no it just tastes like coffee still What snacks am I getting at the gas station? Every time I go to the gas station, I get a can of iced coffee and I get a spinach and feta roll because they have a hot food section. If there's no hot food section, I might get a... I don't know. Like, uh, a Kit Kat? I don't, I don't really... I don't know. I don't remember the last time I ever even ate a Kit Kat. Handsome Pants and maybe the 36 months? I just came back from the Raptors game and saw the Twitch remove Jabasted. Wait, no shot? What the hell? What the hell? Oh, sometimes I get, uh, like, if I'm a little hungry and I'm at a gas station, I'll get, like, a little protein bar. I like getting a little protein bar snack. Thoughts on bounty bars? I think bounty bars are good, and I think Almond Joys suck. Bounty bars are actually so good, though. Do you follow any sports? Not really. Sorry, I'm lame. God, I'm getting so hungry. Yeah, there's a dead bug on the windscreen. Sorry. I'm so fucking hungry, dude. Only an hour and ten more minutes. Best score in Fortnite Festival? Vampire by Olivia Rodrigo? Oh, perfect. Ah! We're good. You see the little seam on the dirt? I think if you go over that, you die. Are you gonna play the rest of Telltale's Expanse game? That? I'm not even trying to be mean to the devs or the, like the Expanse. I'm not joking. I think the Expanse Telltale game was the worst thing I've ever played. It was so bad. It, this game is more enjoyable than the Expanse Telltale game. What was the last dream you had? I had a dream I got killed by a spider the size of a basketball. It was last night. There was a lot more to the dream too. What's that one game you wish you could get all the boys to play together? Ooh, um... There is a game... Uh, Sub Rosa. Sub Rosa, I think, would be really fun. It's like a... I think it's really early in its dev stage. Um, but it's like a bank heist game with, like, there's multiple teams and they all have to steal from the same play. I don't know what, how it works exactly, but it's really fun looking. Are you going to play more Voices of the Void? Uh, maybe. What's the biggest animal you think you could tap out? Uh, give me some examples. Because, like, all I can think of is, like, goat and horse. But I definitely can't take a horse. Wait, I don't have 100% base on Vampire? What the fuck? I swear to God I did it. I have a screenshot! I think I have a screenshot! I sent it to Chib! Where's my Chib vouch when I need it? I wanna be... What about an anteater? I could take an anteater. I could take a... I could take a... You know what? This might be crazy. I think I could take a giraffe, bro. 
Cause draw like a giraffe is big, but it has a lot of weak points, man. And it, like, if you just stand under it, it can't see you. It steps on you, you die? Okay, well, do I get the drop on it? Like, does it know I'm coming to attack it? Like, chat, have you ever been punched in the throat? Do you know how much that hurts? I just punch it in the throat, dude. Name five weak points on a giraffe. Uh, leg one, leg two, leg three, leg four, throat. You cannot reach the throat? Yeah, but when I kick it in one leg, it's gonna fall down on that one leg and then I'm gonna climb on top of it and then I'm gonna hu like hug it around its throat and then strangle it out and I win. Okay, I'll be humble. I could take a rhinoceros. How would I take out a rhino you might ask? I do the okay you know that trick where you um tell someone to uh put their hand in front of their in front of their eyes and then you put your like you go to like poke them in the eyes you know how you do that to people well i don't but like people used to do it to me when i was a kid i would i would say to the rhino Yo, put your hand in front of your eyes, and then when- look, when I go to poke you in the eyes, it won't reach. And then the dumbass would do that, and then I would use two hands, go One in each eye, bro, can't see. I have the upper hand, man. Climbing on top of it, I'm- I- I- I eat its rhino horn, and then because I've eaten the rhino horn, bro, I'm strong as fuck, because that shit's made out of keratin. And then I simply kick its ass with my- with roundhouse kicks to the head. People that say they could fight a cow are delusional. Have- has anyone seen a cow? Do you- people don't know what they- A cow is literally like all muscle, bro. It's like a- it's like a 800 kilogram of muscle. A rhino is an armored cow? You know, but cows are smart. Fuck it, I'm eating another gummy vitamin. No, I shouldn't. I've already had like five, bro. You're only meant to have two a day. Could you take on a small dog? No. Just buy candy? The thing is, if I... Gummy vitamins are the perfect snack because I have to have self-control where if I get candy, I just eat all the candy, you know? I think I could take a... No, I'm sticking by Giraffe. I think I, Giraffe is the biggest animal I could take. Okay, I could take a whale if we're fighting on my land, on my territory. I could take a whale. Because it's actually unfair if I had to fight a whale and we were in the ocean. That is so unfair. And the reason that uh, this would pass in, uh, in court, that my argument that we should fight on land, is because a whale can breathe air, but a chibli can't breathe water. So, it would actually pass that we'd have to fight on land. Giraffe, you're done, it's ten times your size? It ain't about the size, you know? It's about how you use it. How many salamanders do you have to tap out? How big is the average salamander? Because there is an argument. If you know how to fight 
three humans at one time, you can fight an infinite amount of humans. Because only three people can attack you at the same time. So if I could fight, okay, the 10 inches, what's my diameter as a human being? Like, bro, if I could fight like 15 salamanders at the same time, I could fight an infinite amount of salamanders. Dude thinks he's in the Arkham Knight video game. Dude is using geometry to fight. It makes sense, dude. Think about it. Fighting a hundred salamanders is the same as fighting 15 salamanders. One just takes longer. If you have un in if you have an infinite amount of stamina, you could fight salamanders forever. You could fight for like hundreds of years. You would be if you if you back in the day fought like salamanders for like three weeks straight, you would have been crowned a king. Do you know that? You would literally be crowned like a fucking like a deity in 2023 or 2024. You'd be a god, bro. If you fought salamanders for like three weeks, they'd call you like the god of lizards or some shit. It would be fucking awesome. Isn't that fucking cool? What's my medieval weapon of choice? Probably uh, like a mace, like a stick with a sharp ball on it. You named approximately 183 people, by the way. I'll send that Sporkle quiz when you least expect it. Wait, what the fuck? That's so funny. Wait, I named 183 people. That's awesome. All right, uh, do, 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 do. get uh, Ryan Letourneau on the Chibli. How many, uh, what people did Chibli name Sparkle Quiz? If you can name at least 50, you, will you win? I want to pee. Why should we be playing a Zuma remake of Desert Bus instead of the real thing? Um, this one looks better and it has multiplayer. Have you ever seen giraffes fighting? Yeah, they just slap each other with their heads, right? Wait, how many miles is Desert Bus? Isn't it 370 something? We're at 311. It's 360? But I'm only going... I'm f going 45 miles an hour. Bro, it's gonna take longer than 8 hours, dude. Fuck. You're not going straight? My bad. Why is it so slow? This bus sucks shit. Literally first generation bus, bro. It needs to evolve. I'm driving the Charmander of buses. play vampire on the horn bam 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 
Dun, 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 dun. Chip, if not streaming, what job would you want to end up doing? Would you want to slash end up doing? I think... I... You know, I know this isn't a path, a job path you can really climb through. So, I, like, me saying barista is kind of stupid, because, like, you are, like, you're just a barista, and then, like, you're a barista. Like, where are you going from barista? But, like... I think I would like hospitality a lot. I think I would really enjoy hospitality, and I know chat's already gonna say, have fun talking to customers, bro. You're gonna hate it. You know what? I've been practicing for the past four years, bro. I'm a Twitch streamer. I already know how to talk to customers. You guys are pretty much customers of my attention. Or... I think I would kill it in an office, bro. Give me an Excel sheet, dude. I'm killing it, man. Nah, I don't think I could work in an office. Unless it was like a fun office. <laughs> but we like you, the customers don't. If I had a rude customer, I... I don't know if you're allowed to do this as a barista. I would spit in their drink. I think dream Chibli life. I know this is pretty unrealistic because uh, the cafe and restaurant business has like a like literal like fucking 90% failure rate. But I would love to own a cafe when I'm like 50, bro. Dream life. Stream long enough until I can open a cafe. Or stream long enough until I fall off, but I streamed long enough that I can open a cafe afterwards. But that probably won't happen. I'll probably like, I don't know, work for a pressure washing business or something. What about a deli? I just think anywhere where I can make, like, I have creative freedom over food and drink. And, like, aesthetic of, of said establishment. I don't know, bro. This Anthony Bourdain book's training me good, guys. I learned that I need to have a big chef's knife. And I, um, need to not be annoying. Favorite type of house? A home. House music, yeah. House MD. House MD's notes. Dude, we drove through the entire night. What would I sell at my cafe? I would make sure to have a good selection of pastries. I feel like a lot of cafes, they go too heavy on the muffins, bro. They go way too heavy on the muffins and the slices. I think you need to stick to the pastries, bro. Pastries is where it's at in a cafe. I don't want to go eat no fucking muffin, bro. It ain't muffin house. It ain't muffin break. It's a cafe. Give me a croissant. Danishes? Yep. What would they be called? B Bugle bees. The aesthetics, it has to have a big concrete wall on the back. It has to have a big concrete wall. And unfortunately, due to capitalism, I have to make the chairs uncomfortable. If the chairs are too comfortable, it's the establishment's gonna get filled with motherfuckers that come down, sit down with their laptop, and never leave, dude.
dedicated smoking room? This is Desert Bus VR, yeah. Jib, I hope your cafe goes under. I'll have one, I'll have two chairs that are really comfortable. And when you come into the cafe, if you plan to stay for a while, you have to play like fucking musical chairs until you find the comfortable one. Do you guys think wobbly tables at a cafe is a fucking like they're done on purpose? This is a conspiracy theory I'm making right now. I think the wobbly tables are done on purpose to make sure people don't stay for too long. Because they're like, oh, well, the table, like, because <gasps> then we put your laptop on it and you start typing, shit goes, rrr, rrr, rrr. it starts wobbling around and shit, dude. So they're like, well, I gotta leave. Don't get too comfortable. Yes. Oh. Still there? Okay. I think the twins have been here almost the entire time. Dude, my driver's seat must be so musty. Oh, look at it. Wait, you can see my balls. You can see like a ball imprint, dude. Look in the middle. And by abstain, let's just say my peanuts. How hot do you think that bus is? Is there an AC? There's no AC, huh? This is all we've got for cooling and it's not even- you can't even turn it on. Where are we going? We're going to Vegas. Do you think I can uh, request to have my own sticker added to the game if I complete the um, Desert Bus VR challenge? You think we could get a little chibli right there or something? Right down there, maybe? Oh, they're from charity events. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe if we did, maybe if we were a charity event, maybe. What's that one? I'm guessing that one is Desert Bus for Hope. That one is Tucson or Bust. That one is Croft Along. What's that one? Did we really run out of music on the radio? I just had the head exploding sound again, dude. And it's actually so accurate to what it sounds like. Honestly, finding a way to stick down the uh, WQ was a game changer, man. Prey mindset? What the fuck does that mean? Would I be really good at hunting animals? No, you would be hunted? No, I wouldn't. You should see me when I go outside at nighttime in the middle of the night out in the forest, bro. You should see me. You should fucking see me. My head is on a swivel, man. 
and like something breaks a stick, man, I know I can pinpoint the exact location it's coming from. If, if humans had no inventions, where do you think they would do in the wild? Like if we didn't have like spears or like guns or rocks, how, where do you think we'd rank on the food pyramid? Cause like, I'm not gonna lie, man. Pretty much anything can kill us. Do we still have language? Yeah. Like you can say like, oh, look out, a giraffe. Then pretty good. Well, no, cause like, like a bird can say like, and that means like, look out, there's a cat. And like, they still do pretty good. I mean, and they still get fucked up. Birds know Morse code. Yeah. Make enemy spider. Are you crying? What was that? We honestly do have characters, man. There are characters in here. We got like Sideshow Bob. We have the twins. We have the person that's been logged out of their brain for like uh, the past fucking seven hours. And then we have like the person back there is like a little goofy. <laughs> a little goofy silly. The twins, bro. <laughs> yeah, we had the peekaboo guy. The twins is so funny. This dude, the dude that's just staring is me on like a 12 hour flight. I'm just like logged out, bro. I'm just sitting there the entire time. Mmm, eating? Are you eating some food? Yum! Oh. Oh yes, yum! Soup. Eating some soup. Ooh, drinking the- drinking it out of the bowl. Yummy. Oh, are you trying to grab a briefcase? Oh, what the fuck? They're back! Wait, what the fuck? They woke up, dude. They woke up. They've been asleep. Oh, they've been asleep this entire time. What's my D&D character? I've had one character I've used, I think, in three campaigns now called Crumb. Mainly because I cannot be ever bothered to make a new character. Crumb like the band. C-R-U-M-B. You know what? That's a beautiful idea. Let me turn on some crumb. Fuck yes, man. Let me turn on some fucking crumb, bro. Fuck yes, bro. Fuck yes, man.
<laughs> what a good band, dude. 40 more minutes, chat. What song? This is Ghost Ride by Crumb. Oh, oh. Oh, that, oh, you dropped something? Did you drop something? Oh, it's, oh, oh, it's all good. No, no, no need to worry. They are harvesting a magical orb. Oh, oh, you're telling me to be quiet? Oh, everyone else is still dancing, dude. Marco no Polo Oh Why can I hear music? Am I going crazy? Oh wow. Are we there yet? Nope, we still have like 40 miles. We still got like an hour to go. I'm not gonna lie Yeah, the VOD will be fine after this I think Dude, I cannot wait to go eat and pee It's gonna be so fucking awesome Separate things by the way separate things Streamer eats piss? Ew. Ew. How much gas does this thing have? Every time someone gets on the bus, they bring their own uh, thing of uh, gasoline. They've been refilling as we're driving. That's why sometimes when you see... Aren't they twins? Aren't they twins? Dang, right at the front of the bus, bro. They don't even give a fuck. Hey! Stop that! Hey! Stop! Oh. We're almost there, I swear to god, we're almost there. Any pent up energy you have, you can get out in Vegas, dude. Trust me, it's the place for it. minutes man oh my god 44 minutes bro come on can we get some more chip lore i don't know what other lore i have like uh i almost burnt down the uh, kindergarten Who was my first kiss? My... I don't remember her name. My dad's... Friend's... Daughter. <laughs> <laughs> B 
but I don't that's all I know We're good, 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 we're good. Do I have a favorite movie? I like the lobster. Oh, I also like uh, Florida Project. Is that what it's called? With Willem Dafoe? I really do like Yogo's movies. Florida Project is probably one of my favorites, though. I mean, Lobster is probably one of my favorites, too, but... I've not seen Leon, no. Blue Lobster! Paris, Texas? I think that's on my watch list. Killing of a Sacred Dead. Killing of the Sacred Dead is pretty good. The only one I don't like from Yogos is Dog Tooth. I think Dog Tooth was a bit shit for me. But I think Dog Tooth is shit because it tries like. It is really trying to be like shocking and weird, but I didn't find it that shocking and weird because I could see that it was really trying to be shocking and weird and weird immediately. So like I didn't really think it was like shocking and weird. Pleb take? No, five D chest take? I saw straight through it. Can you do fart reviews? Maybe one day, when I run out of content, I'll do some fart reviews on stream. Are you a Wes Anderson head? Not really. I'm not really a movie dude, honestly. That's a realization I've had recently. I feel like leading up, you know, the past few years, I was like, man, I gotta get into movies, bro. Everyone I know watches movies. I need to start watching movies so I can talk about movies with all these people. Let me try watch these movies. And then I kind of realized, I was like, I mean, I don't really like watching movies. <laughs> like, I think there's a reason that I've not watched a lot of movies. I just, I really don't think I like movies. Like, I will watch a movie every once in a while, especially with people. Like, I do always enjoy a movie with people. But like... One movie a month, maybe? That's good enough for me. I can't do one every peloton ride, dude. I'll stick to the books. Do you know what that your favorite movie is is made after? A book. Do you know what I've read? The book. I know everything more than you, because I've read the book. Oh, do you like that one part where this happens? Oh no, I've not seen that part because uh, it wasn't in the movie, was it? No, it wasn't. It was in the fucking book. You suck and you're stupid. You don't know shit about your favorite fucking movie because you should read the book. Oh, I'm sorry. Fuck you. I'm reading a book. Have I read the good book? Yep. I've read every book ever. I've read the Bible seven times, bro. What about green eggs and ham? I tried to get into reading green eggs and ham, but I just didn't fucking get it, bro. I just, I could not understand it. I think it was too like complex for me. Cause I don't, Content the eggs are green exciting. and this ham. Yo, Dexter, thank you for the six months. Dexter, thank you. 24 hour stream. Actually, there is only 32 minutes left, maybe. Another book that I really had uh, trouble getting into was like one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Bro, I don't get so many people say they fucking love that book, man. I just didn't understand it, dude. Like, I think I'm too fucking stupid for it. It was so difficult. 
two-year-olds if they could speak like fine English, but um, but that uh, end of sentence. Two-year-olds if they could speak perfectly fine English. Bro, I tried to read one fish, blue fish, fucking green fish, two fish, but this shit was hard, man. I just don't get it. I don't get how some people say it's their favorite book. Harry Potter books ranked. Um. Uh. Okay, Inner Furnace, S tier. Uh, Buried in the Ground, like an A tier. Uh, Lit a Flame with a Lighter, S plus tier, bro. Um, Flush down the Toilet, B tier. It's not that satisfying. <laughs> We haven't done- Oh, I, can't, I was gonna swerve right and left, but I can't even press my D key, dude. I'm right. I'm gonna press it and it's gonna get stuck. Lethal Company with a Lost Dog win? Does Lost Dog want to play Lethal Company? He does? Hmm. Us Australian streamers really have to stick together. Us Australians. Try and move to Australia, lol. I hate that this is a thing in my brain. In my head, I'm like, if I moved to Australia, I would be in a worse time zone for streaming because I would be two hours behind where I am now. So if I wanted to do group content at 9 a.m., I'd be doing it at 7 a.m. instead, bro. My normal stream start time would be 8.30. What the fuck? I'm not doing that. And it is just cooler Oz. If you asked anyone in New Zealand, okay, if you asked almost anyone in New Zealand, they would all say the opposite. People in New Zealand loved to love Australia. That was close. I think uh, a lot of people like Australia because it's got like bigger cities and like, I think you can like there's more work, like job opportunity, like more growth opportunity within fields. <laughs> But the way I look at it, okay, this is the way I look at moving overseas, right? Because every time I hype, I drop the hypothetical, should I move somewhere? Everyone's like, no, why the fuck would you want to move from New Zealand? I, you, I can always come back to New Zealand, bro. It's not like you're only allowed to live in one spot for the rest of time, right? Like hypothetically, it'd be super easy for me to move to Australia. But I would probably have to, I would probably fuck with my taxes like crazy, man. Such a pain getting a visa. To, um, I think Austra New Zealand to Australia is really easy visa-wise. What do you think? Yep. Thank you. What about you guys? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, I gotta stick a tissue in my nose. Come to Nashville. A what? Date is Nashville. Content. 
content created. Yo! Cinti Saps! Thank you for the brand new Prime! Thank you so much. I appreciate it. So many Prime is these past weeks. Thank you. I like to view a Prime as like a, um... It's like a it's like a subscription trial run, you know. People use their Prime when they're like, "Ooh, am I gonna like the streamer for a month?" You know, let me use my Prime to just test the waters a little bit. <laughs> let me just test it out, you know, see how we're feeling in a month, and then I might use the Prime again. That's how I use my Prime, at least. Can I say Mad Moon? Mad Moon. <gasps> I saw Mad Moon, dude. Mad Moon. Oh, I saw Mad Moon. Yo, screaming. Thank you so much for the Prime. Thank you. Mad, mad subscription. I saw Mad subscription. Man, Alvis's house is in Memphis, Tennessee. Do they still have his toilet that he shat in? And died on. You know, Alvis had like 30 pounds of poop in him. A golden gamma train! Golden gamma train is close! Golden gamma dude! Oh, golden gamma train is close, bro! Holy man, NFTs, bro! Frame one NFTs! <laughs> A golden gamma train is starting! Oh, I'm very good the road, dude! Yo, Dub69, thank you for the Prime. Cool. Genghis Khan, Crazy. thank you for the gift sub. Thank you so much. <laughs> Kennessy, thank you for the gift sub. Insert Irony, thank you for the 100 bits. Iron Spout, thank you for the 100 bits. Created. Chat, this NFT is gonna go to the moon, man. I promise. Make sure to grab it now. Oh, fuck, Galactic, thank you, Chipley Fan, thank you, Biggest Boy, thank you, oh, Wendy's, thank you, uh, ah, uh, Turtle Geek the First, thank you, Timmy's, Dan, thank you, I have to read them so quick, because I can't scroll back, Solemn, thank you, Butt Loop, thank you, Pluto, thank you, I have to, uh, Y223, thank you so much for the five, oh my god, Blue Ribbon, thank you, Symbia, thank you, Garfield, thank you, Tavka, thank you, Holo oh, Dads, thank you so much, Jinkwala, thank you, Milestone, thank you, Bistie B, thank you, I have to read them quick, because, uh, hey, and thank you so much for the 100 bits, Chipley, thank you so much, Lavender Hauntings, thank you, Kenneth, thank you, Bros! Swamp No, thank you. Satori Dev, thank you. Cosmic, thank you. Jago, thank you for the five. Oh, I have to read them so quick it. because I can't tab out of the game to scroll back down to uh, like reread them when they're gone. I have to read them so fucking quick. Um, A, A, nah, for real. Thank you for the hundred bits. Oh, 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 mom. Thank you for the prime. Anonymous Gifted, thank you for the five. Pompous, thank you for the five. Bloomsy, thank you so much for the nine months. Dude, my mouth hurts. That's the most words I've ever spoken. Alice Dawson, thank you for the hundred bits. That's the most I've ever said in my life. Sunbro Steve, thank you for the prime. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Saint, thank you. Uh, Turbulizer, thank you so much for the five. Anon, thank you for the five. Thank you. Symbiote, thank you for the five. Guys, if you want to scam the scam train, you only have to do 100 bits, by the way. I promise. I don't- I feel bad I a little bit. Hence the bad something with a five! Can you see thing with a sub? If you want it, you can just do 100. If you don't want it, well, fuck. Ryan, thank you so much for the 100. Toast, thank you for the gifty. But also money for Chibli. Oh God, yeah. Turbulizer! I said it right. I was just stressed. Ecamp thing with a hundred. Moon guy thing with a three hundred thirty-three. Nando thing with a hundred. Wait, how rare are golden hype trains? Well, Kappa trains, bro. Cause this is my second one, and I swear to God, I probably missed them. Alchemist thing with a hundred bits. I probably missed so many because I've not even realized that it's saying like golden Kappa train. Golden Kappa train starts soon. Oh my god, maybe DJ Clancy's in chat, dude. Created. Yo, um, Meta Trust, thank you for the 420. Richard, uh, Richard Zod, thank you for the gift subs. Uh, Zippy Zap, same with the 100. Astronaut Content Kitten, same with the 140. Liam had one. Liam the Goat. <laughs> At ButtLoop69, great name. <laughs> No, yeah, any, uh, any, 
Anything you put into the Kappa thing, you get it. I don't think there's like a level uh, you need to my reach. Head is fucking small, small and big, and at, the big at the same time. Classic. RDM Headwind, thank you for the 100 bits. Andy, thank you so much for the Prime. Thank you. Dang, Dexter is so mad he primed two minutes before this. Synthy Sap, thank you for the 100. Sigvard, thank you for the gift sub. I don't even know what the train is. That <laughs> makes one of your emotes gold for 24 hours. <laughs> wow. Yo, the mouse, thing with the gift sub. The five gift subs. Missy, thing with 100 bits. How was it when the bug hit the windshield? Best fucking moment of my life, can't lie. Content Wait, I'm about created. to beat my last record. Wow. Wowee. Luna, you've missed a lot. I named 183 people, Basically. and I also hey, named a country for That's every letter of the alphabet. Uh -huh. Missy, thank you with 100 bits. And I also... Symbiote, thank you with the 10! Got a golden kappa train. Created. I uh, I Carl, buddy, thank you with the prime. Pico Peaky, uh, Peking 10, thank you with 100 bits. Baton, thank you for the 100 bits. Ah, uh, my head is fucking small. I played, yeah, I played charades with, um, Sideshow Bob. Uh, Hazalia, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, someone in the bus was jacking off. It was a bit odd. Blue Ruby Red, thank you for the 100. These two keep making out. There's a lot of characters. This could be a whole fucking movie, dude. Oh. This person keeps going into like a K-hole. Oh my god, she's But they come back sometimes. Do I have the wheel set up? No, I've been pressing W and A repeatedly for ah! eight hours. Which sounded sarcastic, but it wasn't, I promise. That's literally what I've been doing. Yo, uh, Ace, uh, Ace, uh, Ace, 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 I, I lived, Ace lived, I survived with my little eye. Thank you for the seven months. I think it's uh I think it's crazy that you managed to last this long. Content Honestly, created. not the flex guys, but like every single day I'm normally awake for like nine or ten hours, not even eight. I'm normally awake for like nine or ten. Isn't that crazy? Hot local Content dad, thing with the gift sub. Squibus, thing with the hundred bits. Thank you. Content created. He will not say DX can't. What is that, a gaming chair brand? What is that? How does the Kappa thing work? If you're a part of the hype train, <laughs> this is gonna sound like a joke, but it's not. If you're a part of the hype train, your Kappa turns gold for <laughs> 24 hours. Sunrays, thank you for the gift sub, thank you. It will turn gold after the hype trade. <laughs> that sounds like a parody, dude. That sounds like a fucking parody. Infinity, thank you for the gift sub. Content created. Overclocked, thank you for the 100 bits. This is your career. Isn't that fucking funny? Isn't that funny? Oh, what do you do for work? Well, um, oh, how was jo your job yesterday? I went really good. I got a golden kappa hype train. Really good. Lives online, thank you for the two months. Oh, what's a golden cap of hype train? So it's when a certain amount of people give you money, the hype train starts, and then if you put in a certain amount of money, you can get your capper and chat turns gold. Uber driver turns around, drops you off in the middle of fucking nowhere, gives you a one star rating. Comment on profile, dude was crazy, I think. Hello, Ryan. Right, this game is actually so good, bro. You should play it, man. You should play this, dude. Stop. 
You violated the You should play this. Eight hour yap stream? No, no, it's this game is five hours long. Oh my God. Like Ryan, look at this. Baby, what? Them creepy pickles, them little baby. Yo, uh, descript descriptivist, thing with the 100 bits, okay, Missy, thing with the gift sub. Wait, can you, can Sideshow Bob, can you do the Lethal Company dance? Like the. <laughs> Great assets, great, great assets, great assets, great, great assets. Oh, twins, can you do it? Content created. Nah, it's close enough. Overclocked pixel, thank you for the. Wait, thank you for the tier two Content sub to Kate. Created. And Cynthia Sam, same with the 100 bits. There's your golden cap, guys. You've received the golden cap over 24 hours. Buttery cap oh dude. God, thank you so much, guys. So I appreciate it. And thank you, DJ Clancy, for the opportunity, dude. I couldn't have done it without you, man. Oh my god, cheeseburger, McDonald's. No, is this Desert Driver? Yeah, this is Desert Driver. Golden face, no space. Blue Ruby Red, thank you for the gift sub. Zach, thank you for the 100 bits. My God, she's a bridger. Thank Donald, I'm back. I it's subbed in no kappa. Um, God, is that real? Same. Oh. oh, you guys kappa? Are you guys oh gonna... God. It's because you want to kappa me right now? She's back and bagger. Ryan strikes me as a guy that doesn't have his credit card information auto saved on Twitch. Oh my god, we couldn't escape Donkey Kong, bro. If you know the words, you can join in to put your hands together if you want to clap as we take He's right. I only thought because someone was like, Ryan, get the golden camera, bro. And I just imagined you like be like, where's my fucking wallet, man? Like, I don't, it's shit's not saved on my account, bro. Where is the fucking debit card, dude? He's like crying and shit. Dramatic movie scene where he's like, like fucking wobbly legged, like stumbling into the bathroom, like fucking knocks into the wall to get down on the floor, like throw up into the toilet because he's so fucked up and sad. I missed it. Right. <laughs> Bottle of whiskey in hand. <laughs> Where's my checkbook? Dude, the checkbook's a thing. I remember when I was young, uh, Mumsy would write a check to do groceries. And I was like, wow, how, how, how look at Oh my god, cheeseburger. Me when I'm driving, when I'm dizzy driving, I need to lock in. This, this passenger is locked in, bro. They're the most locked in passenger in the world. The one that doesn't move at all. They come back like every Content hour or so, created. and by that I mean they've come back once. But they're locked the fuck in, bro. Uh, Sideshow Bob's pretty locked in too, I can't lie. Good co-pilot. Good co-pilot. Guys? I don't think we're 12 minutes away. Because, oh, we might be actually. What is this? This is game of the year 2024. What do you mean? These are the results I found for all oh my gods. 
cheeseburger, McDonald's, and that Big Mac were ordered Bika Buns, Big or Mormon's cheese. I really hope burger. when you get to the end, it's a, like a scary jump scare that like ruins. It's kind of like the maze game, you know? Like, oh, that game's so hard. I hope I get a good reward at the end, and then it's like just scary. Eight hour long maze game. Should I upload? I should upload every part of this uh, in uh, chunks on TikTok, like seven thousand TikToks. Aww. They're all like thirty seconds Aww. each. Man, I kind of feel like, like, man, I don't want it to be over, dude. Like, I kind of, I feel like we were just like getting started. I can't. Time. We still got I ten more I minutes. I I'm sure. Really. I'll, I'm sure I'll change my mind in ten minutes. I'm surprised I've done this entire thing with no external. Uh, entertainment. Content created. Except playing a song every once in a while. You know what? We have to go back to where we started, bro. Where is this tune? Well, oh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Oh, wait, what about this? Nah, fuck this song, dude. Put on the good shit. I don't care about no Big Jack playing anymore. La 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 Wait, okay, POV, bro, you're, um... Well, I'm sticky. Um, you, uh, get broken up with in Tucson, Arizona, bro, so you get on a goddamn bus to start a new life in Vegas, man, because you're so sad and fucked up, and you're like, well, in Vegas, I can go gamble and, like, fucking see some titties. So, and then this is a song you play on the eight-hour ride. She broke my heart, man! She broke my heart! Oh! She broke my heart! I loved her! I'm sticky. I loved her! Oh! Baby, baby, it's a wild world! Content created. Ah! Oh, I didn't even care when she shit in the toilet and didn't flush it, man. I just flush it every well, time. No I'm questions asked. Oh, oh. I'm way better than him. I'm way better than him. I'm, He's I'm, not I'm, shit, I'm, I'm, man. I'm, 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 He's nothing. You're gonna regret it. And I'm not taking you back. I'm not taking you back. I'm way better than your new man. Mm. Oh, he wears fucking. He wears skinny jeans. Not that there's anything wrong with skinny jeans. It's just like, I feel like my jeans are way better than his. Content created. The X Cat. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. Jesus broke up McDonald's and black. 
Let's smile. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild world. I always remember you. Fucking child. Wid, wid song, wid song, wid lyrical. Take good care. Nice friends out there. Content created. Beware. <laughs> Content created. Chip listens to this whenever the Lethal Company lobby ends. <laughs> no, true. <sighs> when you're done playing games with the boys and you're just all alone in the Discord by yourself. It would be really funny if they added one oncoming car into the entire eight hours. And if you hit it, the game ended. That would be so funny. Dude, the alerts are still going. Holy. I think it's going to go a little over eight hours because I pulled over twice. I think it's probably added two or three minutes. Sorry guys, we're two or three minutes behind ETA. I hope you don't mind. Okay, it's all good. Oh my god, she's Virgin yeah. McDonald's a bad good. I think the timer paused and you didn't move? Wait, really? Virgin. The notifications are so delayed. I think they're almost done though. Uh, holy fuck, it was at a hundred subs. I see the notification. Wow! Imagine you run out of gas. Oh. Great assets, great, great assets. Great assets, great, great assets. Oh my god, we are so close, dude. Guys, do you think I've, um... Do you think I've held up pretty good during this entire time? Do you think I did good, pretty good? What, what would you rate my performance out of 10? Do you think I earned my streamer right of passage? Do you think I'm allowed to be a live streamer now that I've done Desert Bus 2 and I didn't crumble? I didn't even fucking flinch, bro. I didn't even flinch, man. Do you think that I, maybe I'll finally get Twitch partner, dude? Maybe DJ Clancy will be like, well, he did do a desert bus. For those who weren't here earlier, I was saying this is how they should um, do partner applications. Instead of reaching goals, like number goals, you should have to just play desert bus for eight hours. And if you can play the entire thing, you should get Twitch partner. Oh, guys, I can't tab out. Oh, guys, I can't tab out. Stop! Stop! Okay. There's a mod here. Phew. <laughs> Wait, Ryan, did you do that? Wait, shield mode means LMAO gets held by moderators, man. That's so funny. It was Chib? Oh, okay. Thanks, Chib. Held for <laughs> reasons. Ah! They're still here, bro. Wait, maybe they're not bots. Maybe they're real chatters. Maybe they're real. Just maybe they're just real new chatters, and they're just they're just friend. They're friends. Thanks, Chibu. 
I don't know how to say thank you without sounding sarcastic in any aspect. Thank you to believe for uh, preventing the downfall of Chip Nation. Chib was asking me in DMs if she could be uh, head of the police commission in uh, Chib Nation because she said she really wants to be a cop. And I said, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> she did not say that. What the fuck? A million dental points hydration? Wow, man. Everything's happening today, bro. Everything's happening. Wait, let me get a good... Hang on. <laughs> Yo, Tony Stu, thank you. You've been saving a while, what the fuck? I even took three sips for the price of one. Throat goat? I think I got pretty good throat muscles. Hey, it says eight hours. Why the fuck are we not there, bro? Hello? Oh my god, I accidentally got the 16 hour expansion, dude. Oh, fuck. No shot, man. Wait, no, I think we're like five miles away. How much was this game? It's free. It's free. I cannot wait to pee in the toilet. Honestly, we're making quicker time than I thought. I thought I was going to be on until 7, dude. It's only 6.30. Baby, baby, yo, so loinky doink. Thank you for the brand new tier one. Driving is kind of fun. Yeah, I've had fun. I think everyone in the bus has had fun. I gotta say my goodbyes before it ends. Thank you so much, Sideshow Bob, for. The charades was a big part. That was actually, I think, after the charades, I really got a bit extra kick of energy in me. And I appreciate you being up here for the whole drive and helping out, you know. The twins. The twins, I will admit, it's kind of odd. You two are twins. And you've made out maybe 25 times during this trip. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to try question it. But, um, thank you for spending your time with me. I, I've not quite come up with a name for you yet. But I hope the K-hole that you've been in for, you know, seven of these eight hours is, come, is end, coming to an end soon. You've kind of just have a, had a vacant stare for a lot of it, and I, and I hope you're feeling all right. I hope you have a good time in Vegas. You, back there? Thank you for, um... Having VR, it's very funny to look at. And I like when you did the great assets dance. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> the awkward moment when you say goodbye to everyone and you're still in the bus for another 25 minutes, bro. I just got to pretend I can't see them. This is my stop. How is it? It's 460 something. Bro, why the fuck are we not there, dude? 
I'm actually getting pissed off, bro. You're at 357? It's the bottom one? Maybe one of these signs will uh, be be it. It will say, welcome to Vegas, bro. <laughs> They're inspecting my work, man. I went the wrong way. Fuck, imagine if I took the wrong turn. Is the drive IRL like really like this? This is what PUBG was like when it was good. Brian, I've been playing PUBG every night, dude. They've got Pachinki back, man. Game is still alive. I like talking to people in PUBG because you can tell they all smoke so much weed or cigarettes. It's fucking awesome. The other night, I literally had a notepad down of 30 questions to ask random people in PUBG. And like, it was very curated towards the player base. And one of the questions was, uh, what cigarettes do you smoke? Because people answer it. And then the other one was, what what strain do you smoke? Because one time, there was a dude on our team, and he, I'm not even kidding, he was literally 60 years old. And his, um, his, his fucking clan tag was Puffs. Or Puff? And his, his name was like, Spirit Bongs or some shit. And he was hella quiet the entire game. And then I asked him, what strain do you like? And he opened up, dude. He started talking so much. It was so cute. And then there was a 53 year old dude and his kid was yelling in the background. And I said, oh, is he playing Fortnite? And he said, nah, Valorant. But that 53 year old man scared me because he, I was worried about his safety on the internet. Cause if I asked him the right questions, I could have like hacked into his bank account. Like he was just telling me anything, bro. Like he was too open. I kind of wanted to like pull him aside and be like, dude, just be careful with what you answer, man. Oh, baby, baby. It's a wild world. First gear the entire ride. Nah, yeah, I never figured out how to change gears. I did figure out how to pin down my W key though. Cool assisted. Shh, 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 shh. Is that it? <clears throat> Is that it? High score one man eight hours and ten minutes dude Fuck yes, bro. Now he's doing a multiplayer lobby Fuck yes, man Woo! It only took uh, it wasn't even that long. How did it take eight hours and ten minutes when I've only been live for eight hours and nine minutes what? Wait, how the fuck did that happen, dude? Shit's broken, man. They added time to my sheet, dude. Yo, Cynthia, they with 100 bits. Slim Fandango, thing with the prime. Wait, the, you're telling me no one else? Oh, I'm joining a lobby. Pay us out. Oh shit, there was a prediction too, dude. I forgot there was a prediction. Ooh! Oh my god. Um... I wanted to keep playing, but the servers seem to have died. What the hell? I guess I'll end it here. I guess I'll have to end it here. The servers seem to be dead. Oh, just kidding. I can... Oh! The game crashed.
Now that we've done it once, we can join other people's games and judge the fuck out of them for how... For how far they are. We can judge the fuck out of them, dude. Oh, it's still, um... Interesting, it looks like you've just started. It seems to still be daytime. Uh, there's... Jesus, man, where are you going, bro? Where are you even going, dude? Stay on the road, man. Wait, is my mic on? Um... <laughs> I was... I'm just fucking around. Sorry, I got a bit of an adrenaline rush. I just played... I'll be quiet. Your book, you're doing your job, I'll be quiet. <clears throat> you can keep holding the gas down when you turn around, by the way. <laughs> great assets, great, great assets, bro. Chad, I don't actually think they can hear me. I think they're just watching the stream. <laughs> I think they're just watching the stream. You know, the, um, yeah, they see, there we go. The illusion's ruined. It would be so funny if it was working though. Well. The funniest moment of the stream and it wasn't even when I was driving the bus.